Hey everybody, yesterday I hosted the Super Auto Pets Invitational and I thought about posting the finals over here on YouTube, but for anyone that wasn't able to watch it yesterday, I'll just post the entire thing. For this tournament, I invited 16 players, with eight of them being streamers or YouTubers, and eight of them that are at the top of the competitive side of Super Auto Pets, with the list being shown here. Each group of eight will play to determine the top four from each side, and then we'll be placed into a bracket to see who the best Super Auto Pets player is. And not only does the winner get a cash prize if they win, but also the winner of this tournament will be the fifth person ever to gain the trophy hat. But anyways, if you like the video, like the video. Enjoy the rest of the video. And also for casting today, we have Hello Eggy and we have It's GNG. So everybody, uh, welcome them both back. I'm going to drag them in uh, here. Okay, so let's look at the first random pack. And also, with Grounded's random pack, we can now have Strawberries as well as Jerboa, which we do already have both. But there is no way to get the Apple, it seems, so the Jerboa is going to be uh, useless. <laughs> <laughs> but we do have Strawberry and Kiwi, which alone is good enough, I would say, and then the Velociraptor later on. Sorry, I'm just getting my... Everything set up. Oh, you're good. He's thinking. All right. Are you the nervous at all for this, Scooty? Uh, no, I'm just very excited. Smooth. <laughs> 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 and the uh, the people's champ already getting a first round win. That is phenomenal. Kelby's going for the strawberry strat. I like to see it. And also, yeah, the scoring for this is whoever gets out first gets uh, one point. Whoever gets out second is two points. And if they tie, if two people go out first in eighth and seventh, they both get two points. Ooh. I love the... Uh... Oh, goodness, I'm, I'm about to embarrass myself. Uh, the opossum. Okay. <laughs> two, three with... Uh, I love that, that critter. I'll take it. <laughs> That little critter right there. Gosh, damn. Do you normally say opossum instead of possum? Uh, I I just prefer the technical term. You know, mm -hmm. us Super Auto Pets pros. We never uh, mistake them. Uh-huh, I see, I see. Ooh, ox. They take ox here. Oh, yeah, they have to. I mean, they could sell. I guess they sell for the flamingo. Oh. I love the early possum. It has some I, good hits as well. Me personally, I'm keeping the, uh, I'm keeping the big opossum. You're keeping it. Yeah, I, I, you know though, I like to greed, and really hold on that sellability until there's something that's Ooh. permanent in my team. What about this? Kelby's getting the massive weasel off the <gasps> kiwi cell. I love is it. it. Is it worth scaling the weasel though? Uh, if in a, in a I think so. One, I would say yes. In a lobby, I don't know if a weasel takes you to the end i think money can yeah. get you pretty far you can buy people's love you can buy people's dubs you heard it here first folks <laughs> oh good oh. this is kelby by the way but chat pov if you guys are wondering whose pov we're watching it's always in the top uh banner right beside the turn timer and don't forget, this is the creator's bracket, so if you want to see any of them on Twitch, feel free to check them out as well. Yeah, I'm not Unless sure. Do you lose. know which of them are live at the moment, Eggie? Uh, out of the homies, I do know for sure Kelby MG is live, Cody, and Super Auto Gaming. Okay. For sure, for yeah, sure. Let's check on Suboptimal. Ooh, with the new background, too. Sheesh, festive. Repping it out. All right, so what do we want from... The tier fours on the level up. I think turtle is a necessity. Falcon's always really strong. Mm. Uh, Noob is also live. Uh, and Cotty is live. Um, so it seems like the only people that aren't live at the moment are Sub and Haps and then uh, Hog. Valorai? Oh, maybe Valorai. For tier fours, I would love to see a couple players, at least one player, rocking a tear. Just because I think in lobby, when you have the unexpected chili or one of a few chilies, you're throwing you're you're getting a lot of extra wins for free. That is true. Yeah, deer and the uh, tear tar. I think chili's really strong. 
Yeah. I think Falcon will be good because it doesn't seem like there's a ton of scaling, at least until the monkey. Mm -mm. I, I think, think currently... these early rounds, everyone's just cooking. Yeah. And currently, Sub and Kelby are the only on three. Uh-oh. Kel Kelby's already on three? Yeah. You know, in the he words does. of Kelby, he said that, I don't want to come uh, in last place. I would like to get seventh at least. <laughs> so there's a, he's probably feeling the pressure right now, because I would be. That's a big claim. Well, to be fair, for those who don't know Kelby very well, he has a thing he likes to do called his cockroach strat, where he goes down to one life, but yet reverse sweeps by some miracle. So we'll see if he can cockroach this game. Well, Kelby did get a win. He's going to level up the... Let's see, we have level ups from a lot of people. Val has a level up. Cotty has a level three mosquito. Here, let's see what Cotty's doing at the top of the leaderboard. Cotty's just rocking great stats here. Great stats, great animals. Yeah, Ox is really strong. Doesn't hit the level up, though. Hmm. I think he never take. Yeah, never take that Ox there. Ox is bait. You gotta let him go, and I hate investing too much in an animal and then selling him two turns later. I would have bought the Ox. This is why I'm not competing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think leveling up on an Ox, you're basically just getting it for the stats, because the level up doesn't really... Yeah do much no i fully agree and, and mm -hmm. you know what the worst part is is if once you buy one ox in sorry once you have a 1.5 ox it's so tempting just to go for the two right just round it out but then you're <laughs> you're chasing exactly you, know, you don't want to give up, up on it then <laughs> exactly you, you've given yourself hope you gotta never back down never what never give up <laughs> never give up two ox <laughs> haps is still holding on to the kiwis i guess they're trying to get a tier four off of oh, that level man. up. So I guess we'll see what they have. Mega greed from Haps. Spicy. Here's the here's the tar. Let's the let's. Year? I did not he know that. Baby. That's yeah. exciting. He's fighting for his his whole family here. Oh God, <laughs> he's got more have... on the table than anyone else does. So if that's on a warrior spirit. Uh oh, suboptimal and sag both on two. Haps survives. Gets the dragonfly. He's at the top of the board. Noob. Cotty still at five. Cotty at the very top. Sheesh. Gavin eating those words. <laughs> Cotty's going to win this out of spite. He's a fun <laughs> half Andy. <laughs> you got to give him the hater fuel. The hater aid fuels his wins. <laughs> That's right. Let's see. Sag does not want to get rid of the Kiwi just yet. Has decent stats. I think... I don't think Sag's out just yet. Oh, I don't think you can count any of these players out. Even on two lives, I think there's enough wiggle room in there for them to pivot. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, when you have players this experienced, you know the lines. They know they're out, and they can identify them quickly. So they're never backing themselves into a corner, which is great. That is true. I do think that's where the random pack will come into play, though. Because I think knowing yes. your outs is much more difficult in random packs. But maybe Absolutely. Sag, the random pack champ, will know how to get out of this. I hope he does. Experience does play a big role, but I am also curious of the competitors who are currently live streaming right now. I wonder how many of them are going to get baited by doing something cool for the views. You know what I mean? <laughs> cool. Who do you think is most susceptible to throw for views? <laughs> oh, absolutely, Kelby. <laughs> Sorry, Kelby. I throw for views all the time. Let's see. Cotty's been knocked out or knocked down from five. Everybody's still in. A lot of people at two. We have three yeah, people at two. Kind of sucks. What is that? A to Z. <laughs> embarrassing. Out every round. Yeah. Take Thanks, guys. Out. I'm gonna make that joke every single time. Oh, I that actually. I think it. cheese is really, really strong. I really like cheese here. I think cheese people won't well be expecting like it. Surprise. Exactly. Yeah, I think cheese, eggplant. And steak are things to be looking for as far as the held food goes. Tomato could also be good in two oh, packs that have, like, if anyone decides to go German Shepherd, but it seems like it's scaling it would be difficult. I think it's mm -hmm. going to end up Velociraptor. I'm thinking we're going to see a strawberry or two. Oh, also, Gavin, for the next round, if you want to do a prediction, or Luisa, if you want to do a prediction, you are welcome to. Do you think anyone? Do you think anyone goes for the Jerboa without the apple for the content? <laughs> you know, yeah. um, 
Paps actually sent me a message, and one of their fun facts was that they've never bought a Jerboa in all of their time playing the game. Not even one. They Who has? Really? Haps. Oh. They sent me proof. They have zero Jerboas bought on their account. Yo. Haps, if so you... I would love to see Haps buy it today. Yeah, message Haps. Say if they buy it, I'll give them an extra point in the standing. <laughs> I've never bought a cookie. That's the only thing I've never bought. For real? The cookie, yeah, it's out of principle. Oh, I see now. Hmm. What's the principle? Uh, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, the pit, the wolf was really strong there from Val. Anybody on one yet? Ooh, all right, we need to go to Haps. Any Haps viewers in chat? Haps is a YouTube streamer though, right? I don't think Haps streams. I think Haps just a... Ooh. They do? Oh, okay. I normally just watch their YouTube videos. They do oh, yeah, stream on yeah. YouTube. Any Haps viewers? Haps love? Did I? Sorry. Looking in the chat, I see two Haps going on. Three Haps. Mm -hmm. There's some Hapers. <laughs> yeah, here is so positive. Someone here said. is the question. The People's Aww. Champ at the top right now with three hearts. Yo. Um. Okay. Crazy thought is the People's Champs, their lines that they were playing read to me so much like uh like a viewer lobby player like nothing too out of the ordinary mm -hmm. which also means that they might get predictable i'm a little nervous to see where it goes in the end game i think if a pack just so happens to have hog and mushroom they can't be stopped they can <laughs> <laughs> wow i'm loving the beta fish i do uh, really gold. like the beta fish and then they get the tier six off this so much greed though so much. Drom is an inherently greedy animal, and they're greeding for levels. I always support the Drom, though. Drom, I, I Drom this late is only for Drom stats, though. Yeah. I don't love Drom in lobbies. I feel like you lose too much tempo. That is fair. It is much better in uh, eight-person lobbies than 1v1s, though. Let's see. Really? Can Hap survive against Kadi? The Crane is really the strong, though. Oh, that was a great oh. trade. Oh. Ooh, Hap stays oh. alive. Hap clutches it up. Yo, great break points there. Anybody still haps? Everybody is on all so close life. Five people on two, two on three, and then haps on one. Velociraptor, Velociraptor into strawberry. Oh. Are you kidding me? Haps has to do it. Oh, yeah. That's oh, so good. It. That's so good. I would like to see a freeze cheese here. Cheese on giraffe could be really strong or on the dromedary. Or they just roll to try and level up beta fish or. Oh, they do go for the cheese. Oh. Mm. Another draw. <laughs> okay, hot take. It's is crocodile good here? Sell giraffe croc. Yeah, sell giraffe croc. Crocodile. Agree. It'd be really good against Val. Misses out on two pigs. Yeah, Kelby cooks Kelby. Really good against Subbo as well. Not that mm -hmm. great against the bottom three. The dragonflies doesn't really do too much. Yeah, oh, I get something. I guess it's if Haps is trying to get first or just try and not lose immediately i think this is the right play mm. really i think croc is is not lose immediately that's what that's what i'm saying i think oh okay, okay okay yeah the giraffe would scale and potentially be even stronger but i think they can't risk that this round yeah Especially i agree they're lethal. and they just hit their power spike so you now that you're riding high oh See how it goes. Let's see, the coconut was great. The cheese Amazing is really trades. strong. Oh, I think Haps is out. Oh, no. Haps is the first person out. Three people on one, though. Oh, seven. Yeah, so the first person out, chat. Oh, sevens for Haps. Christ. Hate to see it. Anyways, here's Super Auto Gaming. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to Keep someone else on, on Lethal. Oh, Cotty has dropped far from being the first place on the leaderboard to Cotty's a lethal ending. to the cat, though. Mm. Also, are all the, all the volumes even? People were saying the volumes weren't good. I tried to boost you guys I up. Think, yeah, I think we're a little quieter, but I turned my mic up on my end. Oh, well, I, 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 just, I, just, I just boosted you, so you may be good. <laughs> oh, okay. Thanks. Now, chat, even though Haps is out, it's not over for Haps. Uh, there's still two more rounds after this. Mm -hmm. True, it's not Jover till it's Jover. It does Jover suck that Jover. Sap... Uh, or Haps does not tie with anyone. So Haps does alone get last place Sash. with one point. Because here, if 
Cotty, Subbo, and Hog all go out at the same time, they would all get fifth. You should make him split the fifth points instead. Divide <laughs> <laughs> by three. All right, you pull out your calculator. You take care of that. <laughs> I'm surprised that Cotty is still holding on to an 11, uh, 1811 beta fish. I think. Like, I feel like you're two in at that point. Yeah, I think the bell pepper's really strong, and 18 attack is a lot. I think the crane's going to get mm -hmm. Cotty, though. The crane will be great for Cotty if it stays alive. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at this tech. Break that pepper. Oh. Ooh, close. Oh. Does get the melon to protect from the cheese. Nice. Ooh, but Big the melons. Okay, trade. It's close. Uh. Oh, that's it. Oh, it's a draw. No. Uh. Anybody I'm else sweating. out? Nobody else is Tell out. Me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so close. Wow. Poor Haps. I thought Haps was going to survive with this. Oh, I didn't know there was Mongoose in this pack. Kelby with the Kelby's peanut. The only, yeah, only one with the toy. I think that'll definitely play a big part. I respect Val for going uh, OG with bison the bison. And mm -hmm. <laughs> bison and If it ain't broke. Know. Hey, Val's got a Velociraptor, no strawberry. No, there's strawberry on the mosquito. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotta use the mind. Velociraptor Gavin. does seem good. Cotty's going double. Ooh, Pepper with Crane is really strong as well. I really like this. I, I think it's very precarious. Mm -hmm. I see one mosquito ruining his day, but he's also got a mosquito. Well, let's see. The only mosquito to deal with is Val. It is level three, though. Only mosquito to deal with is Val. Um, Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because the crocs, yeah, the right crocs will be hitting the back line. Some turtles here are going to prove to be difficult against to deal with in general. I think so as well. Mm -hmm. I'm just so nervous here. This is a big round, chat. It is. There's three people on one. Oh, oh there's a turtle. A turtle as Bad croc, it. though. Bad croc. Stays alive. So much value here. Uh oh. Oh, I think Cotty took this one. Hog is out. So much but is value. anyone else out? Kelby and Kelby. Hog tie for sixth. The two for. <laughs> wow, this team is actually very much cooking. This is a very, very good team. He's got a little bit of a weak one on the front crane with 9 2, you know, a little susceptible to splash damage. Mm. I like the cheese here. Yeah. Good call. Oh, Valorai is going double on the coconut. Valorai is just doing anything that he can, can do to survive. Valorai? That is hilarious. I guess a little fa fun fact. Uh, Val told me that he's taking the Jesus take the wheel approach. Homie has not touched sap since the first week of August, and so what we're seeing is some classic knowledge being pulled out of his uh, out of his brain. I right will now. say the, the Bison Strat <laughs> is classic old school knowledge. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> But if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Exactly. I would never turn down a, a turn five bison when I got level threes. I think, never. I think of these players in this lobby, I think Cotty and Noob probably have spent the most time playing since Ranked has come out. Mm -hmm. I think they've been grinding. Sag has been grinding yeah. a ton as well. Sag is number one on customs and weekly, or maybe number two. I think Kyogre may have overtaken him. Ooh, spicy. I think I have seen Cotty uh, reach above 1,800. I'm not sure on what pack and stuff, but yeah, he is a gamer. Cotty has been... Cotty and Noob have been playing a ton of the standard pack, and then Sag has been playing a ton of both of the others. Mm. Let's see if uh -oh. Val can stay alive. The coconuts will be large, but will it be good enough? I don't think it's good enough against Sag. Oh, oh no. No, Sag's team is, is way perishing. too strong. Sag's team All right. is looking yeah. crazy. Who has been dropped out? It has been just Sub. Is sub. sub is the only... Oh, Sub Val's and Val. Out. Sub and Val. No, Valorai, my Valor guy. How could you do this? All right. Sub and Val tie for fourth place. Ooh, I do like the Mantis Shrimp from Cotty. Cotty's team is looking very, very scary. The three bell peppers, crane on the mosquito and the cheese and the scaling from the dragonfly. Sag does I'm have a ton of cat. stats from the cat. Noob yep. is getting a ton of scaling from the ostrich as well. And the TV pops this turn. Oh, Noob might be on. So if, yeah. if you don't take Noob out now, I don't know if you're taking Noob out. The ostrich is getting really, really big. 
Yeah, and that's a very wide team, too. Look at those. It's so even. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of surprised so many people have kept Giraffe, especially in the top three. Mm -hmm. I think there wasn't really any good... I guess there is Dragonfly, but Giraffe mm -hmm. is just consistent. Keep stats going oh, for a long time. We can see a two elimination here, actually. Cody and... Um, uh, noob skills both out and sag being the low uh yeah, winning sag, right here. Sag could take them both out. <laughs> Let's see. I love the mantis shrimp though. It breaks anything that has pepper just like this. Does that kill that ox? No. Let's see. And then oh, the, the melon. Me oh. Huge. Oh, but wasted. Wait. Cody oh. beats sag and then. Who Noob was skills is out. Noob skills is out. Noob gets third. Let's go, Cody. Cody versus Sag. Cody, I will give props, has the most more interesting team between the two. Objectively. So oh, he for gets sure. more content sure. points. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sag is just going for cat. Is there cupcake yeah. or anything big? Pizza and tacos, I think, are the best thing that Sag can go for with the cat. Mm. And Cody is oh. maybe thinking about getting rid of Dragonfly to tiger yep. something? 100% you're tigering here. He, it, I, I don't see a world where you don't. I think tiger and tomato could be good because using the cheese means you're drawing, but the tomato could win with the tiger. And let's she, see, okay. Oh, he sold it. Crane is gone. Is it tiger with tomato? Why is he, wait. It is tiger with tomato. He's giving up his pepper. It, it do, do, doesn't, um... Sag have a tomato? Sag has a strawberry from the giraffe. Strawberry. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> the other red fruit. <laughs> I, I'm really at a loss here, guys. <laughs> I, I love seeing Gavin continuously confuse all the foods. I go, to the, I go to the store to buy veggies. I'm like, what the hell's going on? <laughs> but Gavin, Sag, come back? Sag can buy a tomato. Maybe you're just, you're thinking too sets I've seen ahead. the future. Yeah, tomato mm. is incoming. Manifesting. Big tomato energy. Oh. Ooh. Potato. Still dies. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good thought. Oh my gosh. I don't the know. Flash there is brutal. I don't know. This is close. What, is, what a spawn. The crane will uh -oh. one shot the ox, though. And then yeah. it's tie. And then <gasps> it had. Yeah. No, Cody wins. Cody wins. What do you mean, no? Ooh, round of <laughs> I was Sorry, saying I was, they were wrong. Wrong. My math was slow. <laughs> Your brain is slow, Unreal. too. God, why are you coming after me? <laughs> <laughs> All oh, right. Oh, that was so good. What a great first game. That was fantastic. Holy smokes. Right. Cat, round of applause for Cody. Round so one bad. winner. <laughs> now, if there's a mod around, if you can run a prediction, does Cody go back to back? That would be cool. All right, let's tally up the points. Cody in first gets eight points. Sag gets seven. Uh, Noob has the solo third place, gets six points. Tied for fourth was Sub and Val with five points. That top four is uh, really where you want to be at at a minimum. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then let's see. Tied for six was Kelby and Hog. So they get mm -hmm. three the points champ? apiece. Yes. Three points, and then sadly, Haps only has one point. But they could have nine next round. Dad, exactly, don't worry. exactly. <laughs> All right, let's see. I can here. I can show the standings. They are not ordered by highest to lowest, but there's only eight people, so you can figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> wow, we. <laughs> Yo, this tournament's kind of scuffed, <laughs> no. To be fair, doing a tournament's a lot of work. You guys don't realize how much graphic design is my passion goes into it. <laughs> oh. All right, and I will set up the next one. And Gavin, if you want, uh, you can set up a prediction if you want. I don't know if I have Gamba permissions on your stream. Let's see. You should. All right, yeah, if I, I let me see if I can. That'd be awesome. I assume so the we can get a real good. fat prediction. Mod view. I'm not used to seeing this from uh, the mod side, you know? <laughs> Partnered streamer. <and> <laughs> streamer privilege. Did I tell you guys? I didn't know how to do the shout out commands because I've never done it before. My mods have always done it for me. I've been babied. <laughs> it's because you hate shouting at other people, even though they support you. It's messed up, Eggy. Well, okay, the pie is big to enough to share. It? Why are you trying to get it twisted like this? 
does Cody win back to back? That's the prediction, not just eight win options. Again. No, that's a lot of that's a lot. Make of... it nice and fat. <laughs> <laughs> and, and he won the last one. Cody did win the last one. It would have been anyone. All right. New code going up to uh, group one. Chat, who are you guys cheering on in the tourney? What brings you out today? Who do you have sweeping it and take, taking the whole thing? I've seen lots of familiar names, but lots of names that I recognize from other streamers chat coming here for the first time. And tons of first time chatters. Also, one thing to note is the seeding from these rounds, the number one seed from this group will play the number four seed from the following group. Mm. So if you get last in this group, the content creator group, you will be facing the number one seed from the pro side in the first round. Oh, no. <laughs> what the hell? I'm so scared. I'm just shaking in my boots, man. So you, you just make it in by the skin of your teeth. You're like sweating profusely, <laughs> only to get beat on harder by the number one seed. The studio said if you want to live, you better show me you got the right to live. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But I will say the first round in the top eight of the 1v1s is a best of one. So if there's a time to knock out the number one pro, uh, that's the time. Oh, that's so awesome. And it seems like with chat, a lot of people are rooting for Kyogre on the pro side. Kyogre is a popular some... name. I'm right. seeing some... Cody, I'm seeing. There is one Let's more see. person. I don't know who we're waiting on for the one more person. One, two, three, Chat, how's the uh, playback seven. speed, by the way? You guys, uh, the speed's okay? We got to iron out the wrinkles now, right? Let's who see. Oh, uh, Kelby. Kelbs, I Kelby. Let me go yell at him. <laughs> Kelby is a... Uh, Beat down after the uh, sixth place last round. Chat, if you guys want to be able to look at the brackets or look at any information, it's going to be in Scooty's Discord. So exclamation mark Discord, go check it out. I'm sure it's in there. Is it in there, Scooty? Hey, I'm just... hey come on, man. <laughs> come on, you didn't put it in the Discord, man? Oh, my come goodness. On, okay. Uh, <laughs> you're slamming in the Discord. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Here, here. This is a, this is the, the pros are on the right side. Here, this is the screen for the all the players competing. I saw on Twitter, Scooty, because, you know, I'm a supportive homie, unlike thank Gavin, you, who follows you. people on multiple platforms. And I saw a few comments saying that they didn't even know that there was a pro scene in Super Auto Pets, which I found very interesting. <laughs> I would say the pro scene is not very public. So mm. I, I think, yeah, I think people that because it's not really posted on YouTube from what I've seen. And mm. me personally, I wouldn't go telling people I'm a pro at Super Auto Pets. I, I think that just opens you up. Would you tell people you're a super auto pet streamer? <laughs> Let's get real here. I wouldn't tell people I'm a streamer. You don't? <laughs> <laughs> All right. We are back into it. Let's see. Here we go. All right. Well, I guess we'll look at the reigning champ, Cody, to start off. Maybe. How's the pack looking? Uh, let's see. We have... Some jelly people, levels? Yeah, we do have cell? jelly levels. Cappy? Mantis? Mm. Oh, someone do something Camel. with the mantis. Oh, mantis oh Mantis shark. So, uh, two days ago when we were doing the tournament for the viewers, there were two lobbies where they were praying mantis as well as shark, and Sag mm -hmm. and Cotty both said that is 100% the way to go. Mm -hmm. so, mm, so they know. One of them two, I am expecting to go mantis shark if they find it. Mantis Shark feels like when I see someone pull it off, I think to myself that no one is balancing Super Auto Pets. <laughs> like, this has been overlooked and there's no stopping it. It is insane. You get 50 50 in probably like, what, four turns if you're playing really, really smart? It mm -hmm. is really strong. I think that the double stats from the Shark is, is too much from in shop. Mm hmm. Someone said, I keep searching YouTube for Kyogre, but I just keep seeing Pokemon. <laughs> 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 That's so cute. <laughs> <Wait>. <laughs> oh 
No, Kyogre, I don't think produces any type of content. No YouTube, no Twitch. They're just an undercover gamer, you know? Kyogre is just a gamer. Actually, Kyogre... If you type in Kyogre Sexy on Google Images. That's all made by the same Kyogre. <laughs> please don't. Oh, please no. don't. Please don't look yeah. that up. Don't look that up. <laughs> He's trying to save his stream. <laughs> Gavin, you can't say that in front of like 500 people. Someone's going to look it up. <laughs> Better they do it than we do it. No, uh-uh. I'm a say so streamer. Oh. I ain't looking at that. <laughs> Oh, what a good, what a good tie for uh, Kelby there, honestly. Hmm. Let's see. Who is down to three? So they get a heart back. Val and Haps go back up to four. Haps can't be risking the uh, the three hearts. Haps oh, with Haps the on uh, three hearts already. Two rounds. Haps loses. Went for the uh, frilled dragon. Didn't find enough faints, I guess. I guess Val is Val's in the same boat. Sag. It's okay. We believe. Double Meerkat. Cody also supports the Meerkat, so let's see if he actually goes for it. I think Meerkat is a really strong tempo play. I must be the odd man out here. I I never buy Meerkat. Meerkat me either. Never it can, entices me. It can give me. tempo from attack. Because here it'll give six attack total, which is pretty decent. I think I see. But Cody yeah, does I've like the Cody dodo. dodo. Cody likes the dodo, and Cody likes the rabbit. The rabbit is here. But there's not a ton. I guess there are a decent amount of fed foods. So let's go solid. check in on. Uh, let's go check in on Haps. Let's see if Haps can stay alive here. Haps, Haps, Haps. Oh, jellyfish. Jellyfish is I'm good. The jellyfish ferret. I'm loving that. Or what is that? Ferret. It's a weasel. Weasel. <laughs> My God. Right, 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 right. <laughs> <laughs> the important part is it's on his team doing a little bit of a mirror matchup against Cody, the person we were just spectating. I think Haps gets this one pretty easily. Oh, Haps has got it. The Frilled mm -hmm. Dragon is strong. cody has got Dodo on the way, though. We'll see if it sticks. And, and in this household, in the words of Cody, we take Rabbit. So we'll see if he gets one. Cody does take Rabbit. But Cody has been saying that they, or he uh, has realized that the Rabbit isn't actually as great as he wants it to be. <laughs> He's his ways? No. <laughs> The doorhead ant, I think, is really strong as well. Mm. Doorhead ant is the most infuriating animal Team with Games ever put in the game. Does Why? Hats what take... gives you that vibe? You're looking at it, you're like, it's unassuming, and then bang. All of a sudden, it's got like 5 HP, but 40 health, and it doesn't stop. You just keep smacking into it. I mean, it's pretty, gay. it's pretty great in early game because not a lot of people have scaled up just yet. So if you got a big doorhead, you can just smash your way through anyone. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm saying. It's it's infuriating because I'm no, never the guy with the door head. See, I'm the girl with the door head all the time because I don't know how to play the game. So I said, <laughs> when in doubt, door head it out. <laughs> I think the play is definitely... I think whoever has the Dodo or the Shark Mantis is going to win. Dodo has way too many good things to hit late rounds. There's the mm. Fire Ant, the Lionfish, the Cobra, the Warthog, the German Shepherd. So many things that work off attack. I think the Dodo is going to be really tough to beat. Oh, Especially with the 10-1 the dodo? dodo from Subbo. <laughs> Tell me you like shrimp. <laughs> Ooh, does not get Oof. it done. But Haps is taking Haps out some around. of the Dodo players, yeah. And then Haps Apparently, uh, I've heard from inside sources that Super Auto Gaming is also cooking. Super Auto Gaming is... They might have something. Cooking. Super Auto Gaming is going the yak. The yes. the random pack gamer shows everyone how it's done. Everyone in my stream hates me going yak. They're like, "Egg, it's such a risky move." But I'm like, "No, this is the way." And look, guys, Super Auto Gaming themselves at the top of the ladder is doing it. This yak, is how you play yak. Yak Silk Moth is a combo. It's gaining plus uh. Plus one, plus one a turn. <laughs> it's gaining so much sass. <laughs> Tima, please balance your game. Please. <laughs> Zach does have a dodo. And Tropical Fish. There is scaling. Five, five hearts, so there, clearly yes. is working. The People's Champ at five going for the Hercules Beetle. Ooh. People that aren't afraid to... Uh, Go off the grain or still different. at five. Exactly. Off meta. I see noob skills with a double toad. So maybe a big switcheroo is in our future, potentially. Ooh, yes. The level up sell. A lot of jellyfish players, but there aren't any ways to get it leveled up. Uh, so they mm -hmm. just have to get lucky. 
I, I think jellyfish is a little bit of bait here, especially who are we spec haps here. Yeah. I, I think going for a two jellyfish for haps is a little bit late. <gasps> Let's see if the yak can get it done. Oh, bad door, door head trade. Let's do it. What a, a good draw. tie. An amazing tie. Good tie. All right, we need. That ooh. is awesome. Cody is about to go first to last. Uh -oh. Cody on two. Val is going for the yak as well. Okay, we need to watch Val. Whoa, instead. seven sixteen on Val. <laughs> That's a big yak. That is a big yak. Yeah. He's yakking it up. Honestly, I know they're not winning, but my favorite teams currently are the bottom two teams because they're the animals I love using the most. The yak and the camel. I am such a camel gamer, and I don't care what anyone says. Oh, camel is the way. I hate the camel. <laughs> you think camels no. taste good? I don't know. I feel like they'd be pretty dry, right? Because all the water is contained in the humps, but not distributed what through if the you, rest of the camel. What if it was like roasted hump? Just the hump, but then yeah. it's like getting a bladder, like a water balloon, because it's just holding liquid. It That's ain't fair. meaty. Hmm. Is that actually how it works? I don't know. Let me Google. <laughs> I got this for you all. Animal fun facts. I, I think a camel will be closer to horse than beef. Gavin, do you have any fun facts of any of the people currently competing at the moment? Yes. Uh, unfortunately, Kelby is uh, unapologetically British. Oh, yeah. Was that information given to you by Kelby, or was that one that you came up with on your own? Uh, provided by Kelby. Okay. But uh, outside of that, I'm trying to think here. Let me see. I've got a fact sheet on all the players, guys. I've all got all this Super Auto Pets goss. Ooh, the, the goss? yak from Val. Yeah. <laughs> that is a very large yak. <laughs> and the mantis is getting strong. If Val can level up the weasel here and get a shark... I think that'll be probably best case scenario. Still statting up the yak, though. I guess because the yak is going to continuously hurt itself. Is Cotty down to one? Cotty is down to one heart. This could really shake things up. If Cotty goes first to last, then there's not really anyone that's standing far on the leaderboard. Mm. Whoa, this is like a, an anime uh, storyline. <laughs> The guy who won first round bottoms out in the next one. But then brings it back. The eight points, brings I think. It back. I think if Cotty can I stay alive a little bit, the eight points can keep Cotty in top four, hopefully. But last place would keep things very, very close. The Nial is very what? strong from uh wait, from what the mantis? mantis gonna eat. I think the mantis eats the weasel. I think it has no, to eat the weasel the here. Mantis is He's eating, eating the Niala. Oh, I think. Oh no! I think if the mantis eats the weasel, you get the two gold the following turn. Why would you sacrifice your Niala? It's so good. Yeah, Niala is very strong. Very good Early tempo. Early Niala too. It's turn seven. Valorai does not care. <laughs> he only wants money. I heard he these were endangered, and I didn't ask. <laughs> <laughs> but Valorai does have the chef hat, so Valorai is cooking up something that no one understands. Certified five-star Michelin out here. Haps gets or, the mantis shark. Oh god, mantis par or sorry, shark parrot too. Oh, <gasps> but and he survived. Is Cody out? Cody is still alive. <sighs> Good on Cody. I think Haps might take this. So Haps got a tie on that too. That's so good. I think in this situation, if you're Haps, you have three hearts. I think you start praying mantising uh, two units instead of one. Mm -hmm. I think it just turbocharges your shark, and no one can do anything against it. I love that idea. That is so risky, but it's so good. Bigger numbers, better person. Yeah, the shark will get really, really strong. And are there, let's see, are there good things for the mantis to be destroying? Fire ant is decent. Slug, you still get money from it. Deer, mm -hmm. you get money off the bus. Mammoth is really strong late game to hit. Yeah, mammoth off the... Praying Mantis or Warthog. Do you see anyone here going Lioness? I don't think um, so. There's well, no one I know who light. commonly takes it's, it. I don't see anyone doing that. I think the Dodo players are going to try and oh, go Lionfish. Go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then the Mantis Shark players. There are three people with Mantis, but Haps hit the Shark, which is huge. Question That's is all if, the difference. Oh, it yeah. depends if he uses it efficiently, though, to scale up fast enough before someone else mm. pulls Shark. I really want to see Haps yep. hitting two things. <laughs> yes, there is very bad equipment in this pack as well. So Lynx could be really strong with the snipes. 
as well as maybe Poison Dart Frog with the Slug. Probably not a great combo, though. Man, Poison Dart Frog Slug was, like, the scariest time to play the test patch. <laughs> Let's see. When Does they first Cotty introduced that, no one knew. Oh, yeah, that's a tie. The that's poison... such a big weasel. <laughs> that's a huge weasel. Let's see. Subbo and Cotty are now at one. Let's see who's at the top right now. The people's, it's champ the people's champ in first place. That team doesn't look that strong, though. <laughs> well, they, they did lose last round. They were at five hearts. Okay, okay. Um, so they're cooking something, hopefully. We'll see what they but, pivot. The, yeah, the, I, the, I mean, the double bus does keep you alive for a long time. All right, let's see how the reigning champ uh, does this round. Niala is a great hit. Do they get level two Niala? Oh, I do not. One, oh. Yikes. Hear me out. I'm rolling one more time, selling Weasel, buying Niala if I see it. And Sag and New both going Rabbit. Noob could have something. Noob hits two level ups here. So we'll have to see what Noob hits. I'm rooting for Noob because I want to see that Lynx do really well. Yeah. And then Hap's I still only Lynx. hitting one unit. Hmm. Not a huge fan of that. Also, due to this being Grounded's random packs, the chocolate is not guaranteed. Is chocolate guaranteed in normal shuffle? Mm hmm. I did really? not know that. Yeah, the I don't the, think so, Eggy. Or, sorry, uh, Scoots. I'm pretty sure the, they use the random for the weekly. So they prevent strawberries, they guarantee chocolate. Maybe the chocolate's for weekly specific. Interesting. But I know in the randoms, they prevent strawberries and. Wow, what a trade there. I the think Cotty you know. survives this. Yeah, more you know. Cotty definitely I think Ooh, he wins. wins. <gasps> Let's go! Camel power. I'm so happy to see a level two camel on the board. The amount of serotonin I have right now is unmatched. <laughs> oh, Grounded said it's guaranteed in normal. It's not guaranteed in normal shuffle, but it's guaranteed in weekly. Okay. Mm. Does Cotty go for the Warthog here over the Fire Ant? I think you have to. Even if you yeah. don't keep it, you can sell the Fire Ant, buy, sell the Blue Ring, and then get Warthog. Yep. And then you can and maybe he's not invested something. in that fire ante. Oh, not at all. Mm -mm. He's tiny. Did anyone drop out? Did Subbo lose? Sub is still in. He's hanging in here. Subbo with a uh, German Shepherd too. The only one on. Oh no, Kelby's got one. Yeah, but Kelby's using the uh, Mantis on it. Ah. Uh. Haps is getting a large shark. Haps is once again uh, Mantising a. <laughs> <laughs> a Niala. <laughs> so interesting is mushrooming they hog still didn't pivot. And that was their pivot turn. Yeah, I think they're just They took another loss. They're hoping they could just try and I mean the early hearts is good. Even if they fall off, they probably still beat a decent amount of people. Just because they have three hearts. Because someone will probably mm -hmm. lose within the next two rounds. Sometimes you're just fighting to survive and not even win the whole thing. And with the point system, it could pay off. And, and even now, they're still not going to sell and cash out because it's turn 10. You might as well wait one more. Mm -hmm. So they're going to go to two hearts for sure. Well, let's see. Oh, here they are. Oh, big bus time. The bus is good. Oh, my goodness. Are they not going to... Uh... They do no draw. punish? They draw. <gasps> Su oh. Sub oh. and Valorai have been dropped out. Oh, no. oh sevens for suboptimal and Val. I didn't even see Val was in last. Around one heart. Yeah. Incredible round for um, uh, the people's champ. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. and Cotty for staying alive. Staying alive that one round pushes Cotty into guaranteed sixth place. Could have tied. Yeah, that said though, Cotty should have. I think Cotty's team needs to win these rounds because this is not going late. Also, he's got a big pivot ahead of him. I think Cotty needs to be using the camel on the Niala. He's if if winning, Cotty isn't getting any value off this weasel. Mm. Yep. Which I guess the stats are more important. Fantastic shoe bill for no strawberries. <laughs> okay, Cotty and Kelby are... Co I think that's a very late shark for Kelby. I don't know if you can go it. Even if they're double um, sniping with the Mantis, do you think the shark is worth the keep? Maybe, maybe not on one heart. Mm. I think the true team to look at here what? is the Komodo Dragon from Noob. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that team does not need order. That's no, what's all. It's that just team big. is strong. Yeah, that team is very good. Yep. <laughs> he's buying food in the shop, and he's 
hit, hit and go next. And Sags, Dodo, German Shepherd, Slug. Could be really good. Unless uh, unless they go against the Lynx team. But Cody is against the Lynx. Team. Ooh, and the Warthog gets hit. And I think that might, might do it for Cody. Yeah, oh, 07s for Cody. And Kelby is out as well. 07s for Kelby. Like father, like son, they go down together. <laughs> <laughs> so Cody and Kelby tie for fifth place. Interesting that all the top three are at three lives, and the People's Choice is honestly doing super duper well against all these content creators. Well, yeah. how many rounds did you make them play in Scooty? Uh, it was a round of eight. Like eight person lobby, the first person went on to a 1v1, and then the 1v1 was best of three. Hey. Oh, okay. So it was two eight person lobbies. Yes, and then a best of okay. three 1v1. So you didn't get some like random person correct this is a player who knows and there were some pretty there own. were some pretty decent decent people in the lobbies as well wow yeah if haps can bring i think haps can bring this back haps now has scaling from an ostrich is going to continue scaling the shark the only thing is once you get into the late rounds it's very easy to predict what haps is going to do with their team because the mm. Mantis has to be in the front or the back for the most part. So it's very easy to play around. And Sag is hopefully going for the level 2 German Shepherd. Still going for fast. stats. Stats on the German Shepherd over stats on the Dodo. Doesn't make too much oh sense if you're keeping it forever. Yep. Agreed. Also, the, the, the time, I don't think that Sag was actually pressed for time. I think it's just spectate mode. Uh, okay, okay. Yeah. Almost the level 3 links from Noob. Noob's oh, team... Oh, this is going to be horrible. The German Shepherd stays alive, though, which I think is the only thing you can ask for. They probably still lose. Sag is Ooh. out. Ambitious team. Oh, that was. Was it only Sag. Sag that round? It was only Sag. Everybody else was on three hearts. Top four, though, for Sag. Great showing. Consistent. Mm -hmm. uh, second and a fourth now? That's really good. That's actually great for the points. That is really good. Haps really needs to bring this back. Noob. I really think Noob might win. And it also really sucks for Sag, because I think if Sag didn't go against Noob, probably could have stayed alive another round. I think the Lynx was really yep. strong. Mm -hmm. Yep, agreed. And yeah, scaling here Mushroom. does seem very difficult, which is why Haps and Noob seem to be really strong. Scaling off both of these and then scaling off of the Rabbit. And then if Noob yep. gets a level 2 Komodo, that could be a lot as well. I love a Komodo. So much fun, so chaotic and hectic. Especially when your team doesn't care about it. Exactly. What if Haps really got bad. a Komodo? <laughs> Yo! <laughs> <And> just, <laughs> like Russian roulette out just there. Just let things play yeah, Exactly. Out. I think Hog made a good pivot here. Um, I think it's too susceptible to snipes. Yes, the Lynx mm -hmm. is really strong here. Yep, and these are not big, fat, rabbit-built team. This is not a rabbit-built team, so you're really yeah. going to be hurting for HP. I think if Hog yeah, can level like 3 this Fire Ant... And level up oh. some of these. Because if the Cobra gets a ton of attack, it's hitting off the deer, the bus, and the golden. Yeah, great point there. But oh, here comes it goes the against the Lynx. And the the Cobra oh. is dead. <laughs> the team is gone. Yeah, Where the did team it go? Is gone. <laughs> Hog is down to one. And Haps goes down to two. So Noob seems to be winning. N Noob is running away here. Noob is also seeming to be the chat's favorite. A lot of people saying, you know, Noob just always wins. Noob is a gamer. Any noob enjoyers in chat? <laughs> That's so weird. Why? <laughs> what? <laughs> the vibe is just, I don't know. <laughs> You're crazy. I, I didn't hear anything like that, huh? Noob enjoyers, really? stand up. Don't be shamed. Do chatters even have legs? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Hog does not hit the level ups. Wow. But hopefully not, Hog goes against Haps and maybe stands a chance. Hog has to go against Haps. Haps has a lot mm. of chili, though. <laughs> well, Hog could go against uh, Noob's uh, clone. Okay, so the Cobra chili? stays alive. But Here the chili, the chili's going to kill it. Yeah. But the 24? shark is too big. Oh, oh a huge no. Shark. Haps, incredible performance here. Hog gets third place. Still pretty good. That's a decent amount of points. They did, yes. what, third and fifth? Uh, I believe fifth? so, yeah. Tied for fifth. Like 
Oh sevens, everyone. Oh sevens, oh sevens. for our fallen soldiers. Great showing, though. Still awesome points on the board. Half and this is just a huge team. Yeah, what this do you is. Do here if you're you, cops? There's the level two lionfish as well. Oh. Jellyfish gets even larger. You just start. I think here you just buy food. The held food you can only get is fortune cookie, chili, or pie. Mm -hmm. Which I think is fine. Yeah, level two lionfish, level three lynx. I think it's too much. Yeah, this is an absolute, like, juiced team. And I'm not sure exactly how they got here. I would say it was, like, the early rabbit. Yeah, the early rabbit did a lot. Some good level ups on rabbit, the jellyfish. Rabbit with yeah. taco kind of evens out. Yep. <laughs> I will say, I mean, Haps has, if oh, Haps level 2 ostriches this turn, level 3 jelly, there is some scaling, but I think I think the utility from the lionfish and lynx are just too much. Mm -hmm. And Haps mm -hmm. is does have two lives, so this is not their final form. Oh. <gasps> Which is maybe a good thing. Oh, big shark, Wait. but... Wait, did Haps not... not was Haps... Was there a fourth unit for Haps, or did the Lynx kill it? There was no There was no fifth unit. I think they're going to have a three-man. So Haps is just sacrificing the jelly. <laughs> Wait... <laughs> No, Haps. You're no, no way, right? Did, did we miss see that? No, it's sports it one. The jellyfish is gone. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Disastrous. But this gives the opportunity for them to do the funniest thing imaginable. Which is Mantis in the middle. Hit the ostrich oh, and the yeah. shark. <laughs> Someone said miss Haps. No. <laughs> Haps oh, is holding out for it. Toys. Huge so pivot. Clever. Yeah, huge pivot from the jellyfish sacrifice. I think Haps' <laughs> heart is broken. Yeah, this seems like too much. Wow, 3945 um, rabbit there. Boy. Jeez. Well, GG's to noob. Really good Jeez. for Haps, though. Haps now has a chance to uh, stay alive from getting last yep. place. Exactly, back into it. Mm. Awesome round there. And it, 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 it really shakes up the standings. So there are so many people whose game this could still be. And who are on the cusp of making it through the cutoff zone. Oh, yeah. I yeah I'm going gonna, gonna to tally up the points and we'll see who's close oh, to the yeah. chopping block. There's nothing. Uh, th this is what makes it exciting is like the chance for anyone to turn it around. It's up to RNG. Jesus. We'll see how it mm -hmm. goes. How was the prediction? How many people believed in Cody? You know what? It was set, uh, it was twenty five percent or something like that. That's pretty good. In Cody. That's Not better. Bad. That's better than an eighth. People did believe in Cody. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm no awesome round there. This All is just right. receding. Uh, no, this is a limb. So top four from this uh, lobby, after the points system, will go on to play in one v ones. Mm -hmm. All right, let's. Check, I think calculator Scooty's working on it. <laughs> yeah, I'm working on it. I'm getting the uh, the lobby set up so everyone can join. Nice. He's double tasking. All right, let's tally Chat, up the we points. We got a uh, prediction going up too. So if you guys want some Scooty milk, Scooty cookies. Excuse me. <laughs> cookies for your milk. Excuse me, Gavin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Hey, I'm not worried about what exactly I'm collecting. I just want that number to be bigger. A number go up, brain go. Brrr. Yep. Let's see. Hog with the <laughs> third place is pretty good. Not bad. Who is our first place in terms of points at the moment? Are you still mathing it out? I'm still mathing it out. I think at the moment, uh, Noob Skills is at the top. Hey, Let's see, Cody and Kelby tied for fifth, so they both get four points. Cody with the first place still has a decent amount of points, even though getting fifth. Let's see, Subbo and Val tied for seventh, so they get two points. Okay, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, let's see. Here are the standings. So Noob has 14, Kadi has 12, Sag has 12. So Sheesh. they have a pretty decent chance of staying in, but everyone else is very, very close. 
So it definitely comes down to this round. Oh mm. my goodness, the fourth place is actually yeah. honestly even th even twelve points, you're not safe. Yeah, I think you go, you get thirteen, you're in trouble. So you get you you come last with twelve points, you you could still see you later. Yeah, everybody can be in it. I need to uh, hopefully there won't be a tie, but I need to remember what the standings were. Yeah, basically, if there is a tie, whoever had the highest placement uh, in the games will take the higher slot. Mm -hmm. So because Cody got first and last, if Cody ties with someone, probably wins because Cody got a first place. What? Should put them in a 1v1, make them fight to the death. <laughs> I'll let you flip a coin. <laughs> Yo, a coin flip, spin a wheel, you know. These yeah. Chat zoomers love a good wheel or a coin flip. <laughs> Seven or 11, you let them choose. <laughs> All right, we have uh, seven or six out of the eight people in here. We are looking for suboptimal and uh, sag, right? sag, yes. Bing bong, bing bong. Oh, yeah. M God is uh, who up Shroom and they hog. Sag is here. Just one more to go. I would be really curious. I know during FPS games, sometimes there's behind the scenes listening to the comms of the players. I would love to hear the commentary from the player side as well to see how tilted they were getting. Because I don't think Cody was a, a fan of the Lynx last game. <laughs> no, Cody was not too happy there. We'll bring in we'll bring in someone after this round. Let's see, we're still waiting on suboptimal. All right, sub is in. There we go. Do you have the uh, prediction ready, uh, Gavin? Uh, oh, yeah. It's locked and loaded. It's already going and gone. All right. It's looking like 17% uh, people believe that Noob can go back to back. And uh, 83 are saying otherwise. Honestly, right. if anyone were to do it, I would trust Noob to go back to back. Or is Cody going to bring it back? Or is Cody going to get Depends. knocked out? All right. Here we Depends go. That's what the pack is looking like. We're back in. Let's see. Oh, look at the pack. <laughs> we have Cricket with the Frill Dragon. Could be something. Pug is really, really strong. I know a lot of players Pug like jelly. going Pug. Pug Jelly Swan. Leopard in the final alongside a Monkey, as well as a Rhino. There's going to be some very top-heavy teams here. And Do Chocolate is in the cow? pack. There is Cow, Not yeah. Gorilla here. I'm loving the Gorilla. Could see something there happening. And then also the secretary bird is really strong for pivoting. Yep. Oh, Ch chat also noticed leech camel is represented. Oh, is <gasps> leech camel in here? Oh, that's Cotty's favorite. Oh. <laughs> there is also elephant. Oh, no. Oh, oh, my oh, my no. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Team Wood Games in the chat. How's it going, Team Wood? Team Wood Games. Hope someone runs the sloth. Can we get a round of applause for Team Wood for yeah. coordinating with Scooty, making sure that the winner of this gets a phenomenal prize? Yes, round of applause for Team Wood. Team Wood. Let's go! Clap, clap, clap. <laughs> Team Wood gets to watch the Leech Camel Elephant in action just in time. Next week it's nerfed <laughs> on the test. <laughs> oh, no, not my beautiful camel. What in the world buys pig to sell pig? Hey, oh, you no, gotta get Val. the shriveled. So greedy. Val does have the chef hat. I am... Okay, so of the people... So fourth place could go to anyone. Who do we think is sneaking mm -hmm. in in the fourth place slot? There's oh. Kelby, Haps, Valerai, Subbo, and uh, M God or Shroomin' They Hog. I would love Shrooming They Hog to win just for the storyline. Mm. Or do we think I anyone mean... of the top three gets knocked out? I think a last place could one. potentially knock out Cody or Super Auto Gaming, but I think Noob is probably a, a definite. I don't think anyone... I think 15 points gets uh, fourth place, no matter what. Yeah, 50, I think Noob's is safe for sure yeah. to go through. I think Cody and Sag are definitely the most volatile. In terms of people sneaking in, I feel like... I feel like Hog or Kobe could do it. So here, do you play to try and survive? Like, are you just going links? Are you going 
tempo? Are you going the Secretary Burr just trying to get as many points as possible, or are you playing for first? Going for the Leopard with the Monkey. I think if you're Cotty and Sag, you're just going for fourth or fifth place. I think you buy as many links as you can and just stay alive. Mm, I, I, I don't know, because if you don't play for the win, then you're in trouble. It, it's the principle of aim small, hit small, right? Ooh, Kelby already has Elephant oh, Camel. Let's go, my camel, my <laughs> beloved. I'm so happy. Oh my Look gosh, at him go. a 10-10-2 cricket. All you camel wow. eaters out there, this one's for you. <laughs> Let's see who has a camel so far. Cotty, Elephant Camel. You hate to see it. <laughs> Kelby also has Elephant <laughs> And then uh, Valorai's the going camels? for the leech. Yeah, I, I guess no I one hit the leech yet. Leech Valorai is looking for the leech camel here. Oh, juice, juice it, Val. Turn four, do it. You know you want to. I can see it in his face. Juice, and then you can fill your team. I think the... I don't know if the gold was bugged. Maybe it isn't. But I think either way, they're wanting the tier four. Mm. For sure. Because they're getting the stats from the pug, so they're not worried about the... You think they're gonna wait? I don't. I don't know. Cause what do you roll for here? You you will take a loss if you don't combine. Like the, to me, that's guaranteed. Why is that? You get you get the stats from the pug during the battle. So I think they may be strong enough. Uh, that is a lot yeah. of jellyfish. That's really strong. Be investing in jelly stonks today. I don't think Val's gonna take it. Let's see, does anyone... Hits the jelly, so that's fine. Doesn't save. Mm -hmm. I guess level 3 is hard to find. Pug keeps it alive. Wow, such a good pug interact. What, another great trade. Sheesh. Awesome math there for Val. Alright, yeah, this is going to be the round where... All the camel leech... There's the camel, immediately. Leech camel for Val... Val's taking it home. <laughs> Does the Val know to buy? Him. He's not even... Oh, okay, there we go, there we go. Yeah. The spectate That's mode, it's it's slow. <laughs> I think Val knew. <laughs> I think Val knew for sure. Ooh, not Good a hit. bad yeah. sell. Yeah. Good hit. Uh, Are you getting rid of Pug here? I, I think Pug is good to stay. I think you buy a Whale Shark here and you start feeding it. Yep, I agree. Whale Shark for sure. I think if you have Whale Shark getting statted as well as the Leech, you're going to be very strong for a long time. Mm -hmm. Is there any seagull shenanigans possible? What sort of food do we have? Uh, there's tomato Popcorn. with slug. Popcorn with slug. Probably oh, just tomato. I think, you ha I think you have to. Yeah, I think you freeze. I think you have to buy it. Yep, you buy it, you immediately Beautiful. feed it the, the meat. The meat. Mm -hmm. Nice, he knows. And then you feed that to the camel, yeah. Oh, oh my goodness, what a what a line! I think Val is in a great spot. Mm -hmm. I think also, any held food asking, you just feed. What are you gonna say, Eggy? Uh, I was gonna say for someone asking, uh, koala is not included in this pack, unfortunately. So yeah, koala is not. No here. extra boosting. <laughs> I'm looking to see Sag pull out the rat. <laughs> rat into camel. Haps oh already has gosh. the massive jellyfish. But I think these stats are just too much. Oh, these are great trades. Yeah, Val's looking really strong. Subbo is Salamander. Sally Gaming. Is there Lollipop or Pepper? There's Lollipop. There? Oh, there is Lollipop. There's Lollipop and Moose. So Salamander is decent here. And there's even the Orangutan, which I don't think is still worth it. But Let's see who is on Camel. Uh, five people. <laughs> five people on camel, and most of the top players all have camel. Yep. It seems like camel's a very good pet. <laughs> Hog does have the secretary bird, which could be good if they get some summon pets. Mm -hmm. I, I, I'm I surprised. Uh, you know what? The standings are close enough that it's not worth noting, even. I was going to say the people at the bottom have really great teams, but it's one life difference, really. Yeah, it is. Yeah, There's just a lot of people at three lives, yeah. Kelby is at it first, looks scarier though. than it is. Has the level two pug. Level three pug could be good as well. Yeah, I'm loving the lion, a sea lion too. Me too. I mean, I noticed that last turn. I was like, dang, he's cooking. 
sea line nice and flexible uh early on use it for the hp and then afterwards it's still relevant and valorai just getting an even i yeah i think you just feed the whale shark until you get to probably the tier fives you can buy some stuff on the next few rounds but i think you're just statting this whale shark as fast as you can especially while we got a lot marks. of uh Kelby with the double pug. Oh, that's ridiculous. Oh, it's it can get caught though. But yeah, Val's team is still just really strong from the whale shark. Wow. Winner's POV. Yeah, I know. Cotty's at four. Cotty almost has level two. This will be really strong. And then a couple people still going for the balloons with the flying squirrel. I think it's a great strat. There's no later round food or uh toy pets mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but the balloon can get you a little ways yeah valor i just feeding the whale shark as much as possible i think the jellyfish kind of has to go here this jellyfish isn't doing much because there's no levels from val agreed yep let the jellyfish go i don't even i mean i might level to a pug if i don't have to roll too hard for it but i'm looking to pivot out of that back half I think we have to check in on Sag. Sag uh, seems like they were rolling for the camel, but never they hit. Milk. They do have the cow. They're still freezing jellies for a 5-6 jelly, so that's um, optimistic. Ooh, double. I guess you can only use one waffle, but still. You don't save the waffle for the cow? <laughs> oh, that's. I think that's a misplay. I don't think that's intentional. I think they just weren't thinking. Okay. I think looking at the team, they might have just like given up hope. So they're just kind of brainlessly rolling potentially. What does Question Sag mark? need to stay in this? He, Sag, I, uh, that waffle. <laughs> also, isn't this like hey, misaligned? Fifth or better. This hey, is the wrong hey, position hey. as well. What's going on? Oh no. Oof! Is it Jover? Sag's older brother had to go. Gave the controller back. Haps with the double secretary bird. Oh, I think no. that was bad positioning. That was punishing. Uh-oh. Yeah. Sag does have 12 points, so maybe Sag can stay in the top four. Yeah, Sag not I freezing mean, waffle. congratulations on a level two jelly. <laughs> no, that is a good hit. There is cheese, which could be good. Cheese porky, I could see. Um, well, also the, I don't know the, if I like cheese porky, yeah. The pug is still, like, put, put the... The better bug behind the worst bug. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Please don't cheese the porky. Oh, that's such a waste. Oh. Well, when are they going to sell the cow? I don't know. I would say keep it for the waffles, but Zag does not like the waffles either. <laughs> Let's see. Cotty and Val still on the top. Cotty, oh, Cotty's team is the leech camel. The leech camel does keep you at the top of the team. Hog is trying to get the level two secretary bird. A lot of secretary birds trying to stay alive. Mm -hmm. And Subbo still with the salamander, which we haven't seen yet. And yeah, I think Moose will be good for some teams, especially Sub. Nope. There you oh. go, Sag. Oh, okay, okay. There you go. <laughs> I thought he was going to combine there. I was about to have a heart attack. <laughs> oh, now the cow good, is good finally sell. gone. No, 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 no. What are you doing? Okay, Dude, the okay, lag okay, in spectate okay. mode stresses me out. <laughs> Wait, why does he care about a level two? Wait, why? I guess he doesn't have any other options. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like, yeah, what it's, else it's, is going to get? It's just for stats during the battle. Yeah, exactly. Oh, geez, that cheese is... Oh, actually... Mm. Oof. <sighs> okay, that's huge for Sag, what staying alive. Dang. Yep. The people's so champ important. is down in last. Oh, no. Sag needs to play for every single... Like, only play for the next round. Don't even worry about endgame, if I'm I think Sag. I think that's how Hog is as well. Hog really? did have a yeah, little bit Hog more well. points. Hog had nine points going into this. So if Hog can stay alive for a little bit and knock it last... Okay, so if I was Hog there, if I'm playing just for this round, you actually level up the Lynx. Lynx or the Secretary Bird. Or yeah, and then get rid of the Swan. If you level because to the Secretary Bird, you can buy the Slug. And then it, there's just so much. See, even here, oh, I think you level little, up here, back. get rid of Swan by the Slug. Level yep. two Secretary Bird can stat so much. It's doable. 
But do they know the line? That's the question. And that is an unconventional line. Awesome. I think they do know okay. it. I, I don't know if they sell for the slug, though. I think they have to. Because otherwise oh, it only forward? gets one yeah, ability. Sell, sell for the slug, not the leopard. Let's see if they do it. Okay. Yay! That's great. Okay, I think they where can, does it. slug go? I think they can stay alive. I think slug's good here. Because then the links get statted. Oh, back link stats. I almost want the stats going to Dodo and then Slug go Ooh. right up front. Oh, Suboptimal team is just too strong here. Oh, that's a big Sally. Yeah. Holy. That's it. 07 to the People's Champ. Yep. And TNT, we'll no point. democracy. Sag is out as well. Ooh, a little double there. Uh oh, but double is great for Sag. It's good for uh, Hog as well. They're both tied for seventh, so they get a little bit wow. more points. I think Sag may have a chance to stay in, but I think uh, I think Hog is probably out. Sag. Uh, Sag says so game one to give him ten plus porcupine. <laughs> <laughs> They called your name. You should have answered. I think Sub's team is looking really strong. The Leopard Monkey. Cody's just... Cody and Valor both just riding the high off of this Leech Camel. Loving it. Yep, agreed. I mean, incredible early tempo. So you have so many lives to play with as well come late game. Hey, Oz Champ. I'm looking at Kelly's team. I see a level 3 pug in the back. Their sea line is no longer there. But they got a level 2 elephant... Going on to a camel in the back as well. Also, the should, I guess the snake. Yeah, I guess the the poodle is going to be larger than the camel. So the snake on the poodle. Kelby could stay alive. All these teams are strong though, because the two teams that don't have camel have the level two secretary bird, which is a lot. Mm. Holy, what a team! Ooh, ooh, I do like the Big armadillo snake. play. Dude, Dillo Gaming is so infuriating because people don't expect it, but it looks like it wasn't enough. Kelby and the Haps game. are out. So I think that guarantees um, Noob? Cody and Noob, yeah. Yep. I mean, buy, sell, cow, camel, and, and on. I think, I think sub may be. Uh, Sneaking into the top here. I think Sub may take this. I think this is a very big team. Yeah, I think I think this team might beat out the Leech teams. I can't believe that Salamander. So well played. Yeah, that Salamander's really good. I think they had to have lollipopped it. Mm hmm What's the final piece of the puzzle here for Sag, then? It is... It honestly is just stats. Just keep getting bigger and bigger. Or for Sub? Faster than the other people. Or sorry, for Sub, yeah. Yeah, I think it's... I mean, you can add a snake later on. It's definitely just getting this leopard as strong as possible. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, Four, six. Wow, sub lolly combined had two salamanders getting statted. It's even better. Jeez. Oh, yeah. Walrus could also play a very big part in this. No one decided Walrus to go for the rhino, like though. Rhino seems uh, kind of good against the secretary bird teams, but maybe not. Mm. Oh, wow. I just noticed noobs level three swan. That's a lot of money to play with. That is a lot. Noobs may be falling on it here i i think rhino in response to secretary bird is good in 1v1s but in lobbies it falls off because you have too many people who you're not getting any value against all right subbo has knocked out noob but noob top four placement that's in uh yeah noob is almost noob for is sure in. in and then Cody even higher ranked <clears throat> val honestly... and val and sub being one or top three could knock sag out it could be Val, Cody, Noob, and uh, Sub going into it. Cody, Noob, Sub. We'll have to see a, how uh, great... how Val and Sub do here. Mm -hmm. Cause Sag did have a five point lead over them. Mm -hmm. Hear me out. You're putting popcorn on that monkey. You think so? Oh, absolutely. I think so. I think you steal a couple. Oh, never mind. I think you steal a couple of random wins that you might not otherwise get. I feel like I'm, I would have bought Hawk there. 
Hawk like is Hawk really good when you can like see your opponents. Cool. But the Hawk... Yeah, exactly. I mean, Val's camel is uh, is slowly dying to this leash. <laughs> <laughs> it's so small. <laughs> but yeah, even here, I, I think... I think you just try and get level 2 on this leopard, and then you... And then probably you are too strong. All the night. <laughs> yeah. Or even lollipop on this leopard here could have been the play, because then it evens out with the monkey. Mm -hmm. And it has more attack for the uh, the fights. Uh oh. Yeah, subs no, team may just be too wow. strong. Cotty also lost as well. Could have played subs ghost. Cotty's trying to get the big gorilla. This is what you were asking for, Gavin. I I love a gorilla play. A gorilla feels like a very high skill um animal to build a team around. And then you have to predict not dying. What? Yeah, that's yeah. fine. And yeah. even with the gorilla, uh, could leech the gorilla to immediately get the coconut. But I guess not going to. Going to go for the pancakes. I think you pancake the cow here, as well. Maybe. Yeah, definitely pancake cow here. This is nothing else in the shop. The leech gorilla was questionable, but I guess it. Uh, I don't know. I guess Cotty's just trying to leech camel until the leech gets to fifty. Mm -hmm. Three hearts, like yeah. you do have the time, yeah. That is, and then you know you can at any point do the gorilla. Yeah. And if you start with the coconut on the gorilla, the leopard could just break it. Would the gorilla not carry over coconut after that one round of taking an L? It could, but this way the gorilla doesn't get one shot if it gets hit by the leopard and just gets the coconut. Right, right, right. Okay. But right now it's so, a level one leopard, so the odds are low. But there are two right, leopards exactly. that Cotty's going against. And neither of them could one-shot the gorilla as, as it stands, so there's no rush. Correct. Wow, that's some really high-level thinking from Cotty. I think the that pancake is... is just really strong as well. Having a pancake yep. instead of the coconut. See, that's there's the coconut. Oh, market. there's the coconut. Mm -hmm. what, an, what a great trade there. 50-50. Take another trade. Oh, oh. my goodness. What? Cotty! Yeah. That's I, a team! Yeah, that is a that strong is a, team. That is a team. He's cooking. I think I think Sub might just beat Cotty, though. If Sub can level up this leopard, I think that's what it's riding on. Cotty finds uh -huh. the waffle. Please do not uh, miss it. <laughs> there you go, Cotty. <laughs> and then you give it to maybe the gorilla? I'm a big yeah. fan of the gorilla play here. Also, at, so, at some point, when are you getting rid of this elephant camel or swapping it around? Oh, here's the leopard. Here's your perfect chance. Freeze the leopard. Oh, but there's no permanent scaling, so I don't know if the leopard is the play. But the thing is, is like right now, this this leech is maxed out. So elephant camel, the ability, the elephant's doing nothing at this point. Yep, agreed. I mean, I, I might even be so inclined to sell oh, elephant for I a like deer. Oh, I like this. Investing in the gorilla with the elephant yeah, camel. Yeah, now the elephant camel's going on the gorilla. Is the positioning going to mess him up at all like this? I don't know. I would also be fine with the front leech. Just so it's it's mm -hmm. a 50-50 in the front. Yeah, with lemon. Yeah. 50-49, effectively. Mm -hmm. I would have, I think, personally invested more in the gorilla than the leech just now, but... Oh, what a bad trade there for Cody. Uh oh. Yeah, subs clones. Sub and is Val so is out. Val's in third. No, Valerie. I I think it's time to get rid of this elephant. I it think makes, so as well. It, it makes no sense to me. Oh my god. Especially against this leopard. Cody's yeah. losing to a level one leopard. So yeah, if sub levels us up, it's over. <laughs> but Cody is guaranteed. I think in the top four. Now it's just for seeding. Is See, leveling level up three cow? Yeah, is leveling up the cow worth it to try and get the waffle? Because you can level three the cow, lollipop the gorilla, and then you find a waffle next turn and average the gorilla out. <laughs> That's a lot of if then. Well, oh, no, no, no. The only if is the waffle. You have the lollipop and the can the chocolate already. <laughs> So you have to freeze your shop and roll for one slot waffle. <laughs> I don't know. That seems a little... I think that's ambitious. But 
Cotty's a. <gasps> nope, Cotty does yeah, not care. Past the taco. Yeah, it does oh, not boy. care. I think this may be it for Cotty. Oh, it's over till it's over. No. He can walrus do. could. Walrus. Yeah, I think Walrus might be the play. Walrus and then put Cow and Camel at the back. Forget about stats. It's okay. Cotty does not opt to Wait, go for the Walrus gold? this turn. It could Did be a bug. Did he save three gold? Maybe. Let's see. Now statting the Camel. Early Coco is good. What a trade there. This might be good. <gasps> nice. Got the back line Ooh, out. Oh, just very us. close. That Fast was a, that was so close to, to a win. Ran out of time properly. He was cooking too hard in the kitchen, you know? All right. Cotty's definitely going to go for the walrus here. I mean, please let Camel. Sub oh, still oh. doesn't have the level two on the leopard, though. Does he need it at this point? Well, I'm just saying, like, Cotty's still, like, losing with it. So I think if Subbo loses, because Subbo has three hearts, mm -hmm. I still think Cotty may not be able to crawl back, even if Cotty can win one round or two. Mm. I think that's smart. The gorilla getting the uh, peanut. Popcorn on walrus might be fine if you're planning on keeping the walrus around. Yep. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Oh. oh. Did homie not map? <laughs> oh, oh no, Cotty. No, this is the second, I think, accidental small squad we've seen in today's tournament. <laughs> oh, Lord. I mean, but what if he wins here? Four man squad winning? Holy shit. <laughs> uh, holy, holy smokes. <laughs> Wait, does it kill the salamander? Is it four damage that it blocks? Yeah, it's going to kill the salamander. I oh, know it's seven damage. It's seven damage two times. That's what it is. Oh, no. Peanut right. gorilla, it overrode the coconut. That was just BM. Cotty gets second, and Sub gets first place. Congratulations, Subbo. Oh, oh, seven for Cotty. That All was right. insane. So I think that would have been closer, but the, the coconut was overridden. I'm going to tally That's up like the points, and I'm going to get the lobby started for the pros. All right. So hopefully the Cotty pros are... <laughs> Hopefully the pros are ready. Drum roll in chat. Brr, who's uh, who's making it through? The top four. I feel like this is like America's next top model. I'm <laughs> feeling that kind of energy right now. <laughs> wow, I would love for Super Auto Pets players to. Uh, <laughs> I think I think the like the guess Imagine. now is if uh, if Sag makes it in or if Sag was too low to get knocked out. It's close. It's a super super close. Because uh, Valor, I got third, standing. so Val may have snuck in, but may have not. Val throwing in the GG's 07 early. It's not Jover till it's Jover. You've got to see how the math shakes out. See who makes it in. Also, we are awarding bonus points based on how much we like the content creator. <laughs> <laughs> We're subtracting points for how much we hate them as well. <laughs> yeah, that's right. And if any content creator has an Amazon Prime sub they use right now, uh, that may or may not influence. Mm hmm <laughs> All right. The code is up for the pros, and now I'm going to tally the points. All right, let's see. Let's see. Sag and Hog got seventh, so that's two points. I think Hog is definitely out. <sighs> the people didn't make it. Kelby a democracy. and Haps got <laughs> fifth, so that's four points. Oh. Now, for those who are wondering where the, a little bit about the pros, these are players who are regular sweats in the sap dojo discord they are players who are at the top of the leaderboards these are players that have shown up and shown out to official super auto pets team wood games tournaments and events and have done very very well so uh you might not recognize the name maybe you do rest assured these games are going to be very very tight uh the skill in here is going to leave very room for mistakes it's almost like watching and i i don't want to make this comparison too lightly but like top level chess Right, it doesn't come down to uh, luck so much as not making mistakes. Mm. The lines are clear for all of them. They know exactly where they're playing, but they uh, they're all chasing the same end goals. 
All right, so the points are in. And believe it or not, Val's third place was not able <gasps> to uh, to get them in. Rest in pieces, Valerai. Noob is in first place. Cotty is second seed. Sub got third, and Sag barely stays alive in fourth. Dang. Sag survives to the next round. Also, and I'm we have very impressed. We have everybody but one in the uh, in the pro uh, bracket. Who are you missing here? Um, no, we have everybody. Tangle has just joined. All right, Excellent. well, uh, let's uh, let's see if we can drag one of the people in from the last round. I'll uh, I'll start up the lobby though. Gavin, you can do a prediction if you want. Uh, okay. Let me think here. I'll start a prediction. I got a good one. Wait, someone is saying I did points wrong. Uh oh. Boom. Cotty should be at 19. Oh. Is that sneak Cotty a better seed or anything? It may tie them for first. Oh, Cotty was at 12. Cotty does go to 19. Yo, chat keeping the streamer honest. Good job. We tried. We tried really hard to screw Cotty out, <laughs> out of the placement there. Damn. Whoa, well, we don't drag me into this. All right, well, let's this. see. Okay. Uh, we all were in on this. So no, the tie, no, no, not me. The tie is on Cotty and Noob. So Cotty got first, fifth, and second. And then Noob got third, first, and fourth. So Cotty is actually in first because Cotty got a first and a second. He's a gamer. So Cotty is actually the one seed. Ching. So it goes Cotty, Noob, Sub and then sag. Interesting. So Cotty will get to beat on the lowest seed pro. Yeah. And sag will go against the highest. Don't Ooh. be fooled though. Even the lowest seed pro is pretty dang good. So it's still going to be a spicy fight whenever the 1v1s roll around. All right. The first round of the pros is starting. Let me. Here we go. And then I'll try and if anyone is. Hanging around. I'll drag him in. I'll drag in Cotty. Cotty! It's Cotty! He's muted. He's a man of few words. <laughs> he Only is a man dubs. of few words. <laughs> also, thank you for the uh, the raid from Kelby. Cotty, what happened in the last round? Why'd you uh, why'd you four squad? Uh, my brain went empty. Yeah, hey, that's fair. <laughs> no thoughts went empty. I, I did the I did the math wrong. I think. And then I just stared at a screen with three gold. <laughs> <laughs> people people were trying to give you the benefit of the doubt. They're like, no. there's more chances for the leopard to hit the gorilla. There's better odds for the walrus. They're like 400 or the you four squad. It off like it was intentional. Yeah. Everybody's, <laughs> yeah, you should have just played it off. Also, it's it seems like move. everybody is rooting for Violet right now. If Violet oh, has Violet a millions of fans, I am one of them. If Violet has 10 fans, I am one of them. If the world's uh, against I Violet, am I Violet am against well. the world. Uh, they are self-proclaimed one of the underdogs in the pro tourney. Oh, really? okay. Interesting. Yep. I feel like and Violet is they play the cello. Good. Violet is... These are all top-tier gamers. Like, it's... There's not much margin between any of these guys. Also, Cotty, congratulations on uh, getting first. Sorry I almost... Uh, put you in second with my bad math <laughs> boom tech is uh requesting vip i think i think that's uh, uh pretty great uh, vip in it's your chat you gotta pay him a cut of your winnings so yeah i think i'll just give him the vip that's fair yeah <laughs> <laughs> all right can we take a peek at the pack oh yeah let's look at the pack oh yeah we're having a ton of fun i think the random packs are great i uh i am very excited that uh I'm sad that Val's good placement at the end did not sneak him into fourth, but I'm glad to see that Sag survived. Mm -hmm. mm. I think Sag was uh, floundering in that last game, and I'm glad to see that he has some redemption.
If it wasn't for those 10 darn porcupines yeah. calling out his name, he could have snuck in a few <laughs> more points at some point. We also have yet to see a scorpion, which I think I'm excited about. Mm. The mistake that most people made last game was simply not finding uh, leech camel. Early. Oh, we, we saw leech camel elephant and just wrote it off. <laughs> yeah. The second game uh, with uh, the uh, shark and mantis was really good as well. Yeah, I really wanted to go Shark Mantis, but it just didn't. Kelby went Shark Mantis, they... but ended up uh, not being able to win. And I think Haps went Shark Mantis, but then Noob ended up winning with just the giant rabbit. And uh, what was it? The Komodo dragon. Yeah, the Noob's team there was the insane. Okay, people are sticking up for Sag. Sag did not flounder. He found 10 porcupines and zero camels. <laughs> That's when you commit to the level three porcupine. That's where the skill difference comes in. All right, let's see. Mm -hmm. Who is at the bottom right now? Fangar is at the bottom. Fangar, one of the OG pros. They won some of the early game, uh, early tournaments right when the uh, scene was taking off. So I, uh, we, we all, and they've been very relevant in the pro scene since. I wonder if anyone's going to go for the bison. So Cody, what would you be looking for here? Oh, uh, you, all, you pretty much always start looking at your tier threes and seeing what scaling is available. Mm -hmm. um, you look at your tier threes and tier sixes uh, and kind of work your way backwards. Um, early, I'm seeing uh, this basically turtle pack. In terms yeah, of the giraffe, you want ox, here. sheep seem really good. Dog is also very good if you're just trying to stay alive. Um, lots of tempo there. Uh, stork is great if you can support it, like if, as long as you can win with it. This role of flycatcher is funny. Um, Pillbug is <laughs> Pillbug moth are probably your tier ones that you're looking for the most here. Yeah, very good scaling. Everyone's going uh, moth, it seems, that has found it. Yeah, it's just the best tier Kyogre's one. Kyogre's going the dog. I think dog is one of those pets that you don't see many people going, but I think at the at the high level, a lot of people respect the scaling that the dog can give. Because you have Damon yeah. and you have Kyogre both going the dog. I was completely sleeping on it, but you're doing a ton of pivoting and moving your team around anyway, and it's just a pet that rewards you for playing the game. So, um, and it's and it's really easy to sell because, like, on turn seven, when you look over and realize you still just have a four three dog, when it's, it doesn't yeah, have any of the temp stats, it just plays the game for you. Ditch it, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so Finger's gonna hit a level up into a tier four. It seems like Lynx is really good here. Gariel into Mosasaurus, maybe, if you're trying to get the tempo from the foam sword. Mm, from all the toys. And I was actually kind of curious, Cotty, do you have, like, a favorite choice of, like, who's probably going to be first seed out of the pros? Uh, it's so hard to pick against Kai. Um, all these guys are really good. Um, Kai is a lot of, like, what, who a lot of people consider. There's, like, three names that are tossed around as who's the best, but they are... Um, you know, you got Kai and you got Bagels that are two really, really, really strong players. Kai has been grinding random lobbies nonstop. And so, also, wow. for anyone curious, uh, Debbie Klein is Bagels, right? Uh, correct. Yeah, that is correct. And then Thorfinn is, uh, who? Uh, that's a good question. We just let a rando in? <laughs> <laughs> I can, I can ask that in the Discord. Snoop around for us. Be our undercover agent. Thorfinn is Kratava. Oh, um, Katarba. People are saying. Couldn't. That's okay. what it is. Someone's been watching too much Vinland Saga lately. <laughs> 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 the penguin on the beaver pill bug. Okay, so Fengar's committing to a big beaver, big pill bug. Scaling with penguin and tropical mean. fish. I love big beaver. <laughs> really? <laughs> it's a soft pet, though, and it's such a low tier pet. Why would you want to keep it around for so long? This flycatcher fly catcher was doing pretty good there. Fangar mm -hmm. is going down to one. This may be a quick out for uh, Fangar. Lightmare down. Yeah, a lot of dog Fangar players here. Yeah, you're seeing a lot of a lot of dog uh, dog sheep tempo is is great, mm -hmm. and that, I think that's what you're seeing here. Same with the is stork. When the, setting David's up for the long good, term, and then you have David's ox. Yeah, getting parrot early is great. The parrot pivots 
could be on the stag. I mean, stegosaurs fly. There's a lot of good summons to work towards. It would the be leopard awesome to could have be a good. Summon team, uh, sort of like last couple. Haven't seen that yet. Let's see. Is there any way to get trumpets for this wildebeest? I Cherry. mean, there's. Cherry. What is this round bird's name? The one at the end of the turn five tier. <laughs> the round bird, the cockatoo. No, oh, turn the five. Blue head, blue blue head. Head. Oh, turn I five. Oh, I thought you said tier five. The flycatcher. No. No, the next one beside the it, I think. Fowl. The guinea, guinea fowl. fowl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, that one, that <laughs> round bird. He's a round boy. <laughs> I didn't know what to call him. <laughs> guinea fowl does gain trumpets. Spherical facts. I don't know done. if I've ever bought a guinea fowl in game. Really? I love going for guinea fowl just because I feel like it's it's a good chance to get a lot of trumpets when you don't have something like the Highland Cow. Hmm. Let's see. Can Fangar stay alive? I don't think so. Nah, Fingar. Oh, Ooh, okay. Drawing, Fingar's still in it. Fingar's still close. in it. And now Lightmare is at one. Fingar versus Lightmare. Lightmare's team is not feeling super strong. I guess this is where you said it's a really good pivot to just get rid of that dog on turn seven. Mm -hmm. If Lightmare can yeah. level up the stork. You gotta find something to anchor around, though. That's, that's looking pretty tenuous. The level three... Stork potentially from Katarba could be great. There is mm -hmm. no chocolate though, so they're gonna have to get lucky and finding level ups. Ooh, parrot. If you have the runway to scale a parrot, it's one of the best pets in the game. Because you I can absolutely just agree. grab a leopard, chuck, uh, chuck it in front, and all of a sudden you have a level two and a level one leopard going or something different. Yep. All right, we have Parrot's three the, still uh, sorry, on five. Such a staple. Yeah, Parrot is really, really strong. Especially on this beaver. <laughs> <laughs> I still well, like committing to this flycatcher. It does seem kind of good against all of these sheep teams. It's done quite a lot of work in previous rounds, mm -hmm. so it might be worth keeping. And now it's Parrot on the flycatcher. And the mm -hmm. big beaver. I'm still rooting for the big beaver. <laughs> The parrot is a bold choice on lethal. You do need the runway to get it off the ground, mm -hmm. especially not having anything to like copy of, of note. Although I say that, yeah, let's but see it. Go absolutely crazy <laughs> right here. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. oh that's so it was good. Hard. All right, Lightmare's still alive. We have three people oh. on one. That was Tangle's worst nightmare there. <laughs> that was so Vigar good. Vigar is gaming. <clears throat> I mean, every single opponent. Or I guess no, we're starting to uh wait, are there? Yeah, we're starting to pill these sheep, so there's less summons. I, I would be laughing myself silly if I had a royal flycatcher do that. An attorney. I don't, I would need a brown to compose <laughs> myself after. When you're on lethal. So satisfying. Too. Oh yeah, even better. Katarba and, and bagels have found player. a shark as well. Oh Ooh, tasty. That's a twenty seven nineteen puppy. Or dog. Uh-huh. What in the world? It also the puppy got stats from the pill during the shop, and I think it accounts for the temporary stats in the uh oh, okay. Yeah. So you're seeing dog's ability to support a pivot, especially being able to pivot dog into shark and just start pilling stuff is just exactly what you want. Mm-hmm. This is really big I, from yeah. Fangar. If Fangar can stay alive and not get last, at least get a couple of points. <clears throat> Who's Thorfinn? Is that their um Oh that was that was Katarba. Katarba? Okay. Yeah. I like that Katarba has a uh melon helmet. The melon toy. helmet, yeah. A lot yeah. of people are going melon helmet. Fengar needs a summon team opponent. Ooh, the Lynx <gasps> gets really good hits. Dang, goodbye. Fengar is out. Just... Yep. Ooh, and Fengar solo gets eighth. And TNT 07s for good old Fangar. I do see that turkey making an appearance, meaning it's going to get a little spicy as we go up the tiers, especially if there's a summons team already going. Do you guys like or hate the turkey now? <clears throat> Is it a net positive or negative to the game? I like the turkey. I like it as well, because like when you're buying new pets especially, it's nice to get them a little off the ground instead of having them just be like small, you know? Mm -hmm. Also, here is the hat that everyone is competing for, that Lightmare is one of three that currently owns. I, I think Fengar has one too. Is it Fengar? Because Fengar won an early tourney. 
Cody, do you know? Maybe, I know maybe uh, confirm. it's Lightmare, and uh, I know um, Saikuno has one from the Ludwig tournament, and then one other person mm -hmm. has one. Saikuno has one? Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I should have competed. I could have been twinning with Saikuno. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure who else has one. That's a good question. Oh, Fangar won the stands turning. Oh, Cleanup has one. Yeah, Cleanup does have one. Oh, so wait, yeah. four people? Oh, so four people has it. Someone's oh, so Light, light Fangar and Cleanup. Okay. So when Fang if Fangar wins, they get a double stacked as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's going to be the only double stacked hat, which is pretty neat. <laughs> well, so whoever Cody... wins also gets either Light or Fingar's hat as well, right? That, that's how it works. <laughs> right. They're playing for keeps. <laughs> so, oh, Cody, who are you Who night. are you wanting to face in the first round? Who am I wanting yeah. to face? Because you're going to face the fourth seed. Uh... Oh, Lightmare's Man. out. Lightmare's out. Of out. this group, Katarba or Fingar, but like any of these are going to be a knife fight in a phone booth, you know? All right. <laughs> 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 All right, Katarba and Fingar, you heard it. If you're against Kadi, just know Kadi thinks you're an easy dub. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's messed up. I got baited. Cody wants Damon. Do you want Damon, Cody? I don't know, man. Damon's got Damon and Lightmare have um, uh, some like outside buffs on me. Like they they have made some of the grossest comebacks on me specifically. So I've got some. So there's a there's a yeah there's a mental game there. To be fair, I have insider information that Damon is kind of you know going through a mental game right now. Not only is he competing in sap but he's competing and fighting for his will to live at work at the same time he said egg i took off the wrong day i thought the tournament was on monday and here we are at work <laughs> please don't tell his supervisor no one clipped that i didn't say it um <laughs> all right well good luck to damon hopefully damon can uh get by without anyone noticing yeah. <laughs> wow damon took a whole day off work for your turning scooty like just the wrong day confidence. so if damon wins well, damon will the then day. get to uh celebrate and have a day off yeah. Or if he loses, he has a day, you know, to emotionally recover <laughs> as he's like going through tissue box after tissue box, crying in the club. Oh no, this is gonna I be bad. love the level three Falcon here. Yeah, that's huge. Yeah, that's oh, huge. Oh my gosh. The Falcon's so strong. Anyone else out? Nope, just Lightmare and Fingar still. Falcon is so Tangle is down to one. Technology. Kyogre is on one as well. Kyogre going a completely different strat from everyone else. Going for the Triceratops. Debbie Klein's got this wrapped up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> look at, look at yeah, that. Yeah, that is a that very is... strong... If, they're, if they find any pills for these mammoths... If they find uh, Spino as well. I also love Violet going for the reindeer. Mm -hmm. Violet's actually the only person not going any summons at all. I think reindeer uh, is such a good play. Reindeer, Spino... Snipe, yeah. Flea as well, but Flea going after the Snipes. Uh, maybe a little bit less good. Let's see. Level up? No. No level up on the Spino here. I think you're still freezing Spino, though. I would, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm a little annoyed at how juicy the sheep is, because like I would want to get rid of it, but the health is just too big Yeah, to the ignore. sheep is the largest unit. Keeping the fly alive from the opposing lynx, potentially. I think the lynx still kills mm -hmm. it with the pineapple. And the sheep is enabling the parrot to be another sheep as well. And all those triggers are feeding the R2 backline units. If either the spino or the shark gets leveled up, this team is really, really strong. Okay, Damon has a huge moth, which may just take it home. Mm -hmm. Good hits from the spino, though. Wait, I believe. I think I, I think Damon's not... Yeah, tang Tangle's... It depends on what the hit is here. Oof. Oh, not even close. Oh my goodness, Please. so close. I like that. That was very satisfying. <laughs> Tangle oh no, not there. not spectate mode. No. No, not spectate ding mode. Ding dong. Team Wood, Team Wood, please team fix wood. it. Help ding us. Wee -woo, wee -woo. Team Wood, help. Chat everyone. <laughs> Please at Teamwood Games. 
Oh, imagine. Get them to help us out. <laughs> Imagine oh, someone's live tweeting the tournament and they're just like at Team Wood. We're like, joining back in. We're shot. joining back in. Okay, was oh, anyone perfect. knocked out? Uh, Kai Ogre was knocked out. Wow. Wow. Is that, that's a fifth for Kai or sixth? That's sixth. Whoa. Mm. Big upset there. Mm hmm. But, you know, everyone in this, uh, everyone on this group is quite a heater, so not impossible. Debbie Klein, the only person on four hearts, might be able to just take this one home. This is a very mm. strong dog and shark with all these mammoths that they're finding. Are you pilling in shop or mm -hmm. no? Oh yeah, you're pilling. You you're pilling every mammoth Even you find. You fly? Yeah. Um, so yeah. Why, why fly then? Why like just hold fly anyways? Um, it's still so good. Uh, basically, you're giving up one of the fly triggers each turn to get permanent scaling, but. The fly is the unit you're gonna want in that slot. End game, just okay. it's the best enabler for the dog and uh, shark. <laughs> All right, well, the, mm -hmm. we don't get to watch the end of the fight. <laughs> Bagels <laughs> takes it home. Too, yeah. <laughs> okay, who was knocked out? Uh, Tangle was knocked out. There's some pieces, Tangle. Also, someone had mentioned if you do pull things in shop and it triggers the fly, that's just one extra gold on the bright side, you know. True. Or it's another thing that you can potentially pill. True. Facts, facts. It does cost you one fly trigger, which is yeah. a bit unfortunate, but... Hey, those perma stats on a shark, I'd say it's worth it. Mm-hmm. The violet reindeer still staying on top, which is exciting. I like the reindeer here. I do as well. It's a good counter pick against all these summon squads. This could be good. Yeah, foam sword to hit the lowest health. Does it kill anything? It kills the flea, kills the penguin with stake, which, and it kills the stork as well. So it does kill something on every single squad at the moment. Going fly in the back. The only snipes to worry about are the links from Violet. Mm -hmm. Freeze what here? Uh, the stake. Oh, yeah, stake yep. would be good. Uh, then you give up a pill slot, though. That's true. Oh and no, the fly is gone. Mm hmm. And the unit I would have put the stake on is dead. So it shows what I know. <laughs> hey, you were the first seed out of the content creators. You're not something. All right, we do have a. Who was knocked out? Damon. Damon was knocked down in fourth place. This and is a TNT. really fun pack. This is a really strong pack, too. What a hard roll here. I, yeah, I mean, I think pill. they're just, I think you just have to look for the pill. Pills and mammoth. They're still rolling. They're still rolling. <laughs> okay, stakes. Well spend it all. <laughs> stakes fine. Let's see. The Lynx is still in from Violet, but Bagels is working Lynx with four hearts. Mm hmm. Doom roll. See, even at the very top uh, skill ceiling, Doom roll is still a strat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's viable. <laughs> I've never called it a Doom roll. I'm always optimistic. Like, oh yeah, next next one. It's right behind this next roll. Said like a true gamba. <laughs> I don't have zero gold, and then it sets in. Oh no. Oh sorry. This is group two. Also, someone in chat was asking, you know, Gavin, you've been doing a great job co-hosting alongside Scooty and stuff, but, you know, people but... want to know facts about you. What does It's G&G stand for, someone has asked. Uh, that is a great question. But to Do find out know? the answer, we have to go deep into the G&G lore. I don't God. know. That might be a tale for another day. I see. Well, only the true It's G&G OGs will know. <laughs> oh my, I can't believe that wins. Mm -hmm. That was really this good. This is insane. Four hearts. This might be our biggest, if they win with four hearts, our biggest, uh, most health yet. I think so. Everyone's still in, though, at the moment. Fun facts about Katarba, actually. Before they started being a Super Auto Pets pro, they were a Fortnite pro. And they want to go band for band against you, by the way, Scooty. In Fortnite? Uh, anything, it seems. I have it in, in written word. 
Oh, in the I in the fun fact section. Fortnite gamer. Yeah. Wait, who was this? Katarba. Katarba, interesting. Yeah, they they're saying earnings check. And uh, they get they might got you whooped. I can't Weird flex, but I. That's what I think. I did try my hand at a Fortnite hype video one time. I never posted it because I was too ashamed, though. No. Fortnite, what video? Hype? hype video. <laughs> <laughs> Make All right. Do you remember the song you had on it? Uh, I Holy don't Lord. remember. I it was a Baby No Money song, but I don't remember. <laughs> this was also like it was Baby No Money. Like I don't know. It was like 2018. It was early Baby No Money. Yeah. Oh, it's that like uh, you know, the, his most famous one. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, he forgot the chorus or the the melody for it. <laughs> Let's see. I think Bagels is just gonna be able to take it. Mm -hmm. The I weakness from the flea is pretty good, but that's just an easy W Four for Bagels, man. Yep. Dang. Violet and uh, Katarba. Both knocked out. All right. Four hearts. That's our biggest gap yet. I would love to see someone win with five. That'd be super cool. I mean, that's just domination at that point. Any bonus points for a five run? Uh... Maybe that'll be if if there's a tiebreaker of the tiebreaker, maybe that. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. Otherwise, it's just for the flex. <laughs> if you win with five hearts, you get to post your stream link in Scooty's chat. <laughs> but these are the pros; they don't even stream. Uh, you can plug your favorite streamer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <dang. laughs> All right, let's get a new pack going. What do you guys think of the random pack over static pack? I Big love fan? it personally. I think it makes it more juicy, honestly. I I think a uh, random pack is so much so entertaining to come back to because it's always shifting metas, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It gets boring seeing the same optimal build over and over again, and especially in bigger lobbies too. You know someone's gonna hit the optimal build, so at that point it comes a scramble for second. Yeah, and there's also plenty of other tournaments, for those who don't know. The SAP community is pretty great at, like, running their own community run events, and most of them typically run with static packs, so it's really nice to see a bigger event use random. Did the winning team have a Spino on it, by the way? I think so. I think so. It did? Mm -hmm. I felt like it was the last animal on it, yeah. No, 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 chat's saying no Spino. Never mind, I'm blind as balls. Don't listen to me. <laughs> I blindly agree. Or do I pay the believers here? Oh, wait, are they gaslighting you? <laughs> now I'm scared. I'm scared to pay out the wrong one. It's, it's your, it's, it's your prediction. No <laughs> it's Fly G &G. dog, shark, mammoth, ox. Yeah, yeah. Fly dog, yeah, shark, right. mammoth, ox. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's thank goodness. G stands for it's gaslight, no gaslight. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. I'll pay that one out then. Um, Violet and Katarba did tie, correct? For second? Yes. Okay. Out at the same round. So they both get seven points. Chad, you guys like that last prediction? Do you want something similar for this one? Or do I throw something out of left field here? All right, here are the current standings. Oh, wrong one. Here we go. You could do, is there pill or is there chocolate? Bagels is in so first and then violent guitar, but pretty commanding lead. Decent amount of points. Kyogre, the people's favorite uh, with three points, though. Does the winning team end with one heart? Interesting prediction. I like it. Right? Gavin, people want you to do what will the dice equal? <laughs> <laughs> That's a classic one. You know, I yoinked that one from stands, I'm pretty sure. Oh, really? <laughs> I no did, shame. yeah. I told him. I mentioned it to him in passing. All right, everybody's I said, in. I just want to be like you, big bro. And then yoinked all his stuff. Ooh, he what a sharp. Uh, he, he left me on red. Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good starting shop. Where'd that one go? Two uh, fish. With the moth? Oh, that was mine. I had to abandon. Oh. I could have played it out. You you could have won with that, man. That's an <laughs> opener. 
All right. What's the pack blob. looking like? We do no have pill, blob, blob, no pill. blob Mantis, though. Blob Mantis. Blob Mantis. There is no strawberry for the shoe bill. Dragon in the late game could do something. I kind of like this orangutan, this pack. I don't, I don't hate it. All right, Gavin, what was the bet that you made? Does winning team end with one heart? It's kind of I a 50-50, like too. Chat's uh, not too sure. There's no big heavy heavy betters yet. It's pretty even for the most part. It seems to slightly oh tilt towards no. Win. Yeah, slightly. Oh, That was never a mind. crazy win over Kyogre, because their team is solid. Yeah. Still yeah, I think, I think you're looking for fish, possum, ferret, yep. chinchilla for pivots. So that's basically what everyone's going. I'm such a pack one um, nerd for the early rounds. I love pack one pets early. I think pack one pets are still some of the strongest, even after all mm -hmm. the nerfs. Like Ant and mm -hmm. Fish are still super, super strong. Yep, always Ant relevant. is probably still one of the strongest. I think Moth, just overall, is probably the strongest tier one. I think, uh, it's, I think it's the only 3-3 three, three that you can get. I'd agree. There's one other one I'm trying to think of who I think is... Yeah, also, Haps, thank is, you so much for the gifted. Thank you, thank you, thank you. To some degree, Goose is also as good as Moth. Uh, I, think I think a little bit less. Early games. Yeah. All right, I guess. I do think the uh, the possum is very, very. Let's solid see if too. anyone has gone down to three. Okay, Bagels and Katarba down to three. Haps, thank you so much, Haps. Yay! Yeah, thank you, Haps. Haps, awesome showing in the tourney. Awesome stuff. So the number one and number two from last round are both ones that are on four hearts. The only ones that aren't back to five after the round. To be fair, they could have a similar story to Cody. You know, you win some, you lose some. Yeah, Cody, mm -hmm. what happened there on the uh, on the second game? Almost went uh, out last. Yeah, I, my let's see, I teared up into double mongoose, and ter from turn three, it was just. <laughs> <laughs> yeah i mean i i had to make a um i just didn't hit i didn't hit anything that i liked and, you barely uh, scraped played. by though and i think that played a big difference because if you went out eighth you would have been three points behind you still would have been in mm -hmm. it but you not would have been you would have not been first yeah i mean I, I just went into survival mode buying uh pies and whatever <laughs> i could just to get immediate impact which is trying to <laughs> mitigate the damage But that can happen. I was set. I was trying to go Dodo because it was really good for the end game. With, yeah, we um, did see you going Dodo because there was Dodo Lionfish and Warthog and Cobra. There were so many good combos for it. And German Shepherd. Mm -hmm. um, I just didn't. I mean, if you greed too much on the end game, you know, you can. These are very good players that can put together really good tempo lines too. Um, and like, you'll just find yourself out of lives in a hurry. Okay. Wow. A that lot of people dropping down to four. Insane. Debbie Klein's garlic press got so much value there. Oh, garlic press is so strong. One. Unreal. Yeah. And you know what's crazy? They're the only one with garlic press right now. So they have such a leg up on the other teams. I mean, I... look at Violet Citizen's team. Just a spawning team would get absolutely cooked. Tangle? Oh, Tangle, might... Tangle has double hatching chick already. Mm -hmm. That's, That's so terrifying. Strong. Okay. With a 9-7 moth too. My goodness. If they level two that very quickly, that'll be huge. There's the Jerboa again, but there is no owl, worm, or apple. No One mouse. of these rounds, we will get no mouse as Jerboa well. Jerboa's just happy to be here. <laughs> Guys, I heard there's a tournament. I'm in. I think this is going to all come down to who hits Mantis. Mantis will be good. Mantis on Blob is really strong here. I don't know if it's going to be a Mantis game. I really think it's going to be a cat-built game. Because you have the chocolate, um, the Mantis blob is less important. If the chocolate wasn't here, that, it would feel almost necessary. Yeah. Um, do we have any big Dodos getting cooked up yet? I guess it's... We have Dodo from Kyogre. And they had one oh, other Dodo that I did Dodo. not see. There is the garlic. Oh my gosh, look at the damage here. Yeah, Just... this is an awful matchup for Fengar. Oof. That's two now that Fengar loses to the Garlic Press. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, for people asking how the pack was made, 
The randomizer pack that is built into sap prevents strawberries and jerboa and a few things. So we used grounded saps randomizer, which is 100% random. There is the mantis. Does Fangar take it? Probably already does. Oh, you can roll. You have chinchilla econ here. You, you, I mean, that's a, such a pivot team. Keep the only thing you're keeping here is rabbit. Everything else can see you later. Maybe you keep cone snail for tempo. I'm liking this so far. Yeah, sell it down. Sell it down. Oh, Cotty, there was one round. I think it was uh, Haps that had a mantis shark super early. Do you mm -hmm. like going double? uh kill with the mantis because uh, we were i mean if you can afford it yeah um, haps was on four and we kept thinking that it was probably a good move but haps did end up getting yeah. second still oh this we're getting rabbit lettuce action this is this is what you want to see that was a I'll really go. good lettuce there's, well, another, there's another lettuce you gotta freeze it you run double rabbits absolutely i think oh, they freeze mind. it no i think they have time yeah don't let the spectate fool you <laughs> So like the tar um, over the uh, mantis because of the uh, the hippo. It's gonna go crazy here. Close. I hope a hippo team wins. That is so satisfying. Kyogre going for the what was it, the orangutan? Could be kind of good when paired with the dodo. It I might think take a second. Great. Lightmare ends up going for the praying mantis. Hits an ant. Level two ant. Damon is going for the Emperor Tamarin. I really want to see that work out. Yeah, let's go see how that's going. Also, it, it sucks that Tangle never hit the level 2 hatching chick. Level 3. Fair it's an 11-3 Emperor Tamarin. Did he... What? <laughs> um, Fried shrimp has to be. Yeah. Oh, awkward levels here. Like, you're leveling a pug. Sure. 2.6... Ferret here. Eh. Oh, You're I've so committed to it. You might as well keep it. I up. wish the Tamron was still 50, 100. Mm -hmm. Would be much better. Does it get hit by the balloon? What are you wanting to get with the uh, Tamron cell? I don't know if you can commit all the way to tier 6. Uh, If you can live that long, German Shepherd is, yeah. or boar. Is Silver Fox ever a play? I'd slap it on an eagle before I do a silver silver fox personally. Mm -hmm. That depends on your life life situation for sure. Is there a bird of paradise? I don't think there is. Because if there's, a bird, I can check, if there's a bird of paradise, silver fox for sure. Um, without much like other gold support, it's a pretty greedy play that you need the lines for. But money is so good. At All right, let's game. see if Damon gets a good hit off the pug. Crocodile, Crocodile Poodle's also good. Poodle. You have three, two, I, four. Yeah. I like this Poodle a lot. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Poodle scales everything. Very good. Maybe just freeze the pair. Roll. Cells oh, there. Oh, okay, go scaling. I'm, I'm with it. I like these lines. Could still get okay, so now I'm garlic here, to be honest. I, I um, wouldn't hate a garlic buy onto anyone uh, just for the win now so you mm -hmm. can use the um uh manatee a little longer i guess garlic I may mean, be on I, pug I, I, everything else you're yeah. getting rid of mm -hmm. except for the I, food, on, but... I, I i would not want to trade lives here when i'm still cooking my uh emperor tamarin three lives you're not safe tangle hits the level two hatching chick and has manta Decent. to try and I pivot feel like i take manta and just die yeah manta's hard to survive with that was really good wow those break points were oh very wow. close those chilies who's on one I... we have katarba and lightmare lightmare finished not super high on the last lightmare got either, seventh that, place last time yeah seventh yeah that was fangar tough. and lightmare are the ones that are and kyogre all did uh in the bottom half 
Interesting. That's going to be a big push then. For but them. Kyogre's doing decently well. Kyogre has the orangutan garlic with dodo combo. Mm -hmm. And stacking up the dodo is going to be good for German Shepherd potentially. Mm -hmm. well, there is the Bird of Paradise here, Cotty. There's, there's a That's lot that. of scaling. Cat has decent hits. You have Dragon, Buy, Sell, Bird of Paradise. Ostrich solo scaling is really good as well. Especially when Please you have such strong tier six. see a rabbit soft eyes. That's all I ask for. I just want to use <laughs> <laughs> If you have all tier it's sixes, the lettuce dangerous. on the cat could be really good. Ooh, look at all those tamarind. Do you, do you go for the level three? I don't know if you can commit yeah. for that. You think so? You Turn eight. So you never back down, that. never what? <laughs> and you want to have No, they don't up. take it. Don't commit for it. Oh, is no. there banana for the manatee? There's not. I think it's reasonable to not take it. Um, yeah. Especially because you're like going... If, if it was turn seven, I think you consider it a lot more, but you really want to find your tier up. If you can hit a tier six, there's a win con where you hit hit the tier six you're looking for off the Emperor Tamarin level up next turn. Lightmare is out. That's not good for Lightmare. That's yeah. Cool. yeah. That's pretty oh, tough. Sevens for light and TNT. This is a very bad situation for Damon, honestly, too. The Jerboa. <laughs> yeah. Do you Shepherd. go? Do you go? Dra I guess you go German Shepherd. You sell the Emperor Tamarin yeah. for it. I Going for the see. dragon. I do. I do. I would really go dragon. Like either one of those, I think you win with either. So I'm. I'm. Totally Get rid of orangutan. Start buy selling. Uh huh. And you're just all stacked. And then garlic the. Ma I would garlic the manatee, or just get rid. Okay. Okay. You can keep the orangutan. I think garlic manatee might be better than orangutan here. I think I sell this orangutan and take the niala. Yep, I'm the same way. Niala in front of pug, and then buy sell buy sell. Yeah, because you're still. But they you're already still missed a the five. They already missed a pro. Yeah. I, I I think this is a little bit behind the eight ball here. You haven't run away with it. The Tamarind Cell wasn't enough of a power spike that you are feeling good about this transition. This is going to be a really hard transition. Being on lethal does make this really tough. You yeah. did end up going with the... Uh, Level two. The Niala. Niala. But then missed out on a, a stat. Yeah. For no reason. That's they do get the Orangutan stacks on the Niala, though. Yep. Good point. On right, one heart. Also, so. the level two mantis down at one heart as well for Katarba. Uh, Bobfish behind it as well. Salt walrus. That peanut oh, could do something. <gasps> oh, this is going to be... It's... Oh, so... no, no, that's, that's so, so sad. sad for Damon. Oh. Oh. oh, no. That's so sad for Damon. Very unlucky. You can't trust any of these gamers if, if there's peanuts rolling around. Yeah, the walrus seems like big. It was a level two walrus as level well. Level two that walrus, correct? yeah. Whoa. Just brutal. man. Here's a bird of paradise potential though. For is it the first one on the board? It must be because it's turn ten. Yeah, there's we have cat from Fangar, which could be Ooh. good. Cat and rabbit. And I know Ooh. you like the big With hippo. The big hippo. Mm -hmm. That's about to be big That's stats. Strong. That's juicy. Yeah. Moto Moto Light. Damon's team was looking really good with the dragon. So, I mean, that's so unfortunate that uh, I wonder if he had gone German Shepherd. He he had, he definitely would have won if he had gone German Shepherd. Just any more stats and he wins that last one. Yeah, German Shepherd probably does win it there. So, dragon was probably too greedy. Almost leveled. Yeah, the uh, Alpaca and a Bird of Paradise could be good for Violet. On two hearts, though. Chocolate for the Bird of Paradise. As long as this walrus can just ruin people's days. If you okay, if Violet Citizen gets out of this with two hearts still, I think they're in for a real like power spike. But if they lose this next one, uh play for survival. Mm hmm This walrus it's is a, very scary spot. though. Mm -hmm. With the salt too, that thing's hitting for twenty. Or Oh, what a trade. Yeah, Let's see, hits kills huge. the pug. Value? Yo. I think it's not good oh. enough. Oh, on. Not quite. Oh, no. And then if Katar the second peanut was up a little bit further, that would have been a tie. Katarb is also out. Oof. I will say, as a person who typically does viewer lobbies, I don't often see people pick up salt. It's not something I see commonly among the salt's... general populace. You probably give them enough of it. I think salt's really, really strong. Oh. 
Hey, I'm a low sodium streamer <laughs> out here, okay? I'm healthy. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, everybody's low on health though. Everybody's on two or one. Hmm. Kyogre has a ton of scaling though. Hits the level two poodle, has the Komodo as well. Almost level two Niala. Komodo with the really dodo. Good. Yeah. I guess Kyogre's risking it. One in four chance, Doing right? All gas. All gas. I'm loving the hippo still. This manatee is about about gone though. <laughs> Unless they find a, a lemon for it. Oh seven the manatee. Manatee's me at work every day, hanging on by a thread. <laughs> one HP. <laughs> really? Can we do another spreadsheet? I'm like, I'm at one heart. <laughs> I think Violet has to sell alpaca for boar or ostrich here. Probably has to just be boar. I think they're going to go for the 1.5 boar. Mm -hmm. Stack these up. Stack the stork, maybe? Oh, no, he's just... He's just trying to survive. Yeah, Th that, that would be too greedy on one. Go meat on something. Yeah. On the boar. Meat looks so delicious. Like, I would absolutely bow <laughs> down on that. That was a... These were all really good lineups, but everything uh, does not survive. So Violet is oh, out. Yeah. Jeez. That'd be fine hanging in there. Oh, yeah. for Kyogre's at the bad. top as well. Kyogre definitely needs a good finish because Kyogre got sixth place last time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Fangar, Debbie Klein. Debbie Klein is uh, who again? Bagels. Uh, bagels. Bagels, right. Thank and Bagels you. got first last time. So Bagels so, has wow, a ton of bagels. points at the moment. Yeah. And if the standings are about the same as you got the, the round before, the comeback is going to be very difficult. Right, mm -hmm. if all the same people are getting first, all the same people are getting last. So Violet and Katarba did tie for second, and they're both already out. Okay. So, okay, so yeah. there's a chance then. Yeah, so I think I they mean, will be pretty close, except for Bagels, because Kyogre uh, did bottom half and is now top half. Same with Fangar. Fangar did last and is now still alive. Essentially going to be a scramble for the fourth place, maybe third place slot. Yeah, yeah I think at the, I think at the price. very top it's just bagels, and then at the bottom, uh, Lightmare. But everyone else seems to be in the middle of the pack. Everyone's cheering for uh, Kyogre's downfall here because believers will get paid out. Oh, is that what the, is that what the bet is for? Yeah. Is if oh, no, the bet is if someone has one heart. heart. Oh, I see. <laughs> They're all hoping Kyogre <laughs> bails on one. I would never cheer on your downfall, Kyogre. That's messed up. <laughs> he has told me before that sometimes it gets to him. Being like one of the well-known pro players, people always expect you to win. And so the second you take like a small L, it's like a huge deal. Tangle's That's out true. here. Tangle is out. Only one out. No one else Fourth lost. Place, though, great spot. And TNT How did, I guess there's a draw. So Tangle is right at the middle of the pack. Tangle got fifth place last time and now got fourth place. So not a bad place to be. Consistency. <laughs> All right. Can Kyogre shop? stay with two hearts? I mean, yeah, yeah. The Ostrich Salt. Let's see. Ostrich Salt is great against the Hippo. Uh, it's killing the Walrus either way. Freeze the whole damn shop. Yo, this is what I like to see. For those who don't know, on the Eggy channel, this is called the Ice Age Strategy. This is a classic. <laughs> One year ago, I learned how to do this, and I haven't stopped since. I learned how to do this. <laughs> <laughs> well, how do you do it? Because he has an ostrich, not because he can't make decisions. Well, 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 what are you saying, Cody? I'm saying this is a strategical move. The Ice Age strat, really, it's a pro gamer move. You want to understand, you know? The surprise mm -hmm. of a shop is too much to handle. It's better you just know what you have. <laughs> yeah. I really want to see this round. ostrich oh. one-shot this hippo. Oh, yeah. He's g Oh, Kai's going to hunt for something next round. All right, let's see the hippo. Oh, it's the tar. Still may have one-shot it anyways. I don't think <gasps> the tar does too, too much, does it? Oh, the hippo's big. The, hip <gasps> the break point. Oh, the spawn in. Yeah, Fangar does get a good... Uh, Placement against Kyogre. Who was Fingar just who was just knocked out? Fangar? Bagels. Or no, Bagels. Bagels, Fingar yeah. Oh, Fangar won against the clone. Or, excuse me. Um, we had a clone, I guess, get a win there as well. So Fingar mm -hmm. beat both teams in that round. Oh. Yeah. 
Looks like, you know, Kai is a, a gamer of the people. Everyone enjoy your cash monies. Those who prayed for his downfall, you've got it. <laughs> I think this is all going to come down to the placement of this hippo. If Kyogre can get a kill with the ostrich or whatever the dodo hits onto the hippo, I think it's over. I think the teams are pretty mm -hmm. evenly matched, though. I, I mean, if, if, I'm, if I'm Bagels, I'm baiting that salt. For sure. No, Bagels is out. Fangar. Oh, sorry, Fangar. Yeah. If I'm Fangar, I'm baiting that salt. But Very I'm big for Fangar as well as Kyogre, though, because they got 8th place and 6th place, and now they're top 2. The soft ice. Wow. Does the soft ice get it done? Is it enough? Trying to get maximum value for that pita with the, the chili. So I yeah, think that pita could be great. Team. I didn't even realize the pita chili combo from the other team. That's so smart. All right, does Kyogre get it done? Where is the hippo at? The hippo's in the very back. That's a hungry, the hungry chili, hippo. The chili is very good as well. And then the double damage from the ostrich. Sheesh. Ah, oh, positioning diff there. GG's Kyogre. That's one of the really fun Kai. things to watch these guys do at the at the top end is the positioning is it, it, there's an entire other game in there that I think a lot of people don't even realize. Could that you was... imagine how different SAP would be if the positioning was shown in real time? <laughs> no, that'd be crazy. <laughs> <laughs> like with oh, TFT, you, you can spectate them yeah. and see where they're moving. Yeah, exactly. If they go really fast. <laughs> Oh, I would hate it. <laughs> I mean, I think Komodo then would get more play. Just leave it up to the other uh, guy. Make a chance. <laughs> yeah, right? <sighs> well, congratulations, believers, on that one. It was close. And uh, it was almost a 50 50 prediction, too. It was. And he honestly lost. Kai lost his, like, second life. Pretty, pretty close towards the end. So yeah, right kept people the on end. the edge of their seats, clenching their butt cheeks, holding onto their pants. You know, the huge. Mm-hmm. Start All another right. prediction. What's the top prizes, by the way? Uh, have you mentioned this in the chat? Uh, yeah, so first place is 250 uh, US. Jeez. And is this Scooty Cash, too? The this is, yeah, this stream is sponsored by me. <laughs> wow. Let's go. Can we get a round of applause for our sponsors, please, chat? Bunch of pogs, please. Sponsor twitch.tv slash scooty s k double o double t i e. Don't Thank forget you. to drop your Twitch Prime. <laughs> and then uh, second place is one twenty five, and then third and fourth uh, both get seventy five. Nice of you to give fourth place anything. Yeah, yeah. well, I, then the third and fourth don't have to play each other, so they just <laughs> they both get the same <laughs> cash prize. <laughs> and then we're on the a time crunch a here. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna add up some uh, some points here. I think it's going to be Doing pretty close. Thinking. I think Bagels has a pretty commanding lead, though. Yeah, Two Bagels. good showings back mm -hmm. to back. Kyogre getting first is huge, though. Mm -hmm. Fangar gets a decent amount. Let's see. While Skates is doing some math, I don't have as many player fun facts as Gavin does. Gavin actually did his homework, but I do have animal fun facts that I have crowdsourced from a lot of the community members ahead of time because I was like, I barely know how to play this game, so I might as well give you guys some some cool facts on animals. Uh, the first one is that camels actually store the majority of their blood supply um, throughout their bodies, and that's what holds the water, not the humps. Oh, fun facts, common very fun fact. Yeah, second fun fact. Moths actually typically don't have a mouth. They just kind of exist. They have proboscis, right? No, they just don't eat. What? They yeah. Just, they just don't get hungry. <laughs> one, of my chatters, one of my chatters put it as their purpose is to fly, frick, and die. Um, so there you go. Moth fun facts. <laughs> All right. Here are the standings. Uh, bagels commanding lead in 14. Kyogre and Violet both have 11. Katarba has 10. Tangled 9, Fangar 8, Damon 7, and then Lightmare has 3. So, still a chance for everyone to make it, probably except for Lightmare. But Lightmare, already having the trophy hat, wants to let someone else get a chance at it. No. Gatekeepers. Very selfless. 
gatekeep it, Lightmare. There's no shame in that. I think you should get a double. Honestly, if you win the hat, I mean, it's up to you, but I would rock a double trophy hat proudly. We're also waiting for one more. I don't know who we're waiting for. If you guys... Damon? Damon, yes. Damon? Damon. Yeah. And Damon does so still have a uh, shot. <laughs> of course. All right, I guess if I have to step in, I will. No. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, Damon's the person that was at work as well. Yeah. Oh, yes. maybe Damon. Oh, man. No. Uh, I mean, maybe Damon's not able to make Damon it. Damon be fired either from the tourney or from their work. <laughs> tourney um, for being late, work for being... Let's see if... Oh, Damon is in. Damon go. is not getting fired today. Or maybe is Let's getting go. fired Ford's today. Fired. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to be so the okay, title gonna... of the YouTube video. <laughs> when they when they win first place, they will need work anymore. <laughs> Big leagues Dude. after that. All that scooty cash funding mm -hmm. their retirement stonks. <laughs> All right, let's get it going. Wrong thing again. Uh, here we go. What would be the worst thing to spend two hundred and fifty dollars of your money on, Scooty? Which hypothetically, sounds... um, one hundred and twenty-five months of Super Auto Pets Plus. It'll last you the next oh! ten years. You can have all the new backgrounds and upgrades that you want. That's not I the, said the worst. Oh, sorry. Like that. That's the best. You said that in I, thought, I thought you said the best. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you said the best. Oh no. <laughs> He's a no, 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 no. No, no, no. Scooty's gonna cancel. <laughs> this is the oh, last God. time they work with this <laughs> Oh no. Start up the dome keeper again, big man. <laughs> <laughs> Dome Keeper co-ops coming out soon. <laughs> pivot, pivot. Played up, played up uh, on consoles is coming out soon. I've got options. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> this is the first and last Scooty tournament. You've heard it here. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, worst. Right, uh, the lobby looking? Worst thing? I don't know. I know what the best thing is. I died a little looking? bit there. No team was watching. <laughs> <laughs> Crungle. <laughs> what are the odds Kyogre goes for a uh, Bison Andy play? If they freeze that mm. edge, it's Bison Andy. I think you do it. Oh, no. They do not. They're in better than that. I, I, oh, Marmoset, Marmoset is the best. I do like one. Marmoset. Mm. I don't know about best, but it is good. Pretty what? good if you go for the higher tier. Well, you do another tournament, it. Scoots. Uh, I guess we'll see uh, what Team Wood thinks of me now. <laughs> 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 Team Wood's crying in the club. Wiping <laughs> their tears with dollar bills. <laughs> Second best combination, level two ant, early ox. That's a free, yeah. like, three rounds. I mean, you, mouse you is good here. You know you're winning. I do like the mouse. There is monkey. Does anyone go for caterpillar here? Kadi, do you Which think Caterpillar is strong in uh, these lobbies? See, a lot of people take it uh, just to hold it, and like it's a free tier up. Free tier and ups. It's it's kind of like a it's a tier up, and it's sort of like a goldfish where because it levels up, you get more set, you get more money back later. Yeah, that is fair. Um, we do have without, frog swaps as well. It works really well with jellyfish as well. Um, mm. but you don't, you don't see much of that. We do have mm. Mantis Ox again. We do have That's Baboon. Pack of Scorpion we have too. Scorpion, yeah, we have Baboon. And no Melon. No Gosh. Melon, that is scary. I, I love the, uh, Stingray. Stingray is fantastic for plus six, yeah. plus six. Scaling from the Polar Bear. Some people with five hearts might commit to it. Really excited to see if anyone goes Octo. Octo is one of my favorite plays. It's just so satisfying to see it just beat up the other team, especially if you juice it up enough. Um, it's not as oppressive as it was, but it's still a really, really good late game pet. Mm -hmm. Which pet were you talking about? Octopus. Octopus. Oh yeah, Octopus. I mean, yeah, there. if people have a lot of hearts, there's T-Rex that can just make everything go off. T-Rex, Leopard... Mm -hmm. Cobra. You have monkey you also have for scaling, board. scorpion. How are you missing uh, ribbons on this account, Scoots? Uh, hard mode. These are hard mode ribbons. <laughs> oh, okay, got yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How yeah, are yeah. you missing hard mode ribbons <laughs> on this? <laughs> you have mantis, ban uh, banana as well. 
Oh. So we'll see a lot of monkeys. And the eggplant, finally. And this is a group that knows how to use Mm -hmm. the eggplant. So we'll see some, hopefully some really fun. uh, This is set up for some really fun late game. Pivots, maneuvers, tech. Gavin, if you do see, I have a hard mode ribbon on the frigate bird, which should count for something. (laughs) Uh, That does actually, yeah, that is pretty impressive. I don't even think I have the normal forget bird. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not keeping that guy on my team long enough. Oh man, the pug is so good here. Kyogre has also seen, I think, enough ants for a level three. I wonder if anyone's gonna go for a bison. Maybe they're too uh... good to uh, consider the bison. <laughs> bison bison Andy's a classic. Bison Andy though doesn't win an eight-person pro lobby, in my opinion. I think you get bested at the end with too much utility. Unless you win you... really early. So why did you teach me to bison Andy when I took sap lessons from you? Because <laughs> there will be a day where that we fight against each other in sap, and I need to know I have the upper hand. Oh, oh my god, the sabotage. <laughs> this kid. I'm playing the long the game, Scooty. Or, or, Aggie. The audacity. <laughs> oh, I love the lizard here. I know you love the lizard, Cotty. Mm-hmm. Going double lizard for Lightmare probably keeps him alive for a second. Lizard changing so that it uh, triggers that tail no matter what has made it mm-hmm. quite like quite good in terms of tempo. yeah. Same with Liz- like lizard camel, of- a lot of that stuff. Yep, I think that was one of the best changes team would made to the game to open up to so many other animals, mm. like guaranteeing uh, effects. Made camel way better. It made uh, saber tooth too good. It's saber tooth is the most like dominant in terms of um in terms of a meta uh saber tooth is just an auto buy on pack three and you'll you'll see it put out there uh whatever it shows up in these in these lobbies as well yeah making rhino work on faint as well a lot of that stuff too mm-hmm. Ooh, and saber tooth we have luckily not seen any saber tooths yet especially saber tooth mushroom or saber tooth uh, bell pepper, I think, is a crazy mm-hmm. six gold combo. So only one ox frozen for Kyogre. Is this a bug or? Okay. Oh, there we go. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> he got there. Let's see. So who are we? Who's close to the chopping block? Basically, everybody has a good chance. Bagels is the only one that has a pretty commanding lead that will probably make it no matter what. But everyone else, second through seventh, are within four points of each other. That tear almost went insane on mm-hmm. that te- on the team. I was holding my breath. Does Kyogre commit to the level up here? No, just waits for both of them for next turn. Freezing a Kakumba, but for who? Maybe the pug. Oh, there That's you really good. Oh, and then Cupcake Juicy. just to win the now? Why not? I think you might just cucumber, yeah. Take this cucumber. Mm-hmm. Nice. That's probably the better play. <laughs> 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 I just... <laughs> I can't listen, resist. Listen, Gavin, this isn't the content creation team, okay? <laughs> this is what pros do. Yeah, they're fighting for their life out here. Their honor. Their honor, absolutely. I think the... I think the winners from the content side do stand a very decent chance against the pros. Cotty, Noob, Sub, and Sag all are very, very good. Oh, all the content creators play in lobbies regularly with the pros. So, you know, it's it's all a very small community. Yeah. Yeah. Right? So to give perspective, uh, Subbo is not like, even though he's on the content creator side, he is one of those names that gets thrown around with Kai and Bagels yes. he's the top player overall. Mm-hmm. Um, so he's really all we've done is overfill the uh, the sweat team all the way over into the content creator team. Um, <laughs> Sub is incredibly good at this game. That is true. In the early days, me and Sub used to compete for the, uh, the world record of Super Auto Pets against each other. <laughs> really? Uh-huh. Aww. Cute. And Akron, but Akron has retired. Some OGs. Mm-hmm. Let's see what these level ups are. Polar bear <laughs> on Please. on four hearts. Do you commit to it? <laughs> get rid of that moth. Get the uh, polar bear. Goes. Please get the polar bear. 
kill the moth over the ant there? That's I guess he the the attack is really at a premium here. It's pretty hard to come by. Mm -hmm. Who's the best unit that polar bear could cook for Kyogre? Turn seven. I like that ant eater, honestly. Um, the best thing to cook though would be. Uh, I think monkey or moose, monkey. just to pivot. Because I, I think with Kyogre's current situation, if you go polar bear, you can probably go T-Rex, so you can't be scaling the tier four. Oh, Doesn't go polar bear, though. <gasps> just wants to I go really for the tempo. I really heartbroken. this lion to come out, but um, I guess because you, you're you taking a, another tier five, you can't take a yeah. lion. And I think this pack is so top-heavy. There's like mm -hmm. not much scaling for the lion to work with, except for maybe the praying mantis. Because then the baboon won't work because you won't have tier sixes. I am a little surprised at that uh, polar bear skip with four lives. I'm pretty also, what do you think of the slug not being in front of the ox? I guess the anteater oh. ant gets enough attack. Yeah, I think this the slug anteater is, is a better place. I agree. I think this slug. Fingers chili kind of may be good here. Tar. It's really. Uh, Making his life pretty difficult. There is a 16 16 golden coming out, but the anteater will break the melon and the kangaroo will be strong enough to survive. Oh no. Very close. Yikes. Ty bleeding a couple of lives here. Oh, light. When did Lightmare get out? Did Lightmare uh -oh. just lose? No. Oh, no, light. Just lost with the praying mantis. Damon right. going praying mantis as well. Oh, yeah, Lightmare had the double lizard. Dang, GG's Lightmare. We have an Ox uh, Shark team from TNGL. That's not looking too bad. Two hearts makes it a little scary. But oh, from got Tangle here? Yeah. Gotta risk it for the biscuit sometimes. Oh, Tangle, obviously. Oh, that. What did you say? TNGL. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, I love the Hercules Beetle and Polar Bear on four hearts. Another strong team from Debbie. Scooty said, if they have a polar bear, we're watching. We are watching. <laughs> They're cooking a wombat <laughs> to copy the anteater or Niala. I mean, um, Hog did win with the wombat in the uh, community tournament. The it's wombat did prove. Maneuver, I believe. Anything is possible. What does a wombat do again? It copies the highest uh, tier opponent faint. So Ooh, we'll be copying sweet. a bunch of Nialas because I assume a lot of people will be playing it. Let's see. Damon can probably survive here with this polar bear. Such good yeah. value there. Oh nice. my goodness. Awesome break. Tangle is down to one. Very clean. And then the wombat is getting boosted up. Another polar bear, Another polar bear. on four <laughs> hearts. Do you commit it's to the Jover. wombat? It's Jover. <laughs> it's so Jover. <laughs> Sell the beetle from here. The uh, only I mean, you don't even really need mantis. Yeah. I actually think mantis will hinder the team. So oh no, mantis you don't go double. Go. I guess you. Gonna go for a level up. He's Another yeah, monkey. He's, space. he's gonna greed. He's gonna greed. Um, polar bear, the gonna... polar bear, and then maybe get yeah. it level two. There is Another no chocolate mantis. though. No, I think mantis is oh. bait. You have to let it go. Use it for tempo. I love the the, the double monkey though. He's mm. just gonna keep printing monkeys. <laughs> printing them. <laughs> Tangle probably sells this goldfish here. My only thing, I, I still think Praying Mantis is so easy to counter in the later rounds. Mm -hmm. It does give you good tempo, but there's just so like little that you can do. Oh, let's go. Okay. And you're playing a, a man down, basically, too. In mm -hmm. the late game against someone with a really great five squad, it's up uphill battle. I do think with the double polar bear, yeah, the Mantis is... Saying goodbye next turn, probably. Oh. How good will the chili be? Not as good as it has been. Shark's getting bigger, but I don't think it'll be enough. No, I think... The bagel's board has gotten a lot good. bigger. Jeez. Even without the mantis. 
Uh, lethal check? Anyone close to getting out? Uh, still Tangle and Damon. Mm. Or Damon went down. Tangle was at one. Damon has gone down to one. Kyogre at three. Kyogre, the first scorpion that we've seen. He's a scorp scammer. No shame, no shame. <laughs> <laughs> Statting up the sauropod seems great. Oh. And then committing okay. for the T-Rex. Getting rid of the ox, enough. committing for T-Rex seems really good. And Bagels has not been scaling the ox, so is definitely looking for the T-Rex line. I think. Mm -hmm. And no one else is really going for it yet. Damon's also scaling a monkey, but probably can't get rid of this mantis because it's so big. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's going to have level 2 monkey as well this coming turn. So, good pivot out. I think Bagels may be able to take this. You guys ever hear the theory that if you put an infinite amount of monkeys in a room with an infinite amount of time and an infinite amount of typewriters, they will eventually write all the works of Shakespeare? Gavin, are you okay? <laughs> no, it's a thing. I mean, yeah. it may, I, I believe it. <laughs> you guys believe it? I don't know if I believe it. Yeah. I That's a lot of time. It. It's like those, what is it called? Like the infinite possibilities. So one of them is bound to happen. Oh, everybody's still and there's four people on lethal. That's so scary. T-Rex hit for Katarba. Yeah, the keyword is infinite. Uh, oh. Long time. Yeah, that is a long time. <laughs> I just find it preposterous. Ooh, level up the monkey. Oh, level two monkey. Oh, yeah, Bagels is going to get this. Ox is out of here Wait. for the octopus. Why not grow the gorilla instead of the um, octopus? I think you could do either. Right? Mosquitoes. Or not mosquitoes, uh the scorpion. It's hmm. The octopus. Like you I, I would think that he likes the end game ability to potentially snipe out stuff. There's not a ton of uh there's not melon, is there? There is not melon. Just tomato. But I think a girl is a totally oxes? fine choice. Yeah. I do like the flashlight with Mosasaurus here from Kyogre. Showing his pack two main. Damon, uh, hopefully getting a level two octopus to show up. Let's go, Octo Gaming. Someone said the wiki article is funny. One of the monkeys pooped on the typewriter. So if the typewriter gotta, breaks gotta, in that infinite amount of time, then it well, can no longer there's be. An infinite, there's infinite typewriter. Oh, there's okay. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Can Damon stay alive? I think Damon can, yeah. Very big praying mantis. Oh, no. Who was knocked out? Tangle and Katarba. Of all the teams, who's got the um, biggest unit right now? I think that Praying Mantis. I'll check in one second. Yeah, this 33 Praying Mantis is really yeah, big. It's ginormous. Dropping but... in a 16-16 octopus is gross. Oh, and then you're going to stat the Cobra as well. Tasty. Still no T Rex though, which is kind of sad. I don't know if you care about a T Rex that much anymore. I think you still take it over the ox, right? Oh. Maybe not. Everybody's so low health. Maybe the. And then do you care about leopard out, over right? cobra here? I like. I, I, think I, I, yeah, like I, I get better. Yeah, I get leopard too because it's the same round anyways. You might as well just freeze leopard. You know what? Freeze Leopard, and then Leopard can come in instead of Ox. Oh, everybody has Octopus now. Mm -hmm. Let's go. I manifested it. We love to I must see have been it. Wrong. They must, these pros must know something about the Octopus that I'm missing here. Well, like Cody said, there is, there so is there is the Scorpion in the pack that everyone's threatening. Right. And everyone an is scared in. of. And also, no one has Eggplanted yet, but I guess there's no super good uh, lineups that people are scared of for the Eggplant. Mm. We'll see, against Kyogre. Kyogre does have the ox, but the octopus is able so to go off a lot. <gasps> Pops a melon. Oh, that's yep. a big doggo. Bagels is too Bagels strong. Bagels is looking so strong. Anybody out? Nobody out. <laughs> it's going to be like a Everybody's on one except for <laughs> Bagels. Oh, man. I'm just imagining those scenes in animes where like people are fighting and they just cross punch each other at the same time. 
Oh, yeah. All right. Going for the scorpion on the final round. Oh, he's doing it. I feel like so many people are going to bring out this scorpion. Easy tomato scorpion. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Because the scorpion's good against every team. Get sniped against these octopuses. Well, if it's, so. fr if it's frontline, I think frontline scorpion's great for every single one here. Hmm. I'm surprised that we aren't seeing more scorpions. I know. Uh, out of the other teams. Kyogre had one, but immediately pivoted. Damon has one, and now Bagels has one. Scorpions almost feels like a like a party trick. You get one or two rounds with it, then you need to. Then everyone's clued in. Then it's like a coin toss on where it's being exactly. placed. Normally, I'd agree because if you have counters for it, like if you can get melon or you can like get equipment. Um, sniper mm. or something, but there's not many <gasps> responses to it in this pack. Fangar oh, gets it tomato. as well. Watch that tomato. Oh, I mean, Bagels is too strong here. Dang. Maybe? That's... Yeah, Bagels Wait, is still too close. strong. No, no, never mind. It was interesting, though. They did see that the frontline scorp was coming on, so, you know, you gotta Let's see a little see. scorpion kiss. Fangar, Fangar and Damon drop out. So, very big for Kyogre. Staying alive. Mm. With the very poor placement in the first game. I think this may be close. Because Violet was also, I think, somewhat low. And Bagel's just further uh, getting their lead. So it's probably going to be Bagel's versus Sag. Bagels versus Seg. That's a hard matchup Good for both of them. <laughs> yeah. I just gently cried. I saw that there was an opportunity for a level 2 sorrow. Not that that's the most important thing you should be shopping for, but it was definitely something I would want. <laughs> <laughs> the base stats of a sorrow are always so tempting. Makes it very easy to slot in. Mm -hmm. Also, interesting question. Since we saw so many, you know, octopuses on the board do you guys say octopi or octopuses you don't want to know what i say <laughs> Octopuses. it's octopi no! <laughs> i believe <laughs> <laughs> i snorted i hate you all Ooh, the eggplant oh. against the scorpion for an incredible actually destroyed yeah yeah that was incredible value this I think Violet Is may be worth? able to get the win here. Violet's yeah. out, though. Coconut did. Oh, Violet loses to Kyogre? <gasps> oh, that's so sad for Violet. Dang. The switcheroo was pretty spicy. Oh. That, and Violet just... That's a really strong play. I think that was great, because I don't think Kyogre can beat uh, Bagels here. So Violet just basically helping Kyogre out. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm looks like uh kai has gone and gotten i'm assuming stinky sock yeah the stinky um, sock is good it'll be really big here. but it may be out um, there was only one turn left on it that was last True. turn yeah yeah didn't find it it seems no sock oh that's yeah i was going for the level tough. two i think kai just digged like yeah i was digging for the level two no eggplant purchase either sad mm -hmm. that eggplant from violet was very, very good. It was good content. Maybe they are content creators at heart. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Violet is absolutely, or Violet Citizen is one to absolutely uh, go for base lines. They have a hard time resisting, you know, your anything hedgehog related or mm -hmm. there's just really, they'll go for the fun stuff that presents themselves. Okay, very good trade for Kyogre Value. here. The melon could play a big part. Doesn't uh, kill though. That, that break point super super yep. unfortunate. Thirty one right, twenty eight well, not even used. Kyogre Jeez. gets second. Awesome. Awesome lobby. Bagels in top form today. Bagels yep. got first, third, and first. Ooh. Dang, top three every time. Turn Very favorite? commanding. Oh my gosh. So bagel versus egg. That's gonna be scary. That's gonna be really fun All to right, watch. Alright, let's count up the points. 
We'll see if there's any ties. I think it'll be close in the uh, third and fourth sections. Yeah. Oh, those lobbies in general were, were down to one heart for everyone. Except, mm -hmm. except for the first. That was it. Absolutely. Like, very, very tight race. Which, I mean, a phenomenal job picking the uh, players. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank and you. And thank you, Gotti. Very humble. <laughs> awesome round. Let's see. Huh? These are close. Chat Bagels is definitely in. Mm -hmm. This is going to mean, chat, after this, uh, we're going into the 1v1s. First round is a best of one. So all everything is out there. You win, you move on to, to the best of threes. So if you guys enjoy high stakes 1v1s, that's on the way. Mm, some juicy gambas coming in as well. <laughs> oh, some really good gambas. Cotty, you're about to enter the fighting ring once again. Are you nervous at all? Or are you just hyped? <laughs> all right. So uh, there is a tie. So oh. the highest placement. Rumble, the tie is between Fangar and Katarba for fourth Ooh. with 13 Whoa. points. And let's Wait, see. Katarba's highest placement, uh, sixth, sixth, and second. And then Fangar's highest placement was fourth, second, and eighth. Oof. So that means that... Um, what is it? That might just be a tiebreaker because they both got second. Yeah, 1v1. So it's Fangar versus Katarba. Interesting. Play out. Playoff game, let's go. Playoff We're playing game. game. Playoff game. All right. Someone asked Katarba's for a point in flip. chat to call the 1v1. <laughs> Where's Fengar? Because I did not. I said the tiebreaker of the tiebreaker would be how many hearts they had, but I no one was actually looking at that. I was just assuming it wouldn't happen. <laughs> uh, they were actually like bang on uh, matched scoots, so. <laughs> yep. All right. Well, I will set it up. They have to do a 1v1, but they're playing chess, not Super Auto Pets. <laughs> Imagine. What was it? You said. Uh, Katarba was the one that was the former Fortnite? Or who was it? Who was the uh, Yeah, Katarba. All right, Fortnite 1v1. <laughs> <laughs> Katarba gets the upper hand. When are we going to have a Super Auto Pets boxing event? And is there anyone who weighs like 120 pounds that I could just absolutely... <laughs> wait, I, wait, Gavin, that's me. <laughs> Aggie, uh, I'm so sorry. This must be the worst matchup of your life. No, I, I told someone because someone's like, Eggy, can you fight Kelby? Because we tend to banter a lot. I was like, you know, Kelby might be six foot and I might be five foot five, but I would throw hands, no rolls. I would just go feral, probably hang onto his arm like a koala and take a good chomp. Like a so street fighter. Yeah, there ain't no rules. That's some Kimbo <laughs> slice action, right? He was a street fighter and then joined uh, UFC and then on to WWE. That would be you. You should you should look up a, uh, like a picture of Kimbo Slice. I highly doubt you and him have much in common. You know what? I'm excited <laughs> to make uh, my fighting ring debut as a VTuber with no arms or legs. Uh, I'm so ready to throw limbs. <laughs> nice. All right. The code for the tiebreaker uh, for Katarba and Fangar is up. Ooh, spicy. Oh, here we go. Run a prediction on this too. So they are fighting for their... Wow, they have to do a 1v1 just to play more 1v1s. Uh, yes. <laughs> you... <laughs> this is some Saw-like activities, Scooty. The thing is, I don't think they're even mad about it. These homies grind stop for like nine hours a day. <laughs> like, this is just a regular day for them. <laughs> I'd That's say the love point. of the game, but the hate of the game. Love the game. How many uh, are playing ranked in between these rounds, Cotty? I got no idea. Are you playing ranked right now? <laughs> I, I am not. I am <laughs> sitting here staring at a blank wall. Okay. <laughs> Cody, are you slouching right now? Uh, a little bit. Interesting. Cody, I heard a fun fact about you is that you recently exploded some watermelons. I did. Oh. I did. All right. Here's the um, tiebreaker. Oh, and this is for who plays is, me, right? Yes, this is for who gets to play Cody. 
Oh, you're getting like in good information. Yeah, you can write down go, some notes Cody. here, Cody. Yeah. I mean, I'm loving the bird squad though, right off the start. Mm -hmm. The bluebird blue is are good. Another tier one. That's super good. Yeah. Showing me in there. <laughs> Let's see what I will just wait. Let's see what they got. Let's go to do Papa. Yeah, I will update the bottom text. Hopefully this round starts. Are there actually bluebirds that blue in real life, or is that made up? No, they're pretty. Twitter. They're pretty blue. That blue? Oh, we missed the first fight. What? They tied. Oh. Okay, perfect. Both going bluebirds though. Triple bluebird chinchilla. Anytime you can get bluebird or pill bug, um, you usually want to take it. Uh, the early scaling is just king. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've been a fan of bluebirds for uh, for a long time. I think they've gotten a little less good with the change to how they distribute their stats, but that was a positive change. So in the past, they would always send stats to the right, but now random. Uh, Bluebird rooster meta was uh, oppressive. <laughs> and leopard. Bluebird, yeah. That was oppressive. I mean, it's any time a tier one lasts until turn eleven, uh, it probably needs a nerf. Um, actually, it was to the there. left, not to the right. Um, actually, well, actually it, was, it was it was it was it was the very left. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> um, actually, let's see how's this how's this pack looking? Still, no strawberries for the shoe bill. No jerboa that actually works with anything yet. We do have musk ox with the mantis, which we haven't seen yet. That's really strong. That is really mm -hmm. strong. No bananas, but you do have a natural monkey. Mm -hmm. Natural monkey. Natural monkey, as opposed <laughs> to what? <laughs> One that summons out of a banana. <laughs> a Neuralink monkey, straight from the Tesla Labs. Oh my gosh, Elon, right is natty. that you? <laughs> there is swordfish uh, with pepper. I don't know if that's ever worth going. Does uh, use the catfish oh, ever? Dog. That dog's good. Catfish is really hard to run in comp because, uh, like, by the time you Ooh. get to tier six, it's usually. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Going I for like the garlic. The snail. Yeah, this. I mean, you're hoping to lose, delicious. but this is not losing. This is too good. I just love the snail. Yo, Team Wood, if you're listening, if you ever release Sap. Plushies, I would definitely buy a snail. It's my emotional support snail. Oh, that's yeah. Plushies just got to be there. They've got to get in on that. I would mm -hmm. love to have uh, a clown clownfish plushie, maybe. Uh, that'd be so cute to see you hold it during stream. <laughs> Even with it going Tell to me. tier four, are you still going to like it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or they should make. Just a dromedary blanket. <laughs> Just a purple blanket. <laughs> that would be cute, That'd be kind of cute, though. Whoa, guys, we're giving out crazy ideas here. Hold on, hold on. Uh... <laughs> Yo, Team Wood, if you need someone to help with product marketing, call <laughs> your favorite SAP streamers up. We got ideas. <laughs> so, I guess Guitar was just committing to the snail, even though they've won the past two rounds. Oh, they're going to keep winning, too. They're very strong here. This panda could be good. The giraffe is great for Fengar as well early. That giraffe bluebird is just really strong. Also, it's Cherry Katara. in the front, though. Yeah. Am I crazy? That's not going to work. Oh, yeah. There we go. Ah, oh, okay, okay. They spotted it. <laughs> they probably so lose this round because the dog doesn't have any stats. Yep. It does I get mean... a stat from the golden, but... And in losing one round for two hearts, I guess total of six hearts. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I think worth. they're fine with losing this. And they're primarily holding on. I mean, the snails for the their ability, but also just holding on to or having a chance at a tear up next turn seems pretty big. You would have liked to have seen a third snail be found in shop somewhere. Mm -hmm. mm. That's a big giraffe. I was about to say, she quite Tengar healthy. is getting huge. We're going to see some really big units here. Oh, yeah, because these snails are going to scale. Lobster mm. could be good to pivot stuff. 
Una langosta. Is rabbit good here? <laughs> there, no. There's <laughs> lettuce. I mean, well, lettuce. You have, yeah, lettuce. You have lettuce, hot dog. Shrimp. Not bad. The stoat sells great. Ooh, oh, not bad. Do they keep the I owl, though? Owl. Level two owl, maybe. Imagine they I'm hit it. Oh, owl. Owl's a bit different, right? It's uh, a little funky. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, you got it. Yeah, go on. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, he summons. He summons at the start of the turn. Yeah, right, yeah, yeah, right. yeah, there you go, there you go. <laughs> Free dog trigger. Uh -huh. Thanks for leaving me out there high and dry, guys. No, no, you got it. You got it right. You figured you it out. I, yeah, I, I believed in so you. Nice. I didn't, I didn't want to give you a shortcut. You're a big boy. Oh, this giraffe's going to be big. If they can level up the giraffe, and they're also cooking with the dromedary a little bit. It's interesting to see two snail teams up against each other. It is. I love it. <laughs> they're just going to keep trading wins back and forth and then both be unlethal. Mm -hmm. Man, if... You had old snail and uh, waffle. You would almost oh. like, consider not. <laughs> like, it's like, man, I don't know if I want to win this round. <laughs> Going for the wasp. That is interesting. interesting. Oh, the toad oh, helps a lot. I'm just looking for any force multiplier, I guess. Mm -hmm. And you got the bluebird to help help support it some. Is That's there fine. pepper? There is. is okay. Then I, I think wasp is a pretty decent grab there. I'm not a huge fan of it, but I would imagine they probably just aren't either. Desperate looking for what Any level ups? Up. Yeah. But Are I guess the they do get the going? garlic. <gasps> I don't think they take yeah. it yet. I think you probably forego the mouse and just keep the snail on board. Or just Whoa. commit. Because then you get the scaling again next turn. Because mm -hmm. you probably lose because you got rid of the bluebird. I don't know. Isn't the dog that... with the garlic could do something. Yeah. <sighs> oh, nice. Look at you. I think you have to commit for one of these. I mean, I, it's maybe the owl. I, I would. Yeah, because then you get an extra gold from the the level two mouse. Yeah. Seal. And then don't keep any of. I the sea lion. Sea lion's good. Oh. You can't you can't go praying mantis with an owl because then you're going like three squad. <laughs> and then sometimes the owl pops the mouse out behind, so you might kill the owl. I'm definitely locking the sea lion personally. Mm -hmm. I th yeah, I think sea I lion's pretty good. They didn't freeze though. They can kind of counter or... out the health from the snail. Yeah, they didn't freeze. I really think the snail level up is more important. Like, I, I don't even think sea lion's gonna matter after the snail level up. Honestly, like. It's going to spit out something awesome. Oh, so close. Oof. That toad is good. They lost for the snail stats, of course. Tactical, yeah. And now they get a tier 5, and they can they still get this level 2 mouse, which is good. They're, okay, snapping turtle. Not the game-changing that... unit we wanted, <laughs> but it's what we get. Um, you know, actually, the snapping turtle going into that uh, wasp is kind of spicy. Mm. It yeah. is getting a fair amount of HP on it, but being able, that'll give you a good shot at cracking that pepper. Pie's great. Hey, Manta Ray's good to pair with the owl as well. Yeah, let go of that snail now. I kind of like the cheese on the snapping turtle. Mm -hmm. Or you're just rolling. Yeah. Are we taking the snail all the way to the end? Is he here for the long uh, ride? Um, I think the snail goes next turn no matter what, potentially. If if like with the manta ray being frozen, I think the snail's going next turn, even if you win or lose. Man, so long, partner. I do like the cowboy hat selection. The cowboy hat is good. <laughs> so cute on the snail, especially. I love him. <laughs> Oh, this wasp is getting way too strong, though. And they're gonna have the flashlight in two turns. They're get, they're get, they're running away with it a little bit here. Yeah. The Five hearts, hard three in a row. The Ooh. snapping turtle too. Oh, yep. We're frozen. Ding uh -oh. dong, team wood, team wood. <laughs> Help us out here. 
The spectator's been pretty good so far today. Haven't been too many True. bugs, which is good. This is Fangar's POV now. Yep, now we're back to Fangar. Yeah, this flashlight's going to be great. The wasp is just going to get even stronger. Cheese on the toad. Double links. Tempting. There's no waffle, yeah. so you're not... I guess you can just get rid of Stingray. I guess really hoping for the level giraffe? 2 wasp. I think so. This like giraffe is yeah, huge. In a 1v1? For sure. Do you go wasp first? Yeah. Yeah, just to get the flashlight. Make sure mm -hmm. that's hitting the wasp. If you flashlight the bluebird, I think that's such a misplay because you eventually do... You I don't know. Oh, Flashlighting what? wasp seems like overkill. Wasp is killing... like Because next turn, wasp is going to get nine more attack. It's probably right. one-shotting no matter what. Have no HP, though. Yeah. But if you have two... Oh. Oh. Fangar <laughs> loses that one. <laughs> uh, no, it was it was uh, Katarba. Oh, wow. It's weird when you rejoin the fight just instantly ends. That is a pretty beefy team. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think I think Fangar lives? just wins. Here's that five life win now. Great event you put on your Scooty. Oh, thank you. It was a lot of fun. All right, so Cody, it looks like you're going to be going up against Fangar. How do you feel? Spooky. They're all spooky. All these gamers uh, know what they're doing. So I mean, I'm just going to have to... I, I mean, do think the, well, the the well, best I mean, of one will uh, make things a little risky. Yeah, that I, it. Yeah, the the best of one is definitely one of the uh, scarier parts about it. Just you know, if you low roll, it's uh, your toast. That's the thing is like uh, even Sag was talking about how he was low rolling super badly, and it just was you know a pit of despair. Well, you know, th this format is one of the things you got to test people on is their ability to just hit when it matters, you know? That, I don't that know. I think sad. whoever came up with this format really dropped the ball. <laughs> <I'm just messing. laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> really inconsiderate. No. Oh, they're going for the Wasp against... They might just not... I, I mean, they, I think they still win no matter what. I think these units are just too large. Ooh, oh, that weakness was really good. Oh, GG. disgusting! GG's G Fangar. Oh the first 5-0. Woohoo! That was very commanding. That's, I mean, that's a great sign, because Fangar uh, was really struggling in the big lobbies, but show him, get him to the 1v1s, and maybe things change. Mm. And I think this is something a lot of casual SAT players don't realize, but the play style between a large lobby player and a 1v1 player is super different. Mm -hmm. So someone yep. could be good at one, but not the other. Rue. All right. I'm going to fill out this bracket here. All right. And guys, so sorry. I have to step away now from the casting, but I'll be watching from hey. the chat and seeing everything that goes on. Thank you, you for joining, Gavin. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Good luck with the rest of the tourney. I hope that you guys all win your predictions, and I hope that people have a good time. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye, Gavin. See you, Gavin. There he goes. All right. Well, anyone that has been knocked out or is currently not playing, because, like, Kata, you can still comment when you're not in these rounds. But if anyone wants to join, what is it? The waiting room. I can drag people up. All right, so the first round, it's going to be Bagels against Sag. It seems. Hold up, Bracket's almost here. He's cooking, he's cooking. While he's cooking, I got more animal fun facts for y'all. <laughs> Everyone get excited. Oh, baby. So Gavin mentioned he really likes bluebirds. The bluebird genus contains three species, and the bluest one is the Western North American bluebird, or known as the mountain bluebird. Fun facts for you all there. <laughs> all so right, here's the... the chat. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here's the bracket. Bagel sag is game one in the top left. And then it'll be... 
Kyogre versus Sub, Violet versus Noob, and then Fangar versus Kadi. And these will all be best of ones. Kyogre Sub is going to be... That's a strong that's first round. A lot of fun. Yeah. Yeah, these are some good matchups. I mean, yeah. I mean, everyone from these top eight is insanely good. So all of them are... All right, let's see. Best of ones. Yeah, Cody, how do you feel about your side of the bracket? The left side it's seems scary. The left side. <laughs> I'm glad I'm on the right side. <laughs> Seeding does play a part here because Bagels and Kyogre, uh, two of the favorites, do get first and second seed. So, you getting first seed is good for you. Getting. Having Bagels, Sag, Kai, and Sub in a situation where only one of them can make it out is yeah, yeah. You only have to. You only best case scenario. You only have to worry about one of them. Yeah, that's true. But I mean, I, I have to make it past the winner, Violet and Noob Skills, and I mean they are very, very good at their. That own is right. true, so and you have to beat Fangar. But luckily, I'm, the finals and the semifinals will be best ofs, or maybe unluckily. I don't know which one you prefer. Uh. I don't know if I, you think I, you're the underdog. I guess in, if you're the underdog, you want best of ones. Yeah. Um, I I think I, I like best of five or seven for mm -hmm. these. Five or seven? That's so many. Yeah. <laughs> best of three will be... Is that is that what's next? Is that the finals? Or best finals best finals is best of five. Semifinals okay. is best ah. of three, yeah. Best of five is typically a good number. If you're a casual Andy like I am, and you're like, why are they saying best of five and seven is best? Uh, <laughs> typical statistics, the larger the sample size, the more accurate your results will be. <laughs> All right, round one is going to be uh, Bagel uh, versus Super Auto Gaming. Violet, shouldn't bracket be changed? Why should the bracket be changed, Violet? Hmm. It's the it's not one seed versus one seed. Oh, did I drop? Hmm. Oh no, my messages aren't sending. Uh oh. I can't send the code name. Uh, wait, wait. I can, I can, we got you. Here, yeah. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, yeah, yeah, you see it. Yeah, just send it in general. Hi, everyone. It's me, emergency tech support. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it's not letting me either. Wait, is it going through? Yo, what? Is having one and two seed from each group on the same side intentional? Uh, yeah. Yeah, Kyogre, because technically, like, the, the two seed is Kadi, because Kadi is the one seed from the other side. If that makes sense. So like three Maybe. seed is uh like bagel is one seed, Cotty's two seed, Kyogre's three seed. And then Noob is four. Is the is the pack not showing? I can't send a message either. Okay. Uh Sag or Bagels, can you get in waiting room and then I can drag you in here and you can see what the code is? Or I guess both of you. <laughs> what kind of gaslight gatekeep girl boss move is this? <laughs> <laughs> wait why can't i drag sag up in here what is going on Cotty, can oh, you wait, where you where you where oh there we go oh thank god <laughs> okay there you go there's your code i'll dm hey, kyogre the code yeah discord seems to be or not kyogre bagels okay so Ag did eggy send it oh yeah eggy did send it all right good luck sag okay okay put me out be free. Good luck. There he goes. Gone with the wind. Even if Bagels is one, Kati to me, Noob four, should it be one versus four, two versus three? Well, no, it's one versus eight. Because Sag is eight. Two is Kati and Fangar is seven. Three is Kyogre, six is Sub. And then Noob is... Four violets five. Or other way around. Yeah, it's right. It's right. Nice. For the second round. 
Uh, yes. Yeah, it should be... Yeah, because Kadi is... Oh, sorry, you're saying Kyogre and Sub should be swapped with Violet and Noob. I disagree. <laughs> <laughs> you're right. Yeah, you're right, Kyogre. All right, these are going over here. Yeah, no, I think that's right. Well, this just oh, nice. got significantly harder. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think I think, now, that, I think that makes sense, right? Because yeah, two because bagels should have the easiest run, so bagels should be against uh, the number four seed from their own pool. Yeah, that is fair. Okay, and then I'm gonna drag. Uh, I think Damon's chilling. Oh, Damon nope, is no nope, longer. Nope, gone. Damon gave up. <laughs> boss found him in the closet playing Cape Pets. He's been found out. <laughs> yeah, Damon can be whispering. All right, these are best of ones, so good luck to Sag as well as Bagels. Mm -hmm. We got oh. some good football lined up today. <laughs> <laughs> and by football, I mean Super Auto Pets. Uh-huh. The best kind of sport. All right, we're in. Super Auto Gaming versus Bagels. We have some Kiwis, but no Strawberries. We do That's have the Yak Koala. You. Prediction, yeah, I can run a prediction. I do like the little honk honk noise the goose makes. I, I do like the sound design of Super Auto Pets, honestly. Like the sound of the snacks munching, the little cute animal noises. I they are pretty good. Fun. Yeah. Two squatted. Interesting. Oh, someone's found a double fish. Oh, Damon's work has uh, caught up with them. <laughs> <gasps> no. <laughs> no, they, they just said out. thanks for hosting. Aw, sweet. I do like the fish, fish start. Fish. Mm -hmm. There's some good tier threes as well. Clownfish could be great. We haven't seen a clownfish yet at all today. People already saying Sag is throwing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> the crowd is cruel. There is no mercy <laughs> throwing, for Sag. throwing on turn two. <laughs> what was his uh, first shot for him to end up two squatted? I don't know. I think Oh, it was it was double kiwi in the shop after the first oh, roll. Oh, that's reasonable then. Yeah, I think that's fair. Hopefully hitting the duck and fish or either of the level ups. Stork is also good. Yeah, Bagels has a great fish start. Taking a stork, I approve of this. Good summon. Stork is super strong. Late game. Now do, now do we take the yak? <laughs> oh, Damon is in the waiting room. Now I can drag Damon in. There he is. He's free from work. <laughs> Hashtag not fired. Cotty, uh, Quagsar said, if you win the whole thing, they're giving a thousand subs. I don't know if they're saying to me or to you, <laughs> but either <laughs> either way, there's a lot on the line. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good deal. <laughs> secure the dubs. All I have to do is beat a lot of very 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 good super out of pets players in succession you could beat them or you could bribe them oh i think i think sag had some unlucky rolls and i think bagels has some very good rolls here oh no sag's rolling luck has not been very good this tournament no sag is really like didn't hit a level up at all on turn three Bagels hits the camel, which is really strong. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Just rolling. Going for all the level ups on turn five. Hopefully we get some of the animals we're looking for. Next turn is extremely make or break for Sag. Yep. This is where <laughs> the best of one does uh, play a big part. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I forgot this is a best of one. Juicy. <gasps> a camel. Camel and the Hedgehog. Oof. 
All I right. Think camel hedgehog is something that people like to do for style points, but oftentimes it is worth it. Zag really needs something good here. Not hitting the no. level ups. No. I feel so bad for him. This is so tough. God is cruel. There's the fish. There we go. Orangutan chameleon. There's no real held oh, food. Like can into a camel board too. Not oh super yeah. Helpful. But what are you wanting here? You're wanting maybe microbe. Hawk could be good. There's not really a ton of great tier fours either way. Let's take a parrot. I, I think Hawk and uh, Anteater are needed here to just to stem the bleeding. Mm -hmm. But you're really looking for a pet to give you some kind of direction. And he just mm -hmm. has not. These ain't it. He is going to go orangutan. Yeah. And then guarantee hit the stork with it. I think that's a reasonable line. You got to get a couple uh, couple more big tier ups. Mm -hmm. Quick. Hitting tier. clown could have been good as well for keeping some of the tier ones. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I think, yeah, I don't think Sag can kill this camel. Yeah, I think Stork has to go in the front. Depends what the Stork summons, we can see. Oh, and the garlic on the camel. Yeah, punching through this camel. <gasps> like, that's that's the, the game con for right now. Now does Sag tank one more round and dig for the tier six or tier fives? <laughs> I don't know what beats this camel here. I think it's it's microbe. Yeah, I mean I think microbe hawk could maybe do something, but hawk still isn't that strong. Probably isn't gonna survive to the that. stake if he can't have an answer to the camel. There's no meat. Anteater is kind of good here. Anteater with Wait. the parrot. That's actually really strong, I think. I, I like I like parrot mm -hmm. parrot anteater a yeah. lot here. Nice. It is unfortunate that, th that you're running this into a camel board, mm -hmm. but there's only so much you can do. Getting the duck stats uh, is also really important here because now you uh, both your parrot and your anteater survive the hedgehog at level one at least. Mm -hmm. Yeah, one lone camel probably beats everything here. <laughs> yeah. Do you hold the lollipop <laughs> to try and get a high attack unit that can kill the camel? That's a smart line. I didn't. I didn't yeah, I was. Uh, I was muted. I was. I was saying that. I think. Oh. Uh, <laughs> how's it going, Damon? Oh, I'm in front. Hey, how you guys doing? Thanks for hosting, Scooby. How's work going? <laughs> uh, well, it's, it's now over. Oh, okay, that's good. Ooh, wait, that was a great hit. I don't know if that's. That urchin's a crazy hit. Oh, it's close. So close. That urchin was really oh, no. good, though. Okay, yeah, I think you buy every pie you see is sag. Pie is very good to stabilize, stop the bleeding. Essentially a little band-aid. Oh, going for more summons. <laughs> and then pie the stork, maybe? I'm surprised you don't I think you I think you buy the pie so you open up more slots for pie. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think that's correct, yeah. Part of me really for? wanted another I don't... parrot. There was there was already another parrot. Sag. Lee might be the answer, however. It's not over. I guess you get the level two anteater next turn. You definitely have to buy the... Oh, you gotta buy the pie. Yeah. No, the money, the stonks. Oh, I don't, I don't even know what, I don't, I don't I don't even know what, what he wants here. Probably doom rolling. Because like, uh, yeah, I think, I think your outs are flea, a bunch of pies, and then you have the pair anteater. Because flea would have been great. Yeah, flea would have been pretty good. Oh, and oh, then the hawk. Ugly. It doesn't help that uh, this stork keeps spitting out units with like one attack. Yeah. The stork did hit the sea urchin that one round, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, he was just. This is a massacre. Oh, no. People are saying he was just straight up looking for a uh, microbe. Ah. Uh, mm. I, I mean, I microbe is good, but rolling. I. Mark, Mike Robo skipping please. Okay, turkey. Yeah. Turkey could do something. You just go turkey banana or turkey pie. I like turkey pie. Sag does not like the pie. You need pie to try to pie pies? over this hawk. 
so you're not losing all your anteaters, I think. Yeah. The man is panic rolling. He missed the flea. Hmm. I think a lot of people also, if you're not into the competitive scene, there is such thing as actually like a mental boom similar to FPS gains where sometimes if you're just not hitting, you kind of start slowly giving up and the strats sometimes just aren't as clean anymore. I think the hawk is yeah, going to ruin sag here. Yeah, I don't like the front down. orangutan. I would have liked to put it further back to eat a hawk. Mm -hmm. However, maybe it's fine. The hawk, the hawk numbers were great there, at least. <laughs> but I still, I mean, it may be enough to survive at least one round. Mm -hmm. Actually, yeah, I think he went. Yeah, he does. Right? Yeah, through here for sure. Yo, uh, this is the comeback. Oh, the one house. But now you need to. Yeah, you definitely pie your turkey or your parrot. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I mean, once they get level two hawk. Yeah. Everyone's cheering for a good comeback. For Lemon Mercy. maybe Lemon makes sense huge. against Hawk. I like this Eagle, I think, the most. Yeah, Eagle. Because, yeah, Eagle gets the stats immediately. Combine mm -hmm. combine the parrots. Uh-huh. It also lets... It's a good unit to run in the front. Um, and you can try and bait the Hawk snipe. I think you, yeah. Yeah, you stack these parrots, go... Because Bagels probably uh, gets level... Hopefully... Four bagels gets a level up on either of these or both of these. Yeah, I think your best out is combined parrots by eagle by the one mm. next one. That, I th now that I, I think that's just a misplay. I think you yeah. Get stats from yeah, because if you combine parrot, you get the double stat on the eagle in the shop. Mhm. Mm and then oh, does no, it go double turkey? Goes second, double right? on the ant eater. I think the double turkey was good. I don't know. I, I, think yeah, I, I just... completely agree with you. Does turkey Double have a limited number of triggers similar to fly? Uh, no. Okay. Okay. I, I mean, beats out the leopard easily here. I think Bagels, bagels is just playing for the monkey still. play, though. Mm -hmm. I think Bagels is just letting Sag get a couple wins. Yeah. Yeah, because it's going to... they're Yeah, just going to stat the parrot a ton, and then the parrot's going to copy the leopard. Mm-hmm. And is there any way to Fine. prevent it? There is melon... To prevent yeah, this Mel parrot. Level two is great there. Do you combine parrot by mammoth or slug or just wait? I feel like I would wait. I don't think you need the tempo. Mm -hmm. Really? Be winning this fight. So maybe just roll for parrot level. Yeah, having level two turkey with so many summons is quite nice. Mm -hmm. I think right now you got to know what your end game looks like now and you need to start digging for it because bagels has given you a couple of turns with going front parrot i yeah. think you're hoping for orca and you're just you're wanting melon on everything because i don't know if i think eventually lemon won't be good enough going for the oh, mammoth it seems combined? i think that's fine is there pill there no, is not no i think i like slug think... better than mammoth here yeah, I agree. Yeah, Mammoth Popcorn eventually, maybe, but yeah, Slug might just be better. Copying the Eagle over the Ant. Uh, I'd have to see the Tier 6s, but I can see that being better. Okay, now Parrot's behind the Leopard. Okay, a couple of losses for the units. Still survives. Oh. <laughs> Very nice. This is getting Let's scary. Sag. I think if I'm Bagels, I think I just... I think I would have kept scaling the parrot. I guess Bagels thought uh -huh. they had a win there. Mm -hmm. It's close. Yeah. Scaling the leopard is almost as good as scaling the parrot, at least. It's not yeah. like you're scaling like an irrelevant unit. That's fair. The gap between them getting smaller and smaller. There are some... I guess the two or three, like pretty decent tier sixes, hit off the eagle. You have mammoth, orca, and warthog. Which I guess warthog probably doesn't mm -hmm. do a ton, except for level two it's maybe. Also, um, to be fair, it's also better against the leopards. Like if a parrot gets sniped, you lose an anteater summon. Whereas if you're copying this eagle, you're always getting your summon up. But that is true. Ooh, I, you can just push for level two mammoth. Yeah. Oh, it's, like it's a mammoth popcorn. would be very strong. 
Mm hmm. It sucks SAG didn't grab that flea. I think SAG could potentially be at two here if SAG like had the, the weakness on that camel early. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Man, that camel got Bagels so many free wins. Mm hmm. I think SAG's just and hoping just Bagels one. doesn't get the level up here on the monkey. Level two monkey would be tough. Still never hit the level two hawk as well. Still no level up on the monkey or the hawk. Dang, they're hunting. Fort hogs, nice spawn. The double ants kicking in once again. SAG is still alive. Oh my goodness. That's crazy. SAG wins this game, I'll be very impressed. I, I mean, I think... Let's go look at Bagels. I think Bagels is just, like, trying to find these level-ups. Mm. Swaps <laughs> like for the, the snake time. here. Uh, dropped... Oh, just gave up on the monkey. Go for the got a lemon. Yeah, trying to go for more snipes to get rid of this turkey. Mm -hmm. Do you ever just put the hawk in the very back, try and just put everything into this turkey? Or no, because uh, the turkey... I, the thing is, back hawk is just completely... Unless you mean, like, parroting the hawk, and then, like, going back parrot. Yeah. Well, the hawk now has Where? the thing where if there's not a slot, then it's fine. Yeah. I think you're still just losing the epic... Like, you're all you're doing is absorbing a lemon trigger. Yeah. Yeah, I don't... Uh, maybe you probably, you probably can't overwhelm this lemon. Mm -mm. Yeah, that's why I'm not a huge fan of the snake. It is trying the back snake. hawk, though. So, hits one on the lemon, potentially hits the lemon with the leopard. But then the parrot is copying the snake now. A lot of potential. I think copying the snake isn't the right move. I agree. I think you really need to copy the hawk or the leopard. Lemon's right. huge there. Level two mammoth. The snake is doing a lot, though. That snake hit oh, the turkey. Oh, it keeps hitting the turkey. Oh, my. Hit the, the turkey turkey's a Connor. Oh. Oh, no. The backline yeah. hawk does take the lemon. That, I mean, that snake was great. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I take back all my snakes. <laughs> yeah, I, I, go, I, I think I man. saw Chatter Equi be a big fan of the snake. Equi called it. GG sag. sag. Yeah, 07 to Sag. That was close, though. Yeah. That was very, very close. Sag almost brought it back. Good pivots. Yeah, well played by by uh, both parties, I'd say. It is really, really tough to be on lethal against players like Bagels. Yeah, Bagels just probably finds it. Finds a win somehow. Oh, he finds it fun. <laughs> All right, so Bagels has moved on. And now it's going to be Violet versus Noob. Ooh. I'm actually quite excited for this matchup. I am too. Um, People are saying Sag's turkey has a secret blueberry. <laughs> 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 yeah, I, Sag, we'll let Sag have some uh, things to say. I think we actually did really oh. well. Hey, I'm Sag. Come oh, hey. That was close. <laughs> I, I think I think being on lethal is tough there, but that was very, very close. You almost had to come back. You did really the, good. The early rounds were so bad for me. Yeah, I, I think... I don't know if you were watching, but my first two rolls were all Kiwi. Yeah, uh, they were. Kiwi, but Kiwi, it was just Strawberry Pets. I think the, the, the main thing maybe is, I don't know if you uh, unintentionally missed that flea. I think that flea could I have did, got you I a did. round or two. Literally, as soon... I, I was already tilted. Mm -hmm. And as soon as I passed it, it tilted me even more because I was like, I just saw flea because I was hard rolling for Microbe. Yeah, that's what a lot of the chatters were pointing out in order to try to take down the camel was, and stuff. That was the only thing that I, the, my only out, because yeah. double garlic, I, I was like, I need microbe here, and that's my only chance, and I didn't find it. Oh, no. That, uh, camel, that sea urchin almost got you that round, too. It was close. That sea urchin was nice. But very well played. Yeah, Seth. very well played. Yeah, very well played. <laughs> I think the so snake shots were unlucky, but you were on lethal ball. for four rounds wow. in a row. <laughs> so I, I think the whole thing got unlucky for me. Yeah, I think <laughs> Bagels was just gonna hit one of those times with the snipes. Yeah, when when he pivoted his team, I was like, he's just gonna try to outscale me, and like I can't do anything except try to protect myself as much as possible with lemon. I was looking for just a bunch of uh, what's it? 
uh, popcorns. There we go. Mm -hmm. Popcorn or lemon? There, I didn't see a single melon either, so I didn't have like a free block there. Mm -hmm. Oh god, it, that was rough. I was racking my brain. You did good surviving for so long, though. You were very creative there. <laughs> All right, there's the code for the next match. But I think this should be a very interesting match. We have two very well-respected uh, comp players that both haven't really had tournament, like great tournament success yet. But mm -hmm. everybody knows that they're both very good. So mm -hmm. Very excited for this. Yeah, I think it should be good. I think people are all hoping for the uh, Bagels versus Kyogre finals. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm looking for the Cotty versus Violet Citizen finals. That's, that's what I'm I mean, apparently there's a thousand subs going Cotty's way <laughs> from someone. Yeah, guys, probably, talk about probably, this? probably, <laughs> probably not a, a true statement, but I think the oh, Kyogre well, sub will on. be great too. Yeah, Kai sub will be an amazing match as always. Mm, looks like we got one player in waiting for Yep, we have Violet looking for okay. Noob. Do we have Noob, noob is skills? in. There we go. All right. Oh, let me uh give it to the bagels for the prediction. I'll start another one. Very nice. Also, someone was asking for another animal fun fact. Fun do you fact, have another one? The... <laughs> I do. I'm just Googling things on the fly, but that's okay. I have a master's degree in... Uh, oh, wait, I can't curse. Um, fluffing it. But uh, <laughs> a hoopoo bird is actually named after the sound it makes, similar to a cuckoo bird. So it's an onomatopoeia, fun facts. There you go. <laughs> All right, we're in. Are... You're welcome. I'm doing my best. <laughs> Ooh, we have seen Mongoose once before. We see have seen, scorpion. yeah, we see a score. We have every, seen Rhino, but no one went Rhino. Every time I see a leech in a random pack, I get excited. Oh, that no damn! Have... Which uh, was that? Was that y'all's lobby, Damon? That was the elephant, camel, leech, or was no, that? Oh, that was ours. Oh, that was <laughs> <got> freaking pine. <laughs> yeah, that was not. Zach, that, that was that was huge that you got fourth though. You crawled back. Crawled back just to lose it all. <laughs> yeah, and, no, that... and then it wasn't even like a free. It wasn't even free there. I had to like try to crawl my way to not getting six would <laughs> Yeah, that leech camel game was ridiculous. That all three were in there. There's no I appreciated it camel because I hit. Yeah, no camel. I always like going early possum but there doesn't seem to be great hits here in the tier I threes see parrot stego parrot stego is gonna go crazy parrot stego is gonna be really good we, ha we there hasn't been a stego at all yet oh running out of time here oh these uh the spectate is always off oh okay, yeah violet's okay, fine <laughs> there is leech pita bread hedges is right big oh, brain that's such a cool line That's close. All right, both back up to six. Okay, great level up on here. Let's see, what are you looking for? Musk ox with pill. Yeah, I think you gotta grab it. Are there any great things to pill? Not really, but either way. Musk ox, you can kind of just pill anything on this tier. Yeah. Yeah, you definitely go musk ox. You just start pilling things like buy cricket and pill it, or pill your yeah, beaver. Yeah, I think if you pill this opossum, maybe. Yeah, I guess there. Yeah, there aren't really good hits until tier four, mm -mm. which you're probably not waiting on. And you want to get this musk ox going as soon as possible. Facts. I could see you waiting until you get a level two potentially. Just goes ahead and sells it for the cricket stats and is not going to pill the cricket. I guess just buys the pig. Interesting. Pills something next turn. I feel so bad for all these strawberry pets that keep getting pulled into this random pack and will never be used. <laughs> Me too. The kiwi strawberry did get used. 
One round, I think. Yeah, it did get used. Uh, the first round, the very first round yeah. for the creators. Oh, there is hope. <laughs> I was really hoping for Strawberry in my 1v1. It would have been great. The Jerboa will finally work as well, hopefully. <laughs> I hope. We have a Muskox here. here. Both players hit Muskox. Oh, they did hit Muskox? Juicy. With the Cricket as well. Well, you, hit, you, you find the cricket you're looking for. Yeah, I'm fine with just maybe pilling stuff and holding the cricket. I think you buy this guinea pig and pill one of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree. And then just put the cricket in another slot. Mm -hmm. Oh, there goes a guinea pig getting pilled. Muskox feels so good. It sucks there's no beta fish or um, blob. Mm -hmm. No Mantis either. Oh yeah, no Mantis. Oh. Guinea pig. Can you freeze this guinea. So you get two I level ups. Yeah, I guess you do. Yeah. Good. Risky. We'll see how it pans out. The front guinea is interesting. Yeah, I don't know if it's, like, intentionally trying to counter anything. Or if it's just there to be there. He's yeah. there for the vibes. It's Noob also noisy. gets the guinea. <laughs> yeah, yeah so he's got it in the back. <laughs> Noob is definitely a guinea enjoyer. <laughs> Aren't so we all? Does Violet go for the level up and then, I guess, maybe... I guess you can buy the guinea on top of the other it's... one and still get the level up. Yeah. It's pretty tough to... All right, we're, we we're bugging bug? out, yeah. Uh-oh. Maybe we can go over to Ping Noob. Pong. We'll see what they get. I, yeah, I think the spectate doesn't like guinea pig. Oh, really? <laughs> it it made my everywhere. spectate crash one time. Huh. Oh, almost so level two on the muskox, too. Sacrificed. Sacrificing the guineas one at a time. No. It's a slaughter out here. Ooh, Ooh that is good. It. Oh, that's a great oh, shot. He's hitting as well. I like the collective ooh just then. It was a juicy <laughs> <one>. <laughs> Not having like consistency and stuff, just hit hitting those level twos is really strong. Tell me about it. <laughs> you did you, you did get lucky. Bagels missed that level two hawk for so many turns. And really? level two monkey. Yeah, didn't have level two hawk or level two monkey for so long. And then I think I gave up on the word. Early deer's good. I also like the falcon. Mm. Yeah, I think this falcon is just gonna win it. Yep. And Violet has Violet the earlier really lasagna long. getting set up. Do you commit to this level up, or do you wait to see if you have a pill before you commit to it? Oh, I take it for sure. I would commit. I would. I would just wait, but I don't hate taking the level up now. I would wait till turn seven. I, I think mean, if, you... if you find a pill, maybe you can <gasps> buy a pill. Yeah, I have, like, so here you I'm happy avocado. with just avocado. Yeah. Fresh avocado. Avocado take a loss. <laughs> Could always garlic. I misunderstood what turn we're on. I would hold the level. <laughs> <laughs> I also thought it was turns. But, uh, All the turns are blurring together. <laughs> I realized when they asked it should be fine. I feel like I would cricket and then guinea pig to oh, tank the uh, the chili hit. I like that. Mm. Yeah, I like that. And then you freeze the pill here. Freeze Stor or Stilton pill. Let's see if they... Nope. They're just gonna... I guess garlic mm. tanking the chili is not terrible. But I would just sack back, that. Back musk ox gets another trigger from the dog. So it's kind of... Oh, yeah. Over the guinea pig. Immediately. Will the falcon yeah. win the round? It mm -hmm. actually might. No, it draws the round. Oh, <laughs> That's <laughs> close. Who hated on Bag? I think Bag Muskox wins that. 
Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> uh, so, uh, you're being I don't think so because uh, the the three threes are better than the one one, and the two two. Oh, oh, are you going double vulture? Oh my lord! Oh man! With cricket and the stilt. So, I forget. So if you buy this vulture and then pill this, does it carry over, or is vulture one of the pets that it doesn't carry over? I think vulture think says in battle. You can't actually look at their abilities in the spectate mode, but. <laughs> I think it's okay. oh, here it is. Them, yeah. Oh, so it doesn't say in battle, but I don't know if it carry carries over. I, I don't think yeah. it carries over. I think it's I'm one of those weird ones. Where, yeah, like, like some Secretary will, Bird. Yeah, Secretary Bird will carry over, but Vulture does. No, I don't. I don't think it does. It used to. Did they change that? I know for a fact it used to. You could like pill in shop, and then it would be one on two. If anyone knows, it's Freets. Let's see, this deer is still very strong. They're both, oh, five to four. Have they drawn a lot? Oh, yeah, I guess they have. Yep. They had drawn Kelby last round. That it used to. What did Kelby say? Oh, well, Kelby says it used to. Somebody else okay. does not. Oh, that's a big musk ox, my lord. Oh, oh my the God. vultures. Oh, <laughs> oh man. When I say there's nothing in this world as satisfying as like a double vulture or like a double bear. Mm. Like that. Oh, whoever was playing the uh, the fly catcher that one round, that was that very satisfying. Oh. Yeah. Um, what are our tier sixes looking like? Uh, Stego was the main thing. Mongoose could be good. I don't think bear, I don't think there's enough summons for the bear. Mm. Yep, yeah, Mongoose and Stego is huge. Yeah, I think Mongoose Stego. Maybe with Falcon Bear. Ah, that's true. If you get like a Stego hit on it. And there are actually a like a ton of held foods to where Elephant Seal on turn nine might seem worth it. But maybe not. I don't know. I guess if like Noob keeps up the hearts, Elephant Seal could be really strong. I love the avocado. Go double avocado. Right. Maybe, yeah. You sell still another avocado. Because <laughs> <laughs> Noob oh, could still win be. this. Violet's keeping yeah, yeah. the bus. Eh. I love that. Because Violet I mean, yeah, fed uh, the tier... lasagna to the bus. It's a tier one to scale with Poodle. That's uh, better. Than oh yeah, cricket. yeah. Probably getting rid of the cricket soon. My cricket's already gone. Ooh, another bus on Ooh. the way. Here we go. It's going to be tough to take down this uh, muskox, though. Yep. Mm -hmm. So the big lad. With the poodle. Now I think Violet is uh, in the lead quite a bit right now. but mm -hmm. Unless Noob problems. can make something happen with this 16 gold. I don't hate... Just the double lasagna on this muskox. A I lot don't... of stats. Double monkey buff. I don't I mean, hate it. Nothing, I love it. <laughs> nothing to, you know, not tall scale, right? Like, there's no score, no skunk. Nothing to, like, really punish building a gigantic unit. Could get your own deer. Playing deer and a falcon um, can really... Like, that's, that always scares well, me. Deer. Mm hmm I guess yeah, Frontier probably isn't going to do... Maybe they're just going to pill bus. the deer, combine the buses. <laughs> <laughs> Does Violet get the level 2 bus win and turn? <laughs> Bug Vulture. Ever heard of that one? No. <laughs> I guess I not. I guess about not. That in high school. That's not. That was my, uh, my senior thesis. <laughs> Scorpion ever? Oh, so there is a scorpion. There, there is, is a scorpion. scorpion. Yeah, there is a scorpion. Then. Scamming. Let the scamming commence. Oh, no. He's just gonna rolling. Fight with honor. Trying no to find, scamming. I guess, a vulture for the next turn. I'm going to say with 16 gold, that was not the best turn. No. <laughs> that was a lot of rolls. That was a mm. lot of rolls. Oh, two buses out on the field. Oh, Violet, my goat. Oh, it's not enough. Uh oh, that was a really bad turn for Noob. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. And Noob's holding Puppy. Maybe trying oh, to get the level two. I don't think that's worth it. 
And there's no chocolate either. The ox is big. Ooh, fresh I mean, I lasagna. guess you, you take puppy for the... Uh, Pillow? Picture, maybe? I don't know. The weakness? Yeah. It's just so easy to position around. It's still quite valuable, though. Do yeah, they go weakness or do there. they go... Yeah. I would go weakness, yeah. He's he's losing. I don't think he can afford lasagna. Too expensive. Makes the first enemy weak, okay. I guess that would be good if it's... Yeah, the bus. Get rid of the chili. I mean, it's, it's pretty good into anything that Violet would run front. I, mean, I think Noob should go scorpion, scorpion there. Mm -hmm. He should be freezing them at the very least. Yeah. You can go level 2 Vulture. Buying Rhino, Rhino just for one turn. <laughs> it's probably triceratops. triceratops, yeah. Or, oh, oh. Just taking a loss. Like taking. Like okay. Just full committing. Don't like, worry you know about it. You're not going to win this round. Yeah, get max value. Like, what is buying a triceratops really going to do for you there, you know? Getting rid of the chili is so satisfying. Oh, that falcon. Oh, that falcon's uh, so frustrating uh, to deal with. It is. All right. Can Noob bring it back against the falcon? Gets the level up on the vulture. Uh, I mean, Stego is just going to be fantastic for whoever can find it. Mm. I think you buy I, I, I think you got to buy the scorpion. It's just a free trade onto the bus. It's well, so see, the weird part about Scorpion now is now that you have this toilet paper, are they going to run a big unit up front? So you'd have to go Scorpion, like, you know, third or fourth, something yeah. like that. And then it's weird into the chili. They still do have the monkey, so they're they're going to be prioritizing the front line with at least something. Yeah, I really yeah. like Scorpion Bop here, I think. I don't I think I like, like Bop. I don't like Bop. Dude. I don't really? like Bop. Yeah, it's I don't think slow. I like The stilt is gone. <laughs> They're going Bird of Paradise. Okay, well. it's. It, I think this is way too slow here. Are you on two hearts? I agree. And then I you gotta buy the scorpion. The steak is good, though. I like the steak. I do like the steak. I think yeah. you go front scorpion. Mm. Yeah, start scaling the scorp. Yeah. You aren't scared of the chili for one round, at least. Well, I don't know. Front front monkey seems uh, pretty good here, because it should take out the bus, and then scorp would clean up muskox mm -hmm. if Violet didn't change anything. But... Could easily happen because they know toilet paper's there. Oh, you know what's going to be sick? Uh, if Scorpion kills the Falcon and the Falcon spawns a Scorpion and kills <laughs> That's the why I, I, I hate this Scorpion in slot two. Ooh, yeah. and then the chili Butter. kills it. <gasps> no! Wow. Yeah, that is. There he goes. That's tough. A little Scorp champ. He didn't right. survive. Let's see. Level up. No guaranteed level up on anything. Maybe the poodle just for scaling. Another steak could be good. Hill bop. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't like the bird of paradise there. I don't. I don't think I like it either. It just doesn't really uh, do anything. Not a huge fan. I like, would have just. It's cheap. I would have risked uh, finding stegos. I didn't like two two right now. Maybe and you can't even take Stego now. Oh, yeah. N now you can't go Stego. I was talking about the round before. Mm. Oh, I don't know what they're yeah, looking for. Blocking yourself out of Stego here is kind of awkward. Yeah, because here, oh, what okay. do you do? Do you yeah, get rid of Scorpion? Yeah. Get rid of Monkey? I don't think you get rid of either. Maybe you get rid I of think Scorpion. You get rid of both. Both. Monkey and Bird. There's no way Monkey's doing anything. That 2 3 is pointless. You might as well hit it on like a falcon or something. Yeah. Um, well, I'm just saying. I think that the value of the stake is still like yeah. worth it potentially. Yeah. I think you get rid oh, of Scorp. Go Stego and then stake the Stego. Bop gets I hit. I like that. Goodbye. I thought he was going to stake the Bop for a second. <laughs> that would have been sad. That would have been sad. Bop for cold efficiency. Oh, Bob gets the boost in the front. I like but now Violet's Bio just going to change back because toilet paper's gone. Oh, oh Similar. No. Wait. Oh. 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 
Ooh, that was clean vulture. Noob skills hanging in there. Oh, this is gonna be close. Mm -hmm. Violet Just only has. Bob. Yeah, now you know, like swapping the scorpion for that dolphin probably wasn't intentional, but. <laughs> oh, I think the like, dolphin... like getting well. You mean like getting scorpion out of there before he? Yeah, got yeah. Dolphin the the in. dolphin was intentional. Yeah, yeah. I'm saying getting rid of scorpion was not intentional, like because of the dolphin. Yeah. Yeah I, uh, yeah, I think it just makes sense. You know, monkey with this steak is about as good as the scorpion. Has more health. Is there any... Mongoose could prove to be really good as well with a peanut. I don't love the monkey threes. No, because you just I want the good like tier sixes effort. now. Yeah. And you just, you just want to replace bot for anything that's good with stego hit. Yeah. You could even do Triceratops. Like, it, it's it's at least better for the turn. Yeah. But I, I think the mm. problem is it's getting shot a lot. So is that worth even buying? I even also don't steak? know if I like the Bell Pepper. What's what's one-shot? There's nothing that's one-shotting it. Yeah, I agree with that. Mm. Nice positioning. Mm hmm Oh! Oh, the monkey! Oh, <laughs> oh you hit a monkey! Oh, oh it was one one now. Let's see. It was it was three health. So what? Like, what are their odds? Oh, I can't look at all yeah, the stats. The I mean, Pood the poodles two would have beaten a poodle. Would have beaten a cockatoo. Cockatoo kills, right? Cockatoo is a two one. I think I could be wrong. Maybe is I'm it? wrong. Am I, am Poodle, I know, I know. Crazy? Poodle's a two-two. Mm -hmm. I thought cockatoo is a four-two. Oh, you could be right. Saying. Cockatoo is yeah, four-two. I, I think it is a four-two. Four-two. So monkey poodle is the only thing that wins there. So I think triceratops was always the play then, instead of having bot. Oh, here's right. the mongoose. You, you get don't two hits go out of mongoose. It. Okay, now uh -oh. you can just sell bot buy another stego. Yeah, for sure. Oh wait, never mind. It doesn't do stego that. doesn't work. Dude. You could still get rid of monkey. I, I still think there's the opportunity to get rid of monkey, but it's not going to happen. I don't know. I, I think double steak is probably better than steak. Was the double stack worth it? I feel like selling bop would have been better there. Is double stego better than the vulture? Is the vulture too good here? I don't know. Vulture's been going The hard. vulture has been going off. <laughs> but double hits from stego onto the bop or the stego hitting the other stego. I don't know. There are a lot of stakes to be thrown around. Ooh, what if Noob yeah. gets... Oh, what if there's Frontline Scorpion on the Muskox? That's so... <laughs> That'd be so That's so insane. scary. I don't think so. Oh, there's yeah. Peanut. It's Peanut. <gasps> it's Peanut. Oh. I actually what? screwed. Ooh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait? wait. Literally? No. What oh, HP? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh. Last peanut is so cheeky. Oh, I, no. I think you have to expect a peanut potentially for the front line. Yeah. Mongoose yeah. was there the whole time. Well played, that though. Seven. That Great was game. close. That was so Violet close. is still in it. Dang, NTNT. The pros are 2 and 0 oh at the moment. So crazy. Noob Skills is such a good player as Noob well. Noob is that a good was player. Like as a casual Andy, my brain was just like, there's such elite level thinking happening around me. <laughs> <laughs> I think that did come down to that peanut, 100%. Mm -hmm. noob, noob skills is a player that could have been put into either side of the bracket. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice. Great yeah. player. All right, well, this... The content creators have a shot here. It's Kyogre versus Sub. They match up. Congrats it is a match to Snakes on a plane, by the way, for winning the uh, uh, the team tour uh, this season. They just wrapped oh. up the uh, competitive scene. Nice. Oh. Hey, can I uh, can I say I'm getting toxic messages from people that were in this tournament? <laughs> Harbus said, "All all I'm thinking now is, thank God I I didn't get out before Damon." <laughs> <laughs> You gotta think. Whatever helps you sleep at night, you know? Hold on, I'll have a toxic one for you in a second. Yo, he's cooking? <laughs> please, please, no. Make a YouTube video about it. This Concept. Super Auto Pets player got out so fast. <laughs> <laughs> Quote-unquote bro. 
<laughs> All right, here's the code. Let's see what the predictions were percentage-wise. It was pretty... Oh, more people voted for Noob there. Really? Yeah, but Violet gets it done. All right, here, I'll show the bracket. Behind the scenes, we have some good interactions between the players going on, asking for the opponents to go easy on them. <laughs> <laughs> so it's going to be Bagels versus Violet in the semifinals. And the semifinals will be best of three. Sheesh. All right, Cody, who are you wanting to face? Sub or Kyogre? Uh, neither. <laughs> uh, I... I probably, I don't know, man. Um, Kai's been grinding really hard, but Sub is Sub is also just incredibly good. I'm just... Mm -hmm. uh, sub has been uh, playing less recently, though, right? Yeah. That's... Um, so Kai does have the practice, or the hours in. I want to face whoever loses the matchup. There you go. <laughs> A wise answer. Kai's, Kai's probably the most storied player here for the fact of... I mean, he's been considered one of the best as long as Fangar has, but been consistent one of the best. And then you have players like Bagels, who is like very widely considered either number one or number two, but he's a lot newer than Kai. All right. So, the best Kai of one is starting. Let me abandon real quick. How Man. cool is Bagels to the scene? Because for me, I've been in the scene for about a year, and I feel like they've just been here forever. <laughs> Bagels isn't new by any means, but uh, a lot newer than Kai. He's been around, uh, I would say Bagels has been around about a year now. Mm, I see, I see. Oh, and Noob, thank you for the raid, and good job. That was very close. Very well played. They're definitely coming down to the wire, and I expect another one here. Oh, this one's going to be so good. Yeah, mm -hmm. I do love the Moth start. Moth is way too strong. Very strong top end here with Mantis Shrimp, Octopus T-Rex, Mongoose for good plays. Still no Strawberry. Hey, these Strawberry Pets, Sag. <laughs> Noob said I chose everything <laughs> that would win except for a Front Peanut. <laughs> <laughs> Sub having to go for a Ladybug. I say I love Sub's background, that Halloween background. That new Halloween so background fast. is good. Mm. I am glad people respected my wishes and did not go cyberspace or cloud as a background today. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. Uh, I totally forgot that you even said that. I just went uh, with my favorite background. <laughs> I did as well. I, I mean, I assume those are not any of anyone's favorites, but didn't want to blind anyone. <laughs> this is a great start to hit the tier threes. Yeah, I'm loving this board. Blobfish yeah. Mantis. Hatching Chick Baboon. No, yeah. There's some really good tier threes as well here. This is a really good pack all together. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot going on here. Let's see, Kyogre does get the one health knocked off on sub. It always feels really bad when you're not on full hearts at turn three. Mm-hmm. I don't think I have been yet. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Baboon, what tier two are you wanting to hit? Mm. Dromedary Bat, bat. Lemur. I guess bat Lemur, you're not kidding. Yeah, it's got to be Bat. Oh, bring it, or the, bring the it, counter bring pick. I love it. I, it the I love the frigate bird here. I love it. I mean, it's honestly, it's just, it's a good body to buff. Oh, yeah. 2 5 yeah. becomes a 3 7. Yeah. Aren't they nerfing I, it to a 1 5? 1 5? Why? I, I think who, so, but I think it's asking for a frigate bird nerf. But it replaces the ailment <laughs> with a rice. Rice. <laughs> <laughs> that huh? so in, good. in battle does nothing. They had it where it replaced it with meat. I think they should have kept that. I liked the mm. meat change. Yeah, I agree. I mean, it's just so irrelevant as a unit right now. Oh, is, is Axolotl in this pack? <laughs> uh, ooh, rat. <laughs> the most I don't think I saw the little pink friend. Time. No, I did not. We have a rat versus frigate bird? What, did you, did you think <laughs> that was going to happen, Tony? No Axolotl. <laughs> not on my bingo card. 
This is the first skunk and blowfish we've seen as well, I think. Mm. Yeah, not many skunks at all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see, getting the garlic seems great. Probably just give it to the frigate bird. Immediately oh, going for the level up on turn four. Getting rewarded. I know. Mm -hmm. I feel like I wouldn't have done that. The tier threes are really good in this pack. That is true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think the tier threes are just better than the tier fours. You are happy yeah. with basically the, anything? The tier, the tier fours look really good too. They both look very enticing. Yeah. Especially the mantis with banana. You got banana tea as well. We're going to be mm. seeing monkeys. I, I I can feel it. I don't know. Kyogre Scorpion. seems like they're just trying to win like 6-0. Might not even <laughs> barely get to the tier fives. Double hit on yeah, frigate we're... bird. Oh, no. no it's, yeah, it's yeah still tier, tier twos. Two. When you have something as premium as a frigate board, bird on your board, are you really worried about monkeys? You know? Exactly. True. You're right. It is a you got the better monkey. 11 with garlic. Yeah. That is gross. The 10 1 Dodo. That, how, how did that happen? How is did there. This, in the creator <laughs> lobbies, he was using fried shrimp and he just made a really big Dodo and Dodo chained for a little bit. Yeah, there is fried shrimp. Mm -hmm. He's a shrimp. Oh he's my a goodness. Oh, wow. Kai just hits. Kai, Kai oh, just hits. Oh, man. What are you scaling? So the Are you buying the turtle scaling the guinea fowl? Or I guess the baboons can just hit each other. Love yeah, me the guinea it, fowl. I would, uh... There's I mean, lettuce, too. Guinea fowl, yeah. lettuce. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's so good. You can just Bell get beaver. rid of beaver. Yeah, oh mm. my god. The, it makes the place for him. <laughs> I'm... I think I'm personally fine with just baboons hitting each other. Not getting guinea right. fowl, but I guess you can get rid of the moth for it. Yeah, you're just. I'm going for lettuce. Babbins hitting each other. So strong. This is probably better. I just really wanted to see that lettuce hit a guinea fowl. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just love guinea fowl. Me I too. do too. It's such a cool unit. It's like yeah, camel, but like less cringe, you know. Yes, <laughs> for sure. Camel's so cringe. Sub's really Can't going through it with the level two <laughs> ladybug. Yeah. <laughs> I and the rat. With, uh, yeah, the rat ladybug board is probably not what Sub would have picked out here. <laughs> no, he's hitting. He's hitting. He's hitting something. I wonder if you... Uh... Hey, I'm fine. I don't see how you lose this fight regardless. No. Sub on three, too. Hmm. Ooh, oh, that oh but the hard. frigate bird counter. Nice toad nerd. Yeah, I can't do anything against the frigate bird. It's too powerful. I don't know. This I is looking very good toad. for one person in particular. Gee, I wonder who. <laughs> Reminds <laughs> me of my game. Here, let's go commentate sub. No, sub's going to bring don't. it back. Reverse I don't want sweep. my opponent to have the satisfaction frigate bird value so i'd never yeah he sold it down, yeah. Oh, the double <laughs> rabbit double lettuce Ooh, Ooh lots like, of he food didn't, value he didn't buy the other rabbit i think yeah, just for the no. guaranteed hits on the one rabbit mm. yeah it's a so it's actually better ev like this is the same with salads too Ooh. better ev to just buy the rabbit after interesting i think with a certain lineup these hatching chicks could get a win and then Sub just has to... I mean, Sub has three level ups next turn, potentially. Potentially. Just depends if he can pull them. Yeah. The but I don't know what the tier fives are. Board did get a lot bigger. Yeah, this was mm -hmm. a good turn. Especially with the lettuce. 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 I love lettuce. Lettuce is really strong. Especially if it hits a guinea fowl. <laughs> <laughs> so real. Ooh, okay. Ooh. Not winning, but keeping the heart is fine. There you go. I think who we spectate gets a little bit of a buff. So let's try and give Scooty, some a little we boost. Switch. <laughs> <laughs> Back and forth. The skunk seems. I see skunk, skunk into. And then the turtle's gonna start getting stats from these baboons. Mm. Do y'all like this manatee? 
Uh, I was just thinking, there's banana in the pack. There is banana, banana. tea's too slow for, for sub, slow. I believe. Hatching chick. Level up hatching chick, you have two skunks. Why is this beaver still Scorpion. here? Is it just for the Tira? Orp, mm. Yeah, the beaver was just to look for a level. Mm. Yeah, he sold it at the first point where it made sense to sell it. Scorp. I love the Scorp. Do you, you save for level two? two skunk? I would definitely freeze it. Yeah. He's going to have He's some big boys. Yeah, this big turtle. Tortuga. Wait, big turtle. His other guys had more health. Well, the turtle will be big from the two baboons. So true. You're, you're just not thinking ahead. So. <laughs> yeah, <I'm> not. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good against the garlic. Ooh, not strong enough though. Oof. Oh, Taking subs on lethal. Summon. Did he? Did he buy a skunk and did both baboons buff skunk there? Uh, no, it was a 4-7. Oh, one, one buff. Yeah, yeah one, one buff, buff hit skunk. Turtle. There goes the this rabbit. Tough mm -hmm. spot for Stubbo here. Yeah, I mean, you need turtle. I... Yeah. Lion? The turkey pivot. Hatching chick on the lion? <laughs> I think you get the this lion turkey, here. This turkey pivot would work if you're sick. Yeah. Yeah, get the, the lion. Lion's not gonna work. With, with the, scorpion? the scorpion? Yeah, I would have sold the scorpion had two skunks. Mm hmm It uh, seems like Sub yeah. is now realizing that the yeah. lion will not work. <laughs> it was at this moment yeah. he knew he I think, messed up. I think double skunk <laughs> swap, because this lion would be great with the hatching chick. And then you mm -hmm. can put the dodo on the skunk. Oh, no. Everyone is sad in the chat. Everyone's like, oh, no, not like this. <laughs> Yeah, if sub can survive one seconds. round, then can get rid of the scorpion. It's just a, it's just a pivot turn. It's just a pivot turn on mm -hmm. lethal, casual. That egg value. Oh, the egg. Oh. It's always the egg. Ggs. Oh. Ggs oh, sub and, and ggs to Kai Ogre. Nah. No. 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 <laughs> good game, Kai Ogre. Yeah. Oh sevens for subo, my dude. All right, Cotty. The pros are three and zero. Oh. You are the last. Yeah. You are the last chance for the content creators. Them. My God, well, he's a pro in my heart. All right, we'll see you. We'll see you after the round, Cotty. Good luck. See you on the other Hello, side. Yeah. You got this, brother. There he goes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I, worried for him. <laughs> he I think just has to hit. I think Cotty can bring it home. I think if he stays chill, he'll be good. He seems to be vibing. He's got to watch, you know, the play styles of all the people before him. So mm -hmm. he's got to absorb that knowledge. He's also just a beautiful man in his prime. I mean, there's That's never true. Been a, we've, we've never seen a Kadi better than the Kadi is today. He was looking you know, pretty good on Watermelon Crushing Day, though. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's just hope the Baru's thighs aren't still uh, holding them back, you know? Mm hmm This man's got thighs and buns of steel. Oh. Well, Udi's making up another lobby and another pack. It's everyone's favorite, unsolicited. Eggy fun fact, get ready everyone, more pet facts for you. Did you know that hummingbirds are the only birds that can actually fly backwards? Everyone else is just a forward Andy. You sure a chicken can't do that? <laughs> I guess. What, what about walking backwards and flapping your wings at the same time? But I feel like flying insinuates like taking off of the ground for a certain height and a certain amount of time. They get helicopter mode. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> That's a hummingbird. Hummingbirds are pretty cool. They also have like yeah, a fly like, little newt newt tongue that like goes out to drink the nectar out of things. The hummingbird is the helicopter of birds. When else can you apply helicopter in nature? Please tell me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the Cotty Fangar match is on. Let's go. Great 
turn one shot for Cotty. Double seahorse. He's hitting already. I can't tell if you're being genuine. <laughs> Do you not like seahorse? <laughs> no, I two like threes. It, but I've never like, two threes. looked at a seahorse and been like, I roll. I mean, I think, oh, no. I think, I think for your first starting shop, two threes are always great. No, I agree. Yeah. No, it's not high rolling a, a two three on shop one. Matt, now that that was me just joking. <laughs> Scooty said it. Scooty said it looked good, which it did. Okay, yeah, yeah. I didn't. I didn't know who you were. Again. Who you thought was joking or not? <laughs> he can't keep getting away with it. Yeah, his stars are too strong. <laughs> Yeah, if I can get two wins on this, it'll be good. Dude, look at that. Look at that. Just that high roll two seahorse turn one. I just you can't stop it. Okay, I want to know yeah, what you I all mean, think. I really like otter. Like I would have double Otter's bought otter there. Thing. I would have sold chipmunk and just bought otter. A lot of Agreed. people in the pro scene hate otter. Think it's the worst one. For what yeah, reason? Uh, I, be I believe otter is one of the worst tier ones. Uh, just for the fact of how often are your otter stats actually relevant. Mm -hmm. Now, in a random pack, I do think otter has a lot of potential. Because you're a lot more likely to have those tier ones you might want to keep. Like moth or like bluebird or something like that. Mm -hmm. Remember in like mm -hmm. just pack one, I'm not a huge fan of otter. Because I'm almost always selling or pilling my ant or whatever my That's tier fair. ones are on pack one. I do think in this, like, the seahorse is one of the tier ones that you could potentially keep for a while. Mm, just because of the movement triple. but i guess in in 1v1s the movement from the seahorse is easily predictable yeah so it's less important it's good for a while in the early yeah i do think otter has a lot of potential in random packs mm -hmm. let's see what are we looking for Ooh, Ooh, you know rated. you know Cotty has Cotty's to Cotty has to get the clown yeah my dude is always down to clown. There's no way he yeah, take Kadi it. Yeah, Kadi 100% takes goes. the clown. Doesn't care for the moth level up, potentially. Ooh, lemur. Yeah, lemur's good. Ooh, but with your balloon on turn one, you give up the 1-1 one, one I guess you could, you could freeze it. Mm. Oh, what is Kadi mm, doing now? No freeze. Is there no. flying squirrel in this? Yes, yes, there is. Interesting. So he's going to try to level two balloon? No. Rolls everything is... Either. You got to balloon the clown, right? Interesting. Yeah, why? I think he forgot about balloon. Because there's oh. no way you... Yeah, you just... Well, if he forgot about balloon, then why not buy lemur? <laughs> uh, Mind the cotty is a mysterious place. He's like, oh, he's like, I got the balloon. I can't get the garlic. And then he's like, oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> he was too distracted by that clownfish. It's a breakpoint thing. You guys want to understand? <laughs> <laughs> I, I wonder. He gets it there with garlic. I wonder if this salamander has good hits here. A lot of self. Mm, start a battle. Start a, a battle. Just yeah, just a, a few. A couple on tier two. Here, here. Uh, Not a ton. But if you hit, you hit. Cotty's tanking for easier opponents. Yeah, Cotty's getting into loser's queue here. <laughs> Pug with clownfish, I feel like you always got to get. Immediately get losing right? out on that, uh, oh. that is good. That's mm. Front cool. Pug. That's some cool. Pug pre I mean, he's hitting. He's hitting. Now, this is actually hitting. Cotty does <laughs> immediately lose out on the balloon value <laughs> onto the ferret, though. <laughs> <laughs> and had the other moth in the shop last round, but now only has level one. So have you guys ever heard of sacrificing your balloon for RNG manip? Oh, no. I have not. <laughs> but it seems like it's paid off. Yeah, he, uh, he let that balloon fly off to the sky. <laughs> <laughs> Elite level gameplay we could never potentially understand. This level two pug clown is going to be fantastic, though. Correct. Mm -hmm. Especially the level up into whatever four. Yeah, and then you can just pug the clown, and it gets plus four, worst case. Oh, <laughs> going oh, for triple right, salamander. For... Is is there lollipop in this? I, because I feel like that's the only reason. Or pepper, lollipop, or pepper. No. Neither. Oh. 
That's I guess he's very just combining with Salamanders going level two. Yeah. Ooh, hits the level up on the moth as well. Stats he's there, cooking? stats there. Oh, deer yeah. whale. Yeah. Get rid of seahorse, yeah, yeah. go deer. Excellent. Do you save the whale? Which one? Um, <laughs> I think the I, I think can't. the regular whale. Yeah, probably regular whale because it level two pod whale, regular whale. 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 Yeah. Oh. Whale shark is good for tempo, but I think not in this team. There are a lot of held foods. Whale's a little bit better for tempo here mm -hmm. for sure with deer. I mean, question is, do you even need this whale? There's I think it's cool. Tempo. You're getting rid of. I think it's really and cool want. and based. Getting rid of bat getting for it. Also, what is Cody wanting to pill here? I don't. I think it's just frozen for a beta fish. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because there's there's basically sense. nothing else that he could want. Lettuce. That is maybe. You have the one slot open for lettuce. Yeah, lettuce has two hits. Mm -hmm. I think I think you keep it frozen until you see the pies show up. Yeah, I agree. I wouldn't really be looking for lettuce. Though. I think pie is so strong. Oh, it's I ridiculous. think pie is really strong too. Both pie and banana both feel like slightly overtuned. Mm -hmm. Oh, Fangar does have the melon getting started, which is good. Yeah, but he's just so far behind. Yeah, we'll go look at him. Cotty had some great hits there. Now that we spectate Fingar, he starts hitting. Yeah, give Fingar some luck. This melon will be Thank great you. on the salamander. Yeah, but... a little awkward in the whale deer, though. That is a interesting lettuce. Lettuce, yeah. So you're... Because you... I, guess... I guess the goal is you're going to keep the flying squirrel... But, like, are you just going to keep getting melon on your team? Is that the plan? And also, the look, thing is, look, like, so you're going to keep this them. flying squirrel, but you're also buffing a gharial, which, if you're keeping the flying squirrel, you don't need to keep the gharial. Mm -hmm. Unless Fair. the goal's level two, but I don't know well, if that's worth it. You could start it. doing some weird plays. Yeah, you could start switching up gharials, like, get I guess foam scary. sword one turn, uh, water gun the mm -hmm. next. So I, are you a foam sword or a water gun guy? I feel like everybody buys one or the other. I always foam go foam sword. sword. I'm a yeah. sword user. Yeah, I think sword is generally better, but I know some water gun people. I think people just can't. It depends. Like, if it wouldn't be killing. I guess if there's, like, held food on the back line, then water gun's better. Like a mm -hmm. melon or something that it could break. Yeah, pepper. Yeah. But otherwise, the water gun's killing no matter what. If it's weak enough. Ooh, we got a pug train and a deer. Oh, nobody oh, let Cotty oh, get the clownfish. <laughs> oh, Cotty. So, so Cotty didn't end up buying the whale and still has the battle for it. Oh, did not. Wow. Just went another pug instead. I mean, that's just really good Yeah, stats. pug train's great. That's his base. Finally pugs. have the melon, though. Oh, we're probably bugged. Oh, there we go. Everyone's distraught oh. that there was no whale. <laughs> <laughs> Cotty is no longer the people's champ. No. Giving up on the whale. Let's He's see. He's a trailblazer. Fengar, I mean, I guess if Fengar levels up into... So Fengar could combine the flying squirrels. Mosasaurus could be good in two turns. Monkey and crocodile also seem great. Gariel is so cute. Gariel is cute. Going That's for the something I thought I'd hear. The double mandos. <laughs> no. oh. Anger is doing things I can't comprehend. What are you wanting this to hit happening. there? There's like nothing great to hit. Like it can scale itself, but it just looks rough here. We're gonna hit the deer. Oh dear. No, it's not. Oh, enough. and Cotty hit the level two bat. Oh, that's just that's brutal. You know, it, Cotty, uh Cotty recognizing that he should probably keep the bat on board into this flying squirrel Gario combo. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, also this makes a little bit more sense. The praying mantis was invisible on the last turn, so there is a guaranteed level two. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. 
Monkey and Mosasaurus. It's got to be Mosasaurus. Get rid of this Gariel. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're on one. That's big. Oh, yeah. this, this Mosasaurus is huge, yeah. It's kind of awkward with the Mantis because you can never buff the Mantis with the Mosasaurus. Yeah. But... Is there Mandrill in the pack? Don't think I, I saw I don't believe so. There's no, because no, he could have switched no, back no. to a lemur and then, or or the uh, ferret, and then could have went with Mandrill Mantis. <laughs> that would have been crazy. Oh, that would be awesome. This does seem like a good I turn. I think Cotty's putting him on lethal, though, which is going to be tough. So Cotty's going to have a lot of chances to win. Mm. I think, uh, dude, there's Sabretooth, too. Cotty has level 2 pug. Cotty, even oh, if Cotty doesn't yeah. take him out now, he's just going to he's just gonna have so much. He's going to level 2 pivot. pug into the Sabretooth with a mushroom, and there's nothing. Yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, pug, lionfish, pteranodon one up on the lionfish it's uh, <laughs> yeah there's there's a oh, lot there's of so good options things. with this pug <laughs> Cody also really really likes going fly this is oh, true oh yeah fly is an amazing yeah. unit i mean you buy fly and it's you're getting 12 12 you know, summons and good base stats going He's for the level three pug swirl. and it, and the bus is going to get hit with melon it's a one to five. Oh, no, no, no. Sorry, Mantis. Yeah, Mantis. Mantis still doesn't have it. All right. Let's see what Cotty cooks up on these tier sixes if he hits. Oh, hits the saber tooth. Okay. <laughs> oh, lordy. Oh, oh no. Right. Doesn't have a mushroom for it yet, but I think I think the saber tooth then, gets it. He just hit. GG go next. Cotty said, Cotty said he was going to come in and hit, and yeah. he wasn't lying. He's carrying the creator squad on his back. Thank you. Thank All their you. tears. <laughs> we got one creator left. Big part of this game is that uh, skill is a myth. And it's just <laughs> <laughs> That's true. This is the RNG games. The RNG tournament to end all RNG games. Oh, I games. thought Cody was about to sell that. He was I just dragging it. <laughs> parrot. It's got a parrot? Parrot Parrot snake. saber. That's so rude. Yeah. <laughs> Just unnecessary. Yeah. Maybe Fingar. So I mean, Fingar has the. I mean, the, I don't know if the double melon's good enough because the Mosasaurus Wait. isn't doing anything for a turn. You have to keep the bus because it gets well, scaled. Well, Flying Squirrel didn't even regenerate. He would have to find a new toy. Wait. Oh yeah. yeah. Why did Fingar kill his Flying Squirrel? Was that like I don't know. I guess I know. the bus was better. But uh. Shark, the pie oh yeah, these oh, this saber tooth is going. <laughs> oh, saber tooth. <laughs> oh, it's Joker. Was still close that final round Yay. down to the bat. GG. Good job, Cody. Oh sevens for GG's Cody and GG's Fangor. Finally streamer. back in the waiting room. <laughs> He's go. ready. Cody's ready. Let's bring him in. He's so ready. There he is. GG's Cody. GG's. Um, yeah, Pug Clownfish is pretty good. That was good. <laughs> we will ask Cotty, though, what was happening on the first few rounds with the not buying lemur, keeping balloon, and then hitting your own ferret with balloon, and then selling the ferret? I was wishy-washy on... I wanted to get the balloon since it was there. Mm -hmm. I wasn't sure if I was gonna keep going with the ferret, and then leaving the ferret up front was a misplay. That's fair. And then you immediately right, found the two pugs, so... Yeah. You need to learn when to just block it. You just gotta accept it. You gotta be like, nah, that was an RNG manip. I know what I'm doing. That's why I want. <laughs> uh, it, was for the break, it was for the break point with the ferret, for sure. Mm. All right. Here is the top four. So now we're in best of threes. And it's gonna be bagels versus violet for best of threes. And each pack for each round will still be random. And then, Cody, you have Kyogre after that. Oh, boy. Good luck to you. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> so we get, we get into earnings now, right? Every, everybody has... Yep. Yep. Everybody now uh, has made at least 75 bucks. Yo. Congratulations. Uh-huh. 
Cotty needs it for his ceiling. <laughs> is there still melon residue on your ceiling, Cotty? Uh, if I really look, I'll find like a shard or two. Um, a shard. But, <laughs> but I've I've cleaned it up for the most part. The real issues are some of the drip stains on the drywall. Oh. Um, the so I exploded a watermelon with four hundred rubber bands, and uh, it my room looked like a murder scene. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so were you able to get the ceiling fan blade back on? Oh, no, I'm just letting the fan uh, wiggle all funny. Yeah, the, the top of the watermelon <laughs> blew a blade off the fan. That's so good. It was wild. Peak Cotty content. You think he only does stuff? He's a variety streamer, melon crusher extraordinaire. <laughs> the peak Cotty content was Cotty putting 100% of his effort to crush that watermelon with his thighs while Eye of the Tiger was playing, and all of chat was just spamming ah. <laughs> 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 and then crushing it with my butt because I couldn't get it with my legs. Got buns and thighs of steel, you know? Alright, so it seems like Bagels is probably the favorite here. But Violet seems like the uh, the crowd favorite. Yeah, they're both great gamers. Um, anybody can take this home, but Debithin is definitely my favorite. <laughs> Debithin. <laughs> All right, well, this is going to be game one. Finally, we get into the best of threes. I think this will be, be fun. Yeah. Um, the, there's kind of two ways to think about it. You could do a, the same random pack, uh, but I like doing random for every single one. Yeah, it's going random for every single one. Let's see what we have That's here. Great. It's spicy. Clownfish again. Cody, it was only fitting that the clownfish was uh, available for you. Oh, it was wonderful. and and the pug. I will say, pug clownfish together is really strong. Really? <laughs> you you think know. so? <laughs> the the pug clownfish, a, a deer, and um, pie was. It's just all the early to mid game you need. Really, mm -hmm. that was pretty overwhelming. And then the saber tooth so to round it out. Oh yeah, and then hitting saber tooth. <laughs> I was like, oh. I, I just hit the guys, huh? I haven't been able to see everything, but it looks like this is going to be a quite a bit of a tempo fest. It's not much scaling until late. Yeah, not much scaling until you hit these poodles. The Falcon has been showing to be really strong in a lot of these matchups. Falcon and Hippo with Deer and Anteater in the same. This, yeah, this is going to be interesting. And Slug, like Saiga. Oh, wow. Yeah, a lot yeah, of good hits on Tier 4s. It's a cockatoo game. No waffle, though. <laughs> no waffle. Oh, and the prediction is just for this round. Banana, no pill. Yeah, banana, no pill, no manatee, no leech. There is, what, is there no leech? I don't. No leech. No leech. Thanks, so. uh, but we got a camel. What about yeah? Very <laughs> Are we going egg? Gaming for the mole. <laughs> the mole tempo. Oh, Violet's tennis ball hit the two fairs both times. Ooh, do we see double the double hog? hog? I mean, you see double hog, you take double take hog. You mm -hmm. take double hog. I like the ox. I don't know if we're going to yeah. see this double hog here. Tension. Oh, we're oh, not no. going to see it. No. Dub, this there's no strawberry. Me. Not my bro. <laughs> yeah. This is, I'm this is out how a favorite becomes a, an enemy. Yeah. Why <laughs> the no people? This was the crowd favorite. There's no bison either. I guess you're not committing to these mm. mosquitoes. You know Violet's taking this game seriously if they're not taking Double Hog, because they, they are absolutely a um, a funny line enjoyer. Oh, <laughs> funny line enjoyer is a good way to phrase it. I would say the pet Violet is most known for is uh, Axolotl. Um, yes. So, like, Violet tries to force Axolotl on pack too, so uh, he very much likes those. Yeah, packs, so, the yeah, fan he's... favorite, Bagels goes Hedgehog. I hope Bagels true. wins. <laughs> <laughs> 
Easily so slayed. it makes me look better. <laughs> there hasn't. I don't think there's been an axolotl yet. Mm -mm. Have not uh, seen a pink friend. Uh -uh. Sag. But I think I, I feel like that also kind of gets glazed over. Yeah, yeah true. If there's not like a good opportunity it. for it. This ox is a great start for Violet. Mm -hmm. Are you not putting it in yep. the back for the Same golden? Also I like it. I liked it in the back, but um, if there's two, are they concerned about two hedgehogs? I don't know what they're worried about. To be fair, putting it in the back is only one extra attack, so if the positioning yeah. is better, go forth. I mean, I'm I, I would probably go back ox too, but putting it anywhere else isn't like crazy. Level two balloon, probably just put it on ox maybe, or shrimp. The double shrimp. Or shrimp I gaming. love it. I do like the shrimp gaming. Yeah, shrimp's a great. Like Violet, Violet is getting great early round wins, though. Already having bagels on three. Violet is yeah. taking bagels straight to Tempo Town. Thanks, the best of three. Population at you. Yeah, I mean, Tempo Town, Ant Eater. I kind of like this Saiga, but I'm a big Saiga guy. Saiga does seem strong. Oh, we got a stout level up. But, like, if you hit Saiga here, then you... Then it's great because of oh, the. Yeah. Ooh, I mean, this is good too. Love yeah, the deer. It's great, great stuff for Violet all around. I think you're getting so, rid of the mosquito. Yeah. yeah. Just because there's so much health from these shrimp. And the ox I guess moth, gets. Moth is more tempo, anyways. I would say sell ox, but I think just the ants. Like if you put ant here in the back, gives it more chances of getting huge. Very true. Yeah. Deer's just so good. Is it not deer in the front? That unit is broken. I can't believe they thought about buffing that unit. <laughs> oh, the stronger I, chili? I the <laughs> Would it be wrong to change the places of anteater and deer? I think uh, I like I, that. No, that would be correct. So, to guarantee the ant buffs on ox. Yeah. I feel like I'm always throwing deer in the front. As well. Mm, I agree. At least the first round that you get it. Well, you want chili to do something, because it might not do anything here. No, it will, okay. Yeah, it's fine. Oh wow, these breakpoints. These are very close. Violet's getting very I'm good. Out the melon. Break points here. That was actually that was amazing position. Mm-hmm. We doubt it. I love the eggplant too. I don't know if it's I don't know. I guess you're trying to send that to the front. Eggplant on the ox. To move their ox forward one. Still going for the level up on the ox. Yeah, I still think I swap anteater. Or put anteater right next to the ox. I don't love the eggplant. I mean, it just seems like you're spending three gold. and For nothing. I don't know. Maybe it pops off. Because positioning doesn't seem super important. Not yet. You're trying yeah. to steal rounds now. I guess if if well, they maybe. if they do ant eater ox in the back line and you swap, that's good because then the ants don't really that's have much true. to hit. That is true. Yeah. Looks like they're swapping. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the surprise eggplant could do something. <laughs> and what do they want from fives? Don't laugh at that. <laughs> what? Don't laugh at that. <laughs> What? I, I, what? I didn't, I didn't say anything. <laughs> yeah, dirty. No. Oh, wow. I sent the Saiga to the back. Did he predict Eggplant or was Eggplant in the last round? I think, I don't think Eggplant was in the last round. I don't think it was in the last round. Well, look how big that ox is, though. I think they were fine with ox being behind the antelope just That's to get the true. two hits. Yeah. That was good. I don't know how... That ox got so big. Matters, I guess but... it was from the shrimp, just selling a lot of things. Yeah. Yep. Level up on deer would be great. Or just going double deer for a second. Over maybe the stilt yeah. or the moth. I think both of these can easily go. Yeah, I was like, I don't feel like moth. Or you're just going for the level up. 
I think you. Oh, I think you. I, well, I think you still sell. Yeah, double ant or anteater. When the Saigo looks even there more interesting now. Oh yeah, true. Oh, yeah, yeah they have very similar builds. Honestly, it might just be so ox now. I, I guess it's still a triple. So. Are there any things that pair with? I mean, the cockatoo hitting deer, stilt, and anteater. Turkey, turkey's what you're hoping for. Yeah, turkey yeah. or Ooh, cockatoo. I like the locked wool. Don't sell the ox right away. We can find another ox. Take the mm. side next. And then you have Spino waiting on turn nine. Amps is going crazy over these grapes somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> I am a I'm a I'm a big grape guy. Well, I uh, oh I okay. Ooh, that, that, commits yeah, for it. Okay. I don't really buy grape all too often. I just, I, I, I mean, especially in lobbies. I guess in one v ones, I don't buy them as much. Falcon but. hitting an anteater would be good. I mean, hitting anything yeah, is fine. Okay. Let's see. You get an ox, which is good. Ooh. Oh, and then you get the melon oh, back. Yeah. That, oh no! Wow. That chili. That chili just threw. That's crazy, actually. Yeah. Eagles proving to be a menace. Yeah. Very you know, sticking around, making it really hard to get Saiga? rid of them. Are you just stacking up stuff for level ups next turn? Like buy Saiga, yeah. buy banana potentially? Yeah. There's no some I wouldn't have been upset with yeah, a banana. I mean, Surprise what banana. other food are you using? Oh, <laughs> more <that's>... eggplants <laughs> Surprise eggplants. here we go five eggplants and you shift the ox all the way to the front <laughs> getting that falcon in the first slot is actually really good that is true yeah because yeah. even if falcon faints it won't summon because the slot is still considered occupied or will it no, uh, uh, yeah you're correct yeah. Okay. it flies off the Is there chocolate? There is not. So it kind of has to get lucky, but it has four options. Let's see. Move. Oh. oh. They tried to predict the anteater here against the uh, eggplant. I think this ox is still too large. Violet's in a little bit of a hole. Yeah, I think Violet, Violet just really small. has to hit level ups here. Small. Or really hopes for level ups here. Chocolate cake on the deer. That's great. Uh, especially Ooh, into the. Falcon. That's good. Pteranodon. I think you have to take Pteranodon. It's just so. I would. This would be a great Pteranodon if it's a test server. I, I have put it behind. Serious ordering issues here, though. Yeah. Like you that's have to put ox front. Yeah, or else you don't get any pteranodon value. The front of four squad. Yeah, you're probably just getting rid of ox for something that can go in the front. And you want the that doesn't have faint ability. You want Is the this pteranodon to copy the deer, not the um? Yeah. Is this moose ever terrible? Getting rid of ox for moose? I know you can't this turn, but... Uh, I'm not a huge fan of moose. Yeah, it's it kind of weird. Slow. Also, this this can't be the positioning you end on. Yeah. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, oh. Okay. Interesting. I guess they're also playing with their own eggplants and assuming their eggplants opposing them. Okay. Oh, okay. So there's a lot. Oh, that's so strong. Great, great line. But the... Ooh, Just that's enough. So close. Just enough. Needs to take Jeez. one more. Cheese them. Oh, the eggplants are too much. There's too much math. Because the yeah. positioning with the Tyrannodon matters so much and the eggplants matter so much. Oh, you got to go Spino as well. Ditch the oh. Yeah, get rid you of the Saiga. I mean, you ditch the ops first. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, there's. A Do slug you just snag there. the slug? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Snag the slug. This nope. Is oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh. Is it ever scorpion? <laughs> I think I think scorp scorpion on this three. shrimp. Yeah, I like scorpion. It's something that you can put up front. That's yeah. still good trend. I tell you. If Violet loses this turn, tomatoes then become really scary for both teams. Onions are interesting into the eggplants. Just to guarantee something to stay in the back of the team. Like Spyro. Yeah. yeah, Scorpion just seems the overall best here, I think. Mm hmm. From what we've seen. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Four squad, running to four squad. Wait, this was, this was a thing. Interesting. Interesting. What? Uh, what? Going with this I four squad it. instead. Wait, that was super weird, actually. No, I. Not with the spy now. Not this with is the psychotic. <laughs> this is, I think this is overvaluing the Pteranodon. I would have just sold Pteranodon. Anti eggplant. Really, yeah, I was about to say anti eggplant because eggplant can't really do much here with a four squad. Um, oh, no. I it, it still bit it. It still bit it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is. Oh no. This is disastrous. I'm pretty sure that, that, that just keeping the anteater would have been fine. Yeah, the poor anteater. Alright, let's double up on the scorpions. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> and then, I mean, are you just going... You gotta go slug. I think slug's so good with the spino. Nanner? Buy another nanner? can't well for I, the next for the next yeah. turn oh yeah <laughs> no he or can <laughs> can buy it what's the f i don't get the four squad gambit so here the can be in front. It, it's i mean it's to guarantee pteranodon value mm -hmm. i guess a 15 but. 15 is a lot i like how you say guaranteed Pteranodon value, but it didn't work this turn. <laughs> it's guaranteed okay, now. now it's guaranteed. As now of now. It's guaranteed. Okay. Unless there's like three eggplants. Yeah, three eggplants. That's the play. Ooh, the foam sword. Okay, just oh. the one. Just the one. Oh. Oh. I get the chocolate cake. Oh. I think 15, 15 was a break point. No. It, Ox that still got way too big there. Double spino. And yeah, crazy. double spino. <gasps> I mean, it seems like five pets are proving to be better than four. <laughs> <laughs> Who would have thought? This is a good cobra freeze, though. This cobra might do some work. Like you said, the okay, oh. no, <laughs> you let it go. <laughs> and like yeah, you said, that fun. onion could have been good as well, holding that. Yeah, cobra onion. Oh, imagine if you, like, lock-rolled the Cobra and you got this toy gun in, too. Also, now, so Violet's been playing the four squad. Does Violet buy something with less health than the deer so that it gets sniped, and then there's two slots open for the deer? It always gets buffed by turkey. Oh, yeah. you're right. <laughs> oh, that sucks. So you're gonna the dig turkey's for a sniper so here, good, but like. so bad. Just get the slug. slug. Just yeah, buy the, finally slug. buy the slug. I don't know. I I, I think, think Violet Violet might got lost in the sauce. I, I think he's getting cooked. Sauce. Mushroom, mushroom oh, the deer. Mushroom deer is huge. Gift another uh, mushroom deer doesn't work. So yeah, the the right. foam sword. Also, it's a 50 -50 get deer. get rid of turkey. Yeah. Buy something that gets sniped. Oh, oh did he float the three gold? Simply oh. got rid of turkey. Three squad. You definitely this just buy something game. that dies to the... You buy the scorpion just so it tanks the hit for the do, like the deer. Wait, I guess the deer only gets like one. So gig. Wait, oh, white tiger into level three spino. I that don't is know. a lot. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's way too much. Yeah, I mean, it's... The three squad. <laughs> What a way to go out, though. Going down like a champion. Yeah, Violet went down swinging. Oh, sevens for Violet out there. <laughs> All right. Well, at least it's game one. Yeah, that is just game one. Violet gets another chance. Oh, yeah. Best of three. Uh-huh. 
I know, I so I much forgot. How they said oh, that. Sheesh, I forgot. Oh, sheesh, I forgot. Never forget. But it is a new pack. All right, it's going to be the same code uh, to Bagels and Violet. While we're waiting, here's your unsolicited egg animal fun fact. Agario <laughs> has between 106 to 110 interlocking razor sharp teeth. Fun fact, Whoa. they're chompy boys. I knew that fun fact. Does that make me not fun anymore? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Good fact. Smart fact. I'm hearing a child scream in the hallway. Excuse me, I am busy gaming. Would you mind? Bring him in for an interview. <laughs> hey, can I borrow your kid for content real quick? It's not even my stream, just for content. <laughs> All right. Do we think that Violet can bring it back and take us to a game three? I I believe Violet definitely could. All right. I got the spectate I think going. If Violet keeps five pets on the board, chances will that be was a uh, big downside. <laughs> the four didn't seem to be working, so Violet decided to go down to three. <laughs> <laughs> now, now maybe llamas in this pack. Like we finally gets like a llama owl line. Really. Oh, there you go. Yeah, we'll look at the pack in a second. Double duck is great. Baboon, penguin, some early scaling. We have crow for level ups. Leech with no synergy touch. We do have Secretary Bird with the Slug, which is really strong as well. Oh, the Otter gets the win. That's a good Otter. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Rare. Meerkat Tempo. Potentially, we have Rabbit with not a ton of foods. We have Salad for it. No I Camel. Think, well, well, another yeah, I think gamer that respects the Meerkat. I think Meerkat's I decent Meerkat. Tempo. Ooh, a lot of summons for the Vulture later on. Wolf, Slug, Orca, Spino. Might be another Spino game. But there is at least scaling to counter it. Because Secretary Bird's a great pivot into the Vulture or Spino. Yeah, like, I know the timer is behind, but it being on zero <laughs> with 10 gold, I feel like it can't be in a great spot here. I think opening up the pack is what makes it weird. Maybe not. Oh, it already shows the pets. Okay, yep. We're on turn three already? <laughs> oh, this is like completely bugged out, right? Oh, not bad. Okay. There we go. This didn't look like a turn three board. Has the baboon to hit the stilt? With the three gold? Oh, yeah. Are we going how to does, see a Niala Nurse Shark combo? Ooh. How does, he, how does he have two level ups? I'm so confused right now. He has one level two on board. Did one of them get sold? Uh, <laughs> I think oh, there was... A, sold a duck yeah, I think it was a duck here. His other, oh, sold Hacking duck. confirmed. Guaranteed yeah, here. I, I'm going to... I'm going to reload this. Okay, there we go. Okay, did end up buying the baboon for the stilt. And then Violet is going shrimp. Love me oh, Violet shrimp seemed one. That stilt was looking really strong. I guess the woodpecker is just great. There's no pineapple for the woodpecker. There is also no like triceratops no camel nothing mm -hmm. cool to do with it or a wombat tiger. or not wombat uh wolverine there's tiger yeah though. there is tiger 
Anything for the Puma to work with? It doesn't seem like it. There's Gary with Puma. Going wild with the foam swords. Yeah, foam sword. Ooh, another shrimp. Wait, actually, the, it's going to be a Puma water gun. Mess up those spines. Yeah, there we go. There is also, yeah, there's just so much working with summons. Yeah. I think it's either summons or you have to get early Baboon Penguin just to get stats going. Seeing Octo and Tiger next to each other sends a shiver down my spine <laughs> of the old mm -hmm. Tiger Octo meta. We also haven't seen Stonefish today, I don't think. No, not a single one on the board. Uh, yeah. Stonefish and is really strong too. Yeah, that makes me think that there's just not been any at all. Like, not that we mm -hmm. missed them, because somebody surely would have them. Mm -hmm. I heard Stonefish is like the scorpion of pack two. Essentially. It's, yeah, it's it's a scorpion that has much better base sets. Like, oh, whale, whale shark. Feed it everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, because you get the two. Yeah, if you whale shark, you feed it both cherries and the eggs. I don't hate it. I, yeah, I like it. Honestly, Chipmunk into Whale Shark is a favorite. Yeah, I think you got to. I think you can do the egg this turn or something just for like money's sake. Or you uh, feed double you cherry. Buy the, just buy the orangutan. Right? Sure, orangutan steps. No, oh, yeah, and then just save both cherries. Yeah. Because the orangutan will hit the Whale Shark. Yeah, I like that. I guess how important are the orangutan stats if you shrimp? Oh, well, you're probably not going to shrimp very much. Yeah, I like this. Mm. Yeah, and then freeze those two. Got to lock the cherries. Surely. Violet. Sure. <laughs> is there a lollipop at all? The, ti the timer's bugged. We're fine. No, there is no lollipop. <laughs> okay. I just, I'm just scared that they weren't locked. Right oh, away. saving all oh, of it. Oh. So you get the I four held strategy. foods, buying everything next turn. That's I your love entire this game. Yeah. You're spending you a meerkat in here. I am uh, so proud. Uh, the you, meerkat you is good. Meerkat. Has been confirmed good in a 1v1. I, I love it, man. Oh, and then you're just buying all it. of this. I'm assuming there's no skunk. Oh, there is remember. not. Okay. No skunk. There is scorpion, scorpion though. Yeah. yeah, scorpion and stonefish. <laughs> no mushroom a though. Scary. That That's a great is. turn. I love it. Huge tempo for sure. And then at this My point, do you can? Is that I sell moth and buy another food? <laughs> Maybe not terrible. You I mean, do get you the... get the orangutan buff. You do that. Oh, yeah, true. And then you get the stats from the shrimp still. Yeah, but because now the orangutan's going to the moth, and they're probably getting rid of the moth eventually. Yeah, that might have actually been the play. I could see it. Because you're not saving health foods anymore. You're trying to get level 2 whale shark if you start committing that again. Yeah. I don't know. I think it's really hard to try to commit to one big unit. Like, I think its stats are probably good enough. Maybe one or two more, but to get it up to, like, 12 or 13 attack. The meerkat difference. Or... Yeah, that was that's a tough loss. Not close to level ups either. But I guess um, Bagels only has the uh, still level up chance. Whale shark is lame because it's anti uh, mole. <laughs> potato. Are there any? I guess potato against vulture. But you have to wait to see if they go vulture. Is flea? Flea is. I mean, doesn't work against whale shark. Not really super great here. I guess maybe it's... it. Nah, Counters the rabbit. Because it does steal one of the stats from the orangutan. Who up donutting with shrimp? Oh. Bluebird donut. 
That's all the stats I need. <laughs> I'm very surprised. I haven't seen someone keep up. Oh, with the mole! <laughs> Holy, my hero! Bagel's going for style points. Oh, now. Bagel's going for the mole. My, my hero. Chat better be going crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I saw Kelby with the all big mole in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think you're just trying to get these level ups. Donkey? Is, is it there, worth? Is there ever a donkey play? Doesn't seem I like, like it. Gary will buy sell. Yeah, I was saying just refreshing your foam sword, getting stats from the shrimp. Or do you just roll, roll it, it down. down? Shouldn't you just be buying stuff for your whale shark? Oh, Holy guacamole is such an underrated comment. <laughs> what do y'all think of the new mole? Now that it can go off more Good. than one times a turn pretty consistently. Very oh, strong. Such a sick change. I think it's Maybe not I the like it. ones, but I don't think I've ever bought a mole before. It's cool. It's fun pet. How do how does it feel just saying in front of this many people that you aren't a cool? <laughs> Whoa, why must you do oh, me sorry. like this? I am a casual Andy who is learning. I'm here to represent the the newbie sat players, okay? Don't judge the That's fact good. I've been playing this for a year, you know, whatever. <laughs> I'm I'm just saying in my first ten hours about a mole. The mole wasn't even out yet. Well you know what, Damon, maybe I'm just not like the other girls. You ever thought about that? <laughs> That's what they all say, Eggie. <laughs> don't doubt me like this. But I, I am glad to learn some mole strategies by watching these two people go against each other. Also, I like the double flea. I would have never gone double flea, but I think it's quite cute. <laughs> yeah, this, this mole's great with this. I mean, the secretary bird tempo, the flea, or not the flea, the meerkat tempo. It is just Bagel's too much. Real strong yeah. Right this is a team that can fall off pretty quick, but Violet is on one, so Bagels just has to figure out how to get one win somehow. I feel like Woodpecker hurts you here so much. It's just like, I feel like it does nothing for you. Yeah, you could, I mean, getting rid of Woodpecker for Slug isn't terrible. Depending on where the flea hits, I guess 510 is a decent amount of stats. Saving the shark as well. Do you get rid of flea here as well and go just slug shark? I don't think you can get rid of whale shark. No. And I don't think flea. I don't think flea does enough. Like, it, yeah, you would love to have it level two, but just gonna get the one in. I think at one life you have to get shark in here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, flea made us or shark made us be better than flea. It gets a lot more stats or stonefish. Okay. That I think you mean you had to pick one. You mm -hmm. just had to pick one. Yeah, I'm fine with getting rid of either. Level Ooh, 2 mole. Ooh, Spino's a good hit too. And level 2 mole. That might be too much. Ooh, yeah, Ooh the Spino, the spino hitting there. Point. Yeah. Uh-oh. Yo, 5 would Pretty and commanding win from Bagels. Mm-hmm. I think the crowd is thinking a pretty commanding mole, judging by Kelby's exclamation mark. <laughs> <laughs> the mole and, mole and mole the meerkat. Good tempo units. Uh -huh. so what do we learn today, Koss? We we buy moles, and I will buy a mole next time. <laughs> Let's go. We've converted her. Not under every single circumstance. <laughs> it's not always buy mole. No, I'm always buying a mole. I see one. I'll be like, Scooty told me to do this. Forget the held food. We're buying mole. <laughs> All right, you gamers. playing microbe. All right, good luck, Cody. I'll see you on the other side. Yep, good luck. Be free, Cody. Always buy mole. It's true. And did you guys know, unsolicited egg fun fact time. Wahoo. Um, moles have an extra thumb on each four of them that helps them dig. Pog crazy. They're so good at digging. Dude, yeah. mm. I've known two two of the fun facts in a row. Am I, I'm just smart, dude. Do you well, have any fun facts for us? Just off the top of the head? Uh, what are what are the... Who's who's in this next game? I'll say a fun fact about it. Uh, Kyogre and Cody. 
Um, fun fact about Kyogre. Um, he went to Juilliard. It's a fun fact because nobody knows if it's true. <laughs> that is fun. <laughs> so, I feel like this is gaslighting. Okay. <laughs> fun fact about Cotty, he has a huge set of thunder thighs. <laughs> um, I can, I, fun fact I about give... Kyogre, he's, he's British. Uh, That's ooh, very I... fun. <laughs> yeah, totally. Kai is British, but Cotty is a huge fan of Alabama, so if you go roll tide at him, he will love you forever. So if anyone wants to riz Cotty up, just go into his chat, scream roll tide, and he will love you. Facts. Unless, unless he knows you're doing it to taunt him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Alabama did lose to Texas pretty bad a little while ago, but Cotty's not here to listen to that, so no one tell him I said that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, here's the bracket. Bagels is in the finals, and Kyogre and Cotty for the best of three. Please, Cotty. Everybody's rooting for you, Cotty. Do not let this man high roll on you. Find Clownfish. It is crazy. These the the three people left are the one and two seed from the pros and the one seed from the uh, creators. Yeah, so we didn't see the best of one. Yeah, the best of one didn't bear, mix things up, up too much. Oh, kiwi strawberry in the first shot. There is, and there's a uh, hummingbird. But Ooh, too bad, too bad that was my shop. <laughs> 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 now we're watching everybody else's shop. Yeah, dummy, double hummingbird here. Our favorite bird that Ooh, can fly back. Triple hummingbird. Oh. There is Talk strawberry crazy. for it. No, no. <laughs> oh, I wasn't muted. <laughs> <laughs> What, what's what's wrong? Oh, the stra you like the strawberries? I wanted, I wanted there to be no strawberry. I wanted them to feel it. He's better. Is there any hey, other combo jelly. with the strawberry later? There's not. There's pug, there's pug jellyfish. Oh, there is pug jellyfish. Wait, did he skip the third humming? He did. Yeah. Interesting. Wants those kiwis. And very interesting. Maybe he just thinks the tier threes aren't worth that. Let's see. I mean, there's hatching chick, dodo, puppy, dolphin. Good. Like, yeah, puppy. Tier are fine. Weasel's, Weasel's good. Cat. Maybe it's a bug. Maybe it, I mean, still hits and oh, decides to buy. Anyways, okay. Never well, <laughs> rewarded. Uh, I guess never by mouse. Never punished. Kyogre. Oh. Never mind. <laughs> so when when are you buying tennis ball instead of uh the balloon? I guess on turn one, because it's always only hitting your tier one units on turn three. I guess if you want to hope to level up into because see then swirl. then Cotty did swap to balloon, so then it'll hit on turn four. So maybe that's it. Wait, is Kyogre? So playing? sometimes the I like getting your your toy set up, you know, on a on an odd turn. There's mm -hmm. Bossasaurus in the play. Yeah, that's what he's looking for. Mm -hmm. Hug. Do you double sell down for the weasel here? I would think so. Yeah, I mean it's it's equal tempo. Better Money next there, turn. Yeah. Yeah, Cotty's stacking up these pigs for something. Let's go look at Cotty. My goat. Cotty's looking to strawberry something as well. Ooh, that's a big stork. Ooh. Hits the African penguin that's and the hatching chick. We see the tier fives. How the stork's going to be looking later. Pretty rhino decent. Rhino, eagle. Yeah, Pretty rhino, good. eagle, wolf is good. Niala's good. Yeah, Four really good. strong hits. Really good breakpoints here, too. Let's go, Cotty. Let's yeah, go. Yeah, good for Cotty. I mean, I mean, we're unbiased here. <laughs> Double drama, Derry. Cotty, do it for me, please. <laughs> <laughs> it's Pug. He's going Pug. <laughs> I mean, you could 
take it all. Yeah. <gasps> you made space oh. for it. He's gonna buff the pug with it. Ah, uh, you just buy it all. Yeah. I guess that's fair. Two fours, no jelly. Skipped that. Once another yeah, dramedary. hitting yeah. the drama yeah. there. Yo, the triples <laughs> are here. Yeah, Cotty's looking good. Mm hmm. Front pug. I guess just trying to get the trade. Yep. Still haven't sold the mouse yet. That's his emotional support mouse. He takes it everywhere with him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here, are you going triple drum? Or are you combining them probably for a tier yeah, four? Get, get the triple. Yeah, yeah. Level, level Ooh, Ooh, we got a hawk and a falcon. Such a good drum target. Yeah, yeah, yeah I think you just freeze it. Nasty. Yeah, I mean, freezing it does... Okay, he just immediately buys Ooh. instead of going for the freeze. Ooh, get another drop. Come oh, on. <laughs> Scale it. I can hear Scooty, like, salivating. <laughs> he's like, ooh, a drum. Oh, he's buying it. He goes for the other one. <laughs> and then he hits another one. Oh, <laughs> my God. <laughs> God, he's doing it for the fans. I don't Yo. hate the garlic there. If you garlic hatching chick the drum... It might not be worth the gold because Cotty seems to be like decently ahead, but I kind of still like the garlic. The hawk could be good to trade with this pug, or it's okay. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> a hawk for a hawk. <laughs> Does get the fight lamb. This is huge with the drums are cooking. Mm -hmm. I love mm -hmm. the fight that the drums full life. In. Do you stack them, or do you drop the? I guess you still keep the hatching chick. I think you have to stack, yeah. I might lock this leech just to, you know, it's a 7-5 already. Make it your buff target. That is true. Is there anything there worth hitting? Peta. Yeah, there is PETA. So now this is my question. So if you, you leech a lemon... In battle, you only have one left on it, and like, and you you have one trigger left on it, like forever now. Mm -hmm. Like, how does that work? Yeah. Okay. Used lemon. Ooh, another drum. <gasps> Cody no. does, oh does not commit to the leech though. He wants more yeah, drums. I think, uh -huh. I think that's bad. I mean, like, if you're gonna go this hard drum, you gotta actually start drumming at some point. Do you toss the hawk here and go ahead and he's buy at this six one? Life. I feel. I mean, he's at six life. Is there polar bear in this? There is. <laughs> oh my god. So no, he could just level up into a polar bear next turn. Oh, decides to stack. I I think he dropped. Oh, I don't like how he stacks that. This is the one yeah. instance where I would have rather yeah. went double level if he do. He kind of rolled down for the most part for the rest of the turn after he secured one drum. I don't think I'm a fan of that, but... Oh, so he's so he can only make a level three drum to level up now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I, I really, really don't like that. And he loses his fight. I kind of expected. He, he hasn't been doing much but rolling for Dromedary, it feels like. It feels like he could have won that fight if he you know, does a lot of other things at this point. Yeah, I think so. That's a good hit for the Hawk. Wow. Oh, just immediately goes for the level 3. Niala is good. Uh, Niala's not really something you want to buff with Drom. I mean, there are two tier ones sitting for this moose. Yeah. I'm, I kind of like the moose. Yeah, it's not terrible. I don't know. I, I'm mean? so addicted to Niala. Niala is so good. Let's see the moose. The, 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 value, the value you get from it is incredible. So he, he mm -hmm. might just buff a stork here. Yeah, just yeah, continue buffing that. the stork. Do you ever buff Wait, this over, Doberman over and then pivot? Wait, yes, yes. I feel like that's actually buy the decent. stork and then just freeze the Doberman. Because you can't commit to the stork if you're going Doberman. True. Yeah. And then you that's already have a Niala, which is good. You so if you do buff this Doberman, you're accepting that you're selling everything on board except for Niala. Mm -hmm. Correct. Kind of awkward. 
There's T-Rex and, like, Stego, though. Like, I think with the lives that Cotty has, I think he could do it. Ending? Did he just end turn with three gold? He did. Cotty, not maybe, again. <laughs> maybe it's a bug. I think he had three gold, though. He don't need oh, it. He oh, no. He, he bought the... Uh, there was yeah, a... He bought the hawk. Oh, okay. There, there was a hawk? <laughs> yeah, Peter I didn't mode? see the hawk. <laughs> Man. You got hawk. it somehow. <laughs> what? Keeping us on our toes. I think Cotty had the... No, Cotty had zero. I thought he stacked yeah, the we, hawk. No. The hawk was there. Oh, I thought he stacked oh. it. Yeah, it just looked like he stacked it then, I bet. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... Oh, why are you feeding a pair if you're committing to this Doberman? I'm going to go with that's another bug. <laughs> it has to be. <laughs> I don't think you commit four stats to this stork. I don't think that was a bug. The Doberman's not really frozen. That Doberman's actually a, a dolphin. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's something else. You get jump scared a different pet in the ice cube. We got flashlight on Kyogre's board. Yeah, it's gonna pop next turn. Mm -hmm. Not too much else going on. Oh, no. Like level up the stork, level up the hawk. We don't know what Kyogre has to level up. Yeah. These tier sixes tier will be good. Go this is the first angler we've seen. Yes, angler waffle. I do love the angler versus angler. There is angler waffle as well. Catfish build is my... Oh, there's such strong tier sixes. You have saber tooth, stego, mantis shrimp strong. Yeah, the yeah. tier fives and sixes are looking good. Eagle. Yeah. I think Doberman is a good move. I don't think pairing the stork, but I still like the Doberman. A lot of strong tier sixes. Oh, the slug right. once again, beating the the trade. It's so slimy to win just with a slug. Like, pun not intended, but like... <laughs> oh, you intended it. No, I didn't. Cheeky, cheeky. Ooh, I crane hit. I in your voice. I was just saying. This crane hit's pepper, great as well. Different. There is not pepper. No pepper. No. I see some pies come out. There's been a lot of pie usage today. Mm-hmm. Yeah, pie's been in a lot of packs. So I feel like lemon has as well. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Yeah, you're buying crane. I would be fine with pivoting Ooh. next turn. You stat the eagle good. with the draw. Yeah, you stat the... Ooh. Okay. No, I'm not going to oh, do it. Might get polar, polar bear in Yeah, here? immediately yeah. just get rid of something for the polar bear. Polar bear. I mean, you kind of have to accept that you lose the next turn, so it doesn't... Yeah. Either one of the tier twos... Or, sorry, not tier fives. I still think... I think I would have frozen that eagle, but... Hitting the polar bear is good. Does Cotty commit for two turns, or does Cotty sell next turn? I feel like he's gonna sell. I don't know if he's patient enough. Ooh, what's this beluga have? Ooh, falcon. Oh, that was good. a good melon. Is that good? Nope. The sl this slug is ruining Kai's <laughs> life. <laughs> Get slugged on. But Kyogre, I mean Kyogre has to assume. Ooh, that Kai's cooking something. Yeah. Okay, now you. So I think you put the Doberman in, start buffing lionfish. Yeah. Yeah. Try to win this fight. Yeah, get get Stork out and then get Drom out. I'm assuming you want the coconut now. Mm hmm. I might have sold, might have sold the uh, bird guy crane. I sold crane. I think you're selling Drom. Ostrich could be something. And you pie the Doberman always. Oh, uh, ostrich is too be, slow. Yeah. yeah. That's gotta be. Not selling the drum, trying to win one turn with it. I'm, I, mm. I can see that. Uh, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. The three yeah, extra I mean, stats is. You're getting working. what seven seven on the slime fish. So it's pretty huge. Mm -hmm. The people seem to want to sell now. Yeah, I like it. I like selling a little. Or they mean like sell the drum this turn? Yeah. Oh, I don't like that. I like. No, that. I don't. I don't know. You, you would have had to find something better in shop to to do it. Yeah, I agree. This lionfish just isn't big enough yet so far. Ooh, that's a good team. 
great trade though. What's in the beluga? It was a falcon. Yeah. Fuck. Okay. Great All right. Falcon. Great. By the way, I was the crane's goaded. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. I even Ooh, said maybe yes, buy sell the stingray. There he goes. Do you go for the stink? I think you go for the stinky sock and you try and win out. Oh, I don't yeah. know. I was I was thinking flashlight. Uh, I like stinky sock. Yeah, there's just there's a big uh, pug there. Yeah. I would go sock. Ooh, and then you can Ooh, puma. puma. You buy lionfish. Oh, I think oh, I would have oh, liked puma as well. I really like that. And is Cotty committing for the lionfish another turn? There's no way. I think right? it's kind of risky. <laughs> like you, you want to get that in? I think you want to find T Rex. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, let's see yeah, what Kyogre's doing that. with the four, chameleon. Four, four isn't worth it anymore. Stego's here. You, yeah, okay. Micro. Stego on your team. Going for level two stingray. Kyogre also swapped to the stinky sock, opting to just try and win two in a row. So yeah, level two pug Stego here is gonna go so hard. Mm -hmm. And level two stingray. Level two. Yeah. Anybody remember what's in the whale? Uh, it's the falcon. Okay. I think you freeze the stingray. Oh yeah, falcon. Okay. Going for the level two on the wolf. He might not be able to win this turn, but maybe the microbe can put in work here. Depends. Yeah, potentially. Oh, the, the lionfish did not get bought. No, interesting. I, I think that. Well, this. Ooh. Is oh no, That's the falcon! Oh, no. <laughs> oh man, wild. the second crane instead of lionfish. Kyogre's have a really big turn with this stego. Yeah, it's going to be crazy. That was insane. Pretzels are also good. Not for Kyogre, but for Cotty. Mm -hmm. And Cotty is Tranodon. still Lionfish. cooking. Oh, yeah, Tranodon for... Yeah, Tranodon, Lionfish, Lionfish. Stego, and make sure it hits Lionfish. Do you have room for the Tran? I guess you'd have to sell... Get rid of Microbe. microbe. Yeah. Well, would level 2 Lionfish be better to have... I think I just if like level two Stego. It depends Ooh, on whether or not you get Pteranodon in, but I, I That's don't... true. There's the T Rex. He's thinking about it. I don't think probably too big. I think the pug is too big. I mean T Rex will, would still scale three things, so maybe T Rex is still worth it. I don't know. I think Pteranodon's good here and over microbe, but you can't guarantee the stego buff this turn, though. So maybe oh, wait, like maybe eggplant. Eggplant, yeah. So you get you get eggplant on something this turn for the crane that you're gonna keep. Yeah, oh, for the crane. Yeah. Actually, I do like. Eggplant. Is Cody buying the lionfish this turn though, or is he cooking it another turn? Okay, so <laughs> he is just is gonna be roasted. He's just focusing it on the lionfish here. There is oh. the lionfish. He, he got pie on it as well. I am confused. Huh. Yeah, that the eggplant doesn't make a ton of sense. Uh, another draw. No, no, no. He eggplanted to focus the buff on. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. Yeah, but uh, I think I you still can like put it second eggplant. slot though, just to get the crane. Yeah, I would have liked to actually try to eggplant there. Do you just waffle to refresh your stinky suck? I think you need to. Yeah, probably. And I know they they keep it. committing to the stinky sock, but like the level two flashlight. If Kyogre doesn't get O two'd, is the flashlight good? I see. I if I was Cody, I would have done flashlight because I felt like he had enough time to do it. Mm -hmm. Let's see what Kyogre goes for. Still committing to stinky sock. I just I think the lives are so important. I think I probably would be stinky socking every time. Angler. I think Cody. They're both. I don't know if Kyogre probably doesn't have the room for it, but Cotty could be buying Angler where this polar bear is and stacking lionfish. Mm. And Stego could be good for Cotty as well. So if Cotty has Anglerfish with waffles, getting level two lionfish or level two Stego. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I like level two lionfish over level two Stego here. Just because you have the trainer on now? Yeah. I, I don't actually know what does more damage. I don't know either. But I, the eight hits might be better 
than the four hits. Oh, that... I think I the think eight. I think yeah. I see. I think the uh, the four hits weren't good enough there. All right. Well, let's see Kadi's what let's see what Cotty is has been cooking up. The polar bear is gone, so he maybe it was just the Stego. Stego. A little bit. Yeah. Mm. I think Cotty's cooking up a. I think pita bread's good here against um, the lionfish. Yeah. Yeah, his lionfish. Do you chocolate yeah, cake the niala? Eggplant. It's or eggplant. Oh, it's, it's eggplant. eggplant moment. Eggplant the pug. But Kyogre might be just be playing around it. Kyogre is fine if Actually, the pug hits I... either one. No. Oh, Kai is playing around it, yeah. Yeah, chocolate chocolate cake Niala looks kind of better there. And, and then, then you, you guarantee hit the focus. crane. Yeah. And then the crane yeah. won't die from a lionfish. Yeah, yeah, that looks good. Okay. The problem oh. with <laughs> chocolate cake uh, Niala... <laughs> I'm the one one. Now, is it might just it usually dies to lionfish. So that is front, front load it, front load it. Yeah, so, yeah, but it forces you to front, front it. But I guess if you're gonna put it, Kyogre would never know that. Don't worry, he never. He the, would never. Guess. The one one on the crane is gonna make the difference. Well, mm -hmm. if he switches, if he switches to eight attack uh, lionfish, that's gonna be, or he just gets a level two Kyogre. That is, then. Oh, we don't know because uh, Stego's gonna hit it. Never mind. No, it's not. I forgot. He still has Niala. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so Stego is change. still going here. Sabertooth does saber. Ooh, the Sneaky saber. Sock was good. It's Saber in time. Oh, that melon. That and melon. then Cotty gets the first game. Wowee. It's my goat. Congratulations, Cotty. That one was very Lauren. close. That was a lot of draws. Yeah. So all those drama dairies. Well, well played by Cotty to find the drama line. I am very happy <laughs> with the drama dairy win. <laughs> the drama dairy <laughs> showcase. All right. Eggy, do we have another fun fact? Yes, I got you. Did you know moles can eat prey in just 230 milliseconds? It's the fastest of any animal or mammal, excuse me. Did you say prey? Yeah, I heard prey. Yeah. Oh, like yeah. P R E Y. I thought you meant like the mole will oh. pray before it eats. <laughs> you think this mole's going to church? <laughs> Thank you for this food. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for this warm. <laughs> now I'm just thinking about mole Jesus. <laughs> and mole we trust. <laughs> All the prages in the chat. I'm crying. <laughs> So we're hoping for Jerboa this game. We are. I think. All right. Cotty and Kyogre, it is the same code. Oh, Kelby's in the waiting room. I didn't see Kelby. Yeah, we got Kelby and Let's Violet see. in the waiting oh, room. Oh, and Violet. We'll bring in everyone, sure. Woo, big party. Hello, How's it going, Kelby and Violet? Hello, hello. Howdy doodly. Okay. What a game. That was a good game. Oh, you just have to say a fun fact about moles and Kelby appears. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Kelby, do you I have any fun like facts? In the waiting room. I got you. Um, other than you're looking really cute today, Scoo, I've got nothing. Oh, thank you. That is fun. <laughs> wow, so did you see the streamer for brownie so points? Gonna, Man. <laughs> I was going to tell him he looked cute today, but then I didn't want him to think that he doesn't look cute every day. It's just like a today thing. I hate that. I think that... I tell Scoo enough that he's cute. You do. And I appreciate it every single time. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. I'll be it tomorrow. <laughs> I really hate that my because I get to see my turn one team. My turn one teams always look so strong. <laughs> they do. Maybe actually. you should have. I had I had the double mouse there. Someone said Scooty more like Cutie. I'm crumbling. <laughs> <laughs> Real. I mean, it's facts. Uh. <laughs> I used to uh, in. When I was in high school, I was dating this girl, and I had a reminder set on my phone. I had an alarm that went off at 5 o'clock every day to text her and tell her she was pretty. Take notes, Really? <laughs> oh. Man. Can I be yours? I... All right. Let's see what... Pa okay. There is strawberry and kiwi yet again. There is Jerboa oh. with apple. You called it, Sag. Oh. Oh, yes. Are they yes. going to go for it? There's and, and, mouse. and mouse. There's no worm yeah, or owl, but... No, so not the worm. 
And this is the first time we've seen the chicken. That's the first time we're seeing, uh, is it Llama, right? On oh, the yeah. first animal turn yeah. seven. First Llama as well. Ooh, Does anyone go for the Jerboa? Yeah, and it's chicken mushroom. Mm. Chicken and we have the guys. Velociraptor hitting the strawberry too. It's a good pack. Hedges is saying Cotty is cooked because there's chicken. <laughs> <laughs> this is a really good start for Kyogre. Hopefully hitting the level up on the Marmoset. This is a great start. Cotty being up 1-0 is huge, though. Kyogre mm. has to win two in a row. And they both so, go uh, back up to six. That was actually a throw round. Cotty succeeded. Mm-hmm. Where's the snail? <laughs> <laughs> Anything Whoa. good to hit with the chipmunk? Rice? Could do a little pivoting Rice is action. Always good. We yeah, have Rice, Baboon. Capybara. Baboon to hit the lizard or Wombat. Wombat probably doesn't seem that great later on, though. There is okay, Crab. We also crab haven't seen Crab yet. Ooh, I do like the Cappy here. Yeah, I love the good. Good. You gotta buy the lizard. Are you Ooh, another oh, oh, that's such a good Lord. turn. Are you strawberrying this lizard next turn? Oh for sure. And just keeping this lizard going. Strawberrying that lizard so quick. God he does get the flea. I think this lizard's just too much, yeah. Kyra's gonna probably win the next few rounds. Capybara is just such a big tempo swing, too. Oh, yeah, for it's sure. Like Not selling the Kiwis yet. I guess it doesn't matter when it's you sell it. Again. Again. Oh, the yeah. oh in, into oh, the flea. No. For flea? Into wow. the flea. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh, boy. And, and it's a 4 6. It is. And, and the, the, uh, the flea has, has the strawberry. So Cotty's probably committing even more to this flea. That's rough. Level two. Frigate? Do you? Yeah. Do you? Do you freeze the frigate bird? Oh, that's <laughs> a good I level would. up there. I mean, oh, if he's yeah. committing, if he's committing to flee, you can commit to frigate bird just as hard. He goes level two flee. Yeah, that is true. Because I think no matter what, Cotty's not selling this flee, even with the frigate bird on the opposing team. I agree. He knows that Kai will have to get rid of the frigate bird eventually, right? <laughs> eventually, surely. Ooh, the oh, rice chipmunk. Oh, it so did frigate hit frigate bird. bird. Doesn't... Wait. Oh my god! And oh, and the Kai wins the trade wins because of that. Oh <laughs> wow! He's a gamer. The, the oh, frigate bird getting the weakness yeah. allowed Kadi to win that round. And Kadi's lizard taking oh, the yeah. hit we before Kai Ogres. Yeah. The, the flea was bigger, so it hit, yeah. Big flea tag. Doberman again. I don't think Doberman. No, no. probably not here. Mm -mm. Uh, definitely, definitely would be too early. Falcon, Falcon seems sucks. good. It sucks because you don't get the stats. It, it might just be better to roll with double Cappy. Yeah. Try and hit it, maybe another Cappy. Ooh, or Baboon. Freeze yeah, freeze the Falcon. Do you immediately buy it and then just roll two? He says it's good enough. It's, I think it's good it's to you got you got to get that frigate bird. <laughs> <laughs> it was so big. It was. I, I think cannot... The frigate bird being big was why he dodged it because it would absorb the weakness. Oh, because oh, it's guaranteed hit. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Mm. Onto that flea. I mean, yeah, I think Kyogre is still just gonna pivot off his frigate bird eventually. I would think so. I think you have to. Yeah, what's this frontline lizard we're? Uh, yeah, I don't know. At... He's probably gonna oh, I, okay. Kyra, I thought Kyra ended the turn. You got more time. <laughs> Thinking about positioning a little bit. Level two on the flea as well, so it hits the frigate bird again. But oh, and then you summon a lizard. Oh, oh, no, oh but then the falcon gets the lizard tail. <laughs> 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 oh man. A Falcon and Lizard is too much. It's like playing tennis and tossing no, the pets back and forth. 
There have been a lot of falcons today. I guess just whenever you see it, it's worth grabbing. Mm. Mm -hmm. Camel, my love. Camel might be too late, but I don't know. Six six is good. Selling kiwi, buy selling kiwi. Does Kai get a flea of his own? Or do you just take this avocado? Uh, for the next, yeah, that could be it. And then you Can spend you all that money rolling mm -hmm. with the cappy. Yeah, looking scrumptious. Yeah, like that. Looking mighty fine. Because then if you double up on the, get the level two falcon eventually. Let's go see what Cotty's doing. Cotty has the yak. Oh, I guess that's with the rice. Yeah, I Okay, yeah, I was one of the yak got here. Has the level up, has the musk ox frozen? What's the musk ox doing? Not for the so lizard like... tail or the falcon? I feel like it's too, I don't know, I don't think that's good enough. It doesn't even work with either of them, does it? It just works twice, that... like not a ton. Doesn't... No, it doesn't even work twice, right? Like they both... Yeah, it does work it. twice, oh, I, I think, because on faint, right? Yeah, if it lizard faints and, and like, lizard. it works on the lizard twice, maybe the falcon. Doesn't seem worth. No. Ooh. Does get the level up here, though. Notice that both Falcons killed each other, but they don't work on each other. <laughs> Infinite game. Wait, chocolate cake? cake Cotty does go chicken. chicken. Is Cotty looking for the chocolate? There is Mantis with Muskox. I love pie. Pie is always great. Is, is Cotty committing to this? Is he going to do Blueberry. it? Blueberry. Ooh, beast. Is this why he had the muskox frozen? Just for Mantis? I think is so. The is the that's muskox crazy. That's frozen. no hard. And Cotty's just going to Mantis this what? chicken? Wait, this is wild. He's unhinged. I think you buy the, you got to buy the pie, right? Oh, yeah. 100%. You got to buy that. Nope. Oh. Another Mantis. <laughs> okay, yeah, no, it's just hard roll for Mantis for Cotty. Well, I buy like... pies and you can roll for Mantis. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just, my oh, goodness. My God. <laughs> he just heads. Oh. This doesn't happen to me. He can't keep getting away with this. <laughs> yeah, he cannot keep getting away with this. Steals like the chicken. Chicken. No, and then Kyogre oh, gets the chicken. No. <laughs> oh, okay, man. So the amount of... That's that he lost this fight by is insane. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think it might be Jover. I just wait, he's got level two mantis. I'm ready. Into another yeah. chicken. Plus one one to Ooh. the shop. Canned. Get canned on. Get canned on. <laughs> zebra for stats. You Kill off the baboon. Or are you just going crane? Yep. And Interesting. No bananas in this pack, right? No uh, correct. Nope. Oh. Only cucumber. Mantis felt insane there. I, I. He did it. Yeah, he, I he just did it. Oh. Being on two hearts is scary with this mantis, though. Yeah. Because Cody probably loses this round as well. This lizard's probably too strong for Cody. And then it's mm -hmm. so hard to out position your opponent, even if you do make it out of this i know because you have you have to have the flea in the back well you can put mantis in the back yeah but, but then the musk ox wouldn't get anything get yeah i'm a mantis enjoyer so it, it's hard to Gee. make it work in a 1v1 well look at all them ants go i mean these that was oh that was okay. that was close okay yeah that was mm. close crane is so good Crane is Crane really is strong. Off. I feel like that lizard's really doing it him in. All right, Cotty just needs a good tier six. Cotty hits the fly, levels up the musk oxen. Wait. Oh, it, did he? No. He hit fly. Did he no, hit I was fly? saying that's what he should hit. <laughs> oh, okay. I was like, I was this is what you should do. <laughs> The Jerboa. Double crane to, to make a... sure that you stay alive. I is, think, yeah, I mean, you have good. to. Yeah. The breakpoints work out. Wasn't there a cheese on that front line, though? Yeah, there was a cheese, yeah, there is one, cheese one, on the fleet. Yeah, but one it was on seven, gone. so if it goes up at all... 
which is probably very likely to happen. Yeah, because Kyogre probably knows, because the Mantis is guaranteed going up to 16 health. See, this is the problem with positioning. Like, you just can't, you can't try to yeah. position him anymore. Mantis mm. does really corner you. Everyone in chat is praying. <laughs> For the Mantis? <laughs> They're, <trying so> hard. <laughs> They're praying like moles before their meal. <laughs> are pray and pray pronounced differently though they're spelled differently but when you say it, it's the same isn't it mm -hmm. yeah, yeah you just uh, english yeah. thing get that one wrong it right, didn't go up kill. oh no eh? oh, the oh the other yeah brains. the crocodile oh unfortunate all right on Rock to game so three Cody was cooking. It just we couldn't we couldn't see it. Getting all the content out of him though while he's here. <laughs> he needed more time to cook. Cody needs yeah, a, needed uh, a bit more time. Clownfish in the next shop. It's gotta be. <laughs> <laughs> no Jerboa. No Jerboa. That game. Yeah, no one decided Ow. to go for it. Honestly, I think it's still it's still just one Okadi, right? Because neither player had a Jerboa, so did anybody really win? Exactly. <laughs> and no one won with the Dromedary either. Facts. Speaking of facts, it's everyone's favorite time. <laughs> <laughs> Great segue. That was, a, yeah, that was a good transition. Thanks. It's the inner content creator in me. Uh, <laughs> did you know the frigate bird is sometimes called the man of war bird because it harasses other birds until they regurgitate recently captured food? You said mana what bird? The man o war bird, because it likes to go to war to other birds. I thought that was a jellyfish. Oh. Yeah, I was about to say, I thought that was a jellyfish. There is a jellyfish. Oh, I, also a yeah, jellyfish. So, oh. Not all, yeah, so frigate birds will, like, they'll fight over, like, they, they fight with each other. Like, one frigate bird will, like, build a nest, and then, like, six frigate birds will, like, fly in and all attack that bird and try to take its nest. They're, like, very aggressive birds. It's like battleships, but in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When frigate birds are young, also, they will sword train with twigs. Oh, in see, their look, see, look at my shop. Only you guys can see it. Look at that. My shop's always Dude, great. You should have competed. <laughs> my shop's you always saved good. $500. <laughs> oh, man. All right, here we and go. Game three. Yeah, and this is what Cotty gets. <laughs> oh, man. Is there any, let's see, is there anything for Cotty to hit that has faint, though? Double by up. double by frilled hope for cricket, or you just. Uh, <laughs> mm. oh, this is great. I bet you Kyogre's first board does not look like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kyogre's got the same as mine. Kyogre's got the okay, gecko ferret. To be fair, no, there is bad. silk moth is good, or not silk moth, the moth, regular moth. Yeah, moth is good. Marmoset is good. Yeah, ferret is good. Two threes. The I feel like if I'm Cody there, I think... Oh, that's a good start. <laughs> oh, and then of course. <laughs> wow, wow. I think Would if I'm Cody, I buy both the Frilled Dragons. Tank the first round and then I just so too. assume you get... Yeah, assume you get these crickets. And then you can probably win round two and then go back to six. I think I, I would have done that too. Just because I feel like pairs are very valuable. Yeah. Mm -hmm. like, very worse. Well, you yeah, almost at a triple. So in my game, in my game with no strawberry, would you pick up double kiwi? And ah. instead of forcing, because it was your second shop, right? So it was either it, it was, double yeah, kiwi first, or go two person. Roll, I think first roll was like uh, kiwi, cockroach. Um, maybe it wasn't cockroach. I know it was kiwi and hummingbird. I can't remember what the third unit was, but I think I bought the third unit actually. Um, and then my next roll was double kiwi hummingbird. Yeah. yeah, I would buy kiwis with mm -hmm. uh, rather than just running two squad. Yeah, I think three is just better in every situation. Ooh, Kadi gets the level up with these little guinea pigs. I just yeah, feel so bad. I feel like the guinea pig art looks so off compared to all the other pets. Yeah. <laughs> it breaks. I'm fine. Oh, Kadi just gives up on the frill dragon? Yeah, did not need to sell that frill dragon. Let's see, do we have good tier threes? We haven't really looked at them. Giraffe. There's... Have yet to have blob pill. That's some good ones. Here is the There's axolotl. Some good ones. There's also some bad ones. Axolotl Finally up. makes its case. 
with a decent amount of oh, synergy. I think Toad's good with the cricket. Toad's pretty good. Better than Flea. Flea's pretty good too. Going for the level three guinea. All you have to do is find one more. I like the squad. Yeah, this doesn't seem bad. We'll see what Kyogre hit. Any good tier threes? Snail. Okay, well, like the bug snail. Oh boy. Oh, that's that's tough. So oh, close. One health. At least Kyogre doesn't get the value off of the snail, so it's kind of a wasted buy. But obviously, you'd rather want a win there. Crab, double pug. Ooh. Double pug has good hits with turtle. Stego late game. Stego late game. Yeah. But you also have white tiger Stego. No, you have Stingray Puma. And you have Gariel and the Mosasaurus. Good pets for, or good toys for the late game. Yeah. I think Cotty's like definitely going pugs here. He's a pug gamer. Cotty is a pug oh, gamer. Yeah. Cotty, there's the drama dairy. <laughs> oh. 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 All your triples. it. Yeah, I mean, you definitely passed drama dairy there. Right. <laughs> good ton. That was yeah, a great yeah. turn. Getting pugs here is huge. Mm hmm. Pugs are always good. Breakpoints are not. Good. No. No. <laughs> It does still make the snail worthless. This is all sounds like a part of Cotty's plan. Exactly. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Good tier fours. Gariel, turtle could be good. Just scaling Manatee, from a sea lion. Sea lion yeah. Poison Dart Frog doesn't really have any good combos. There's manatee with turtle. Well, turtle. Mm, they're on the wrong. There's oh, no yeah, banana. Yeah, they're on the ones. wrong ones. You level two the whale and then you turtle whale. Yeah, I like that. Your yeah, turtle whale isn't bad. Get some. Oh, I guess it's awkward because what's the? You need to get whale higher than moth, or you waste your moth stat. You could you could sell moth for lettuce whale. Okay. Getting rid of the. I think PDF is pretty good here. PDF on like the cricket, get... or behind the whale. What? Uh, you couldn't get it with whale, but. Uh... Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, probably probably the cricket because then you get to uh, snipe the ox, which has been the main problem. Mm hmm. Yeah, I mean it almost one shots everything from the previous yeah, scene. Yeah, once PDF hits four, it goes mm -hmm. crazy. That I like the PDF buff that's coming. Wait, oh, what's the PDF? Buff? The poison dart yet. frog. Yeah, the, oh, I was like, yeah, the poison dart frog is going up to uh, <laughs> yeah. four damage. Not the files. <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> Not the files, egg. <laughs> it's that PDF. Oh, that was good. Oh, actually. Actually. Yeah. That was really good. Oh, wow. yeah, that's huge. It's, that's not a 50, it's not a 50 50 because we yeah. have buffs well. Yeah. So true. Holding the giraffe. He definitely saw that. Getting rid of the cricket for it. Yeah. Turn six giraffe. Like, yeah, it's, yeah it's, that's fine. Probably. Croissant? Is there avocado? Yeah. No. I just I would just rice this giraffe now. Double Ooh, croissant? Like croissant turtle, maybe? Yeah, I don't know what you're looking for here. Or croissant whale? I have no clue. Oh, no, you're probably getting... What? Or you're getting rid of Silk Moth. Or, oh. oh. That's why I would have just taken the rice. I mean, rice is kind of like a delayed yeah. avocado. Yeah. yeah. And the rice delayed is very safe. Avocado. It's a controlled avocado. <laughs> that's the one thing I hate about my avocados. It's so out of control. <laughs> very the wild. They need to be contained. <laughs> Oh, once, I mean, once Kyogre finds the level two pug as well, there's just so many good hits for it. I think we have a very even matchup right now. I think mm -hmm. so. Thoughts on, t on tier three pug? I feel like that unit you know, would still be like really good. It's going to be good, yeah. Yeah, I think crazy. it's still going to be strong. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like I liked Whale getting the buff over uh, Moth there. I also did, but it seemed like this positioning worked out better. So. 
Yes, he's better than us. Cody doesn't have any level up stacked up. Either way, it would work out good. Let us know. Traded really well into the front four attack. They could trade him for in. Like Whale would have as well, but I think this positioning. Yeah, Whale would have like triple traded. Are we dropping giraffe or sea lion? Uh, I, I feel like sea lion is never really the move outside of pack four. Yeah, I, I like sea like lion personally. Let's see, holding. I mean, double lettuce could get rid of whale for manatee. I guess it's good. Or getting rid of moth whale. for manatee. Mm. Whale yeah, turtles. and then do you let you buy <laughs> both both lettuce? Do you not double lettuce first? Yeah, no, I think you, you need... double lettuce first, right? Because this no, manatee is dying manatee in three either. turns either way, unless you can. Scale. Oh, I guess I guess there's sea lion. Just keep it scaled. There is not. There's, there's lemon. There is lemon. Yeah, so I guess if the goal is to keep the manatee around. Yeah, this is fine if you're keeping manatee. Which maybe isn't because Cody's going for attack. He got really lucky. No, I don't think a buff hit the turtle there, or maybe one did. Two no, it didn't. Five. It didn't. Right. Okay. Well, no, you're. No, the three five is just from sea lion. I think yeah. Yeah. I think both okay. Missed. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Ooh, Kyogre's going whale as oh. well, but on a Copier. stilt. It's whale, a whale, whale, whale. whale. <laughs> and manatee. Kyogre's manatee as well. That was great for Cody. Thanks, Sag, for laughing. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, that was me that laughed. Oh, sorry, David. <laughs> <laughs> oh, love your credit on. stolen. I think you just well, buy. Oh, I like pie. Yeah. I like pie here. So buy pie, much. buy sea lion. You have level ups for turn nine. He had the chance to do the famed sea lion split, where you. Oh, uh, front and back. Lion and front yeah, the sea lion sandwich. I don't. Oh. There, nobody's been buying awesome. pies. <laughs> Everybody hates on the pie. Are you yeah, distraught? I, I think pie's so strong. Pie whale looked really good there. It did look I great. Think, Especially with a turtle, pie seems great. Yeah, pie might be the strongest mm -hmm. held food like for its tier. Got a sea lion tear up, and look, what is that I see? A PDF. I'm exactly. Learning. I guess Cody does find the guaranteed level up immediately, which may be better than Pi, but I don't know. Just wait until you guys see Eggie's next stream. She's gonna be playing moles, calling them PDFs. Mold, just calling <laughs> calling everything PDFs. Yeah. You're gonna get a mole prage emote. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, if my mods are here, get working. <laughs> Oh, this oh, whale turtle's so strong. Perfect again. Yeah, it's Damage. it's cleaning. Yeah, There's you level, level up huge here. Huge too, because now you can potentially level two Stego oh, with yeah, Pug. Pug hits Stego. Oh, oh God, say it ain't. And now you can. Oh, you just, now you can target it too. You just drop this manatee. Oh, oh for, for sure. sure. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's gonna perish next turn anyways. It's going to perish. Feed it right, on. <laughs> yeah, I mean, <laughs> has served its purpose. If you lemon the manatee and get rid of sea lion, I guess sea lion's just better. You definitely get rid of that. I mean, you oh, yeah, free stats. Sea lion's better. Yeah. Turtle level up. My end up I think you hold pepper so you can get more guaranteed hits with this. Yeah, try to target it. Yeah. Because you're trying to target the whale. And you're you're pugging the well, stegosaurus actually, over the whale, right? You might not because the buff is so random. You might just go with because whale's gonna trigger. So stego always hits sea lion here. Yeah, I think level mm. two whale is actually better. Okay. But then, would you not want the sea lion in front of the stego you, you, to get yeah, the melon? The, position, the melon, the yeah. Is, okay. I like. The decision to. Like, oh wait, oh. wait! That actually triggered in a d way I did not think it would. Yeah, that was a very interesting. Uh... Oh, that was oh. good. Oh, you held this so close. Well played. I think you do switch to uh, level two stego though. Mm. Like you. There's also I very good options. Yeah, level two whale. Oh, never mind. Go. I didn't see the oh, whale there. Is it two? German I mean, Shepherd. 
Ostrich already has two things for it. No, I don't I think Ostrich might be too slow. No. I think Shepard would be like Shepard just doesn't provide enough. I yeah. Think. What are the other tier sixes? I guess if the rest of the tier sixes suck. There's no, Fly, Mammoth, Leopard, Leopard fly. Mammoth. White Tiger. Leopard. Pug's probably just better with the stats it already has. Yeah. I think Leopard's your dream. Do you ever Clearly you that? have to lemon something. He has croc. Does it does he have a level two croc even? Uh I think it was, it was hit from the Cotty. pug. Yeah, yeah, I think I think Cotty has to lemon the something to survive yeah, well, well, the crocodile. If, um, if Stego <laughs> if Stego keeps triggering that way, then Cotty level two Stego here and then lemons sea lion. And yeah, then yeah Stego's... and then and then it's guaranteed to hit whale. Well the yeah, lemon no, the lemon Stego disappears could... from the double shot. Yeah. Still oh, it's double shot. Okay. Yeah. Okay. If Kyogre keeps it chance. like this. No, because Kai hits Stego. Nah. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, and then it goes back. Yeah, this. this that tank be might be better here, though. This is good. Yeah, back tank that is, is better good. Here. Oh my god. Ooh, sub, yeah. Bottle? Are we are we ever stonefish the back to counter the crocodile? <laughs> Wait, that's huge. <laughs> that is huge. That'd be brain. kinda funny. <laughs> Cotty, buy Mammoth? the pie. <laughs> buy the pie. Oh, oh. There we go. Oh. Dude, we love character progression here. We do. <laughs> Let's see, does salt ever play a difference? Salt, Stego, no, because Stego's hitting the melon. If I has one mammoth, will he freeze the other? I was about to say, is Mammoth better here than Turtle? Because you get one Turtle and then two Turtles, but you get one Mammoth, two Mammoths. No way, though, right? And then Red no, Mammoth, Blue Melon, Mammoth. Melon, Mammoth. <laughs> Melon seems way better. Yeah. I like the Turtle a bit more. I think I there's a weird thing in me that says we need to protect the Turtle. Is there like Mantis Shrimp or something? Something that could kill his Turtle? There is not Mantis Shrimp. There's Leopard. I don't think. Mm, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think no. that would do it. No. There is. There is Garial, but Garial would have to be level uh, two. No, not. Yeah. I think you just look for stats. Rock. Yeah. Yeah. The the sea lion health is putting in the work. Does popcorn on turtle? Would that make sense? Or would it be worth the money? Help. I don't know. Do you want to go straight into the it whale attack? Uh, yeah, true. Let's Got see. Fly. Big pivot here. He Level two fly. Yeah. He switched to mammoth. The whale getting buffed is fat. Mm-hmm. Wait, kills through. Oh, he was gonna kill. Ooh. Good break points so again. I think Cody has it. Okay. Wow. Yes. Cody wow. takes it home. Wow. 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 That's my streamer. That's my streamer. My That's my most watched streamer right there. <laughs> wow. GG's to Cody. Dude, the underdog. Subs. They're on the way. God, he's going for it. God, he's going for it. <laughs> Both one seeds making final. Yeah. That's Dude. crazy. That is yeah. crazy. That's the reason why there are one seeds. And we get one wow. pro, one streamer. I think this is how everybody wanted to see it. Mm -hmm. This is how Shop Gods intended it. I don't know. I was still. I, could tell. I was rooting for my guy, M God. <laughs> <laughs> He did pretty well, though. You always beat me. Hello, hello. GG, Scotty. Hello, gamer. All How right. Do you feel? All right, good luck, Scotty. See you. Oh, my God. Damn, don't even get him a bathroom break. <laughs> just get him back in there. You just, just said content five. now. <laughs> it is best. Oh, it's best. Yeah, it's best of five now. Lots of games. Ooh. Best of speaking, five. Speaking of the games and carrying content, did you know? <laughs> um, <laughs> despite the fact that camels... What, what do you mean? I'm giving you education. Be grateful, okay? Listen, camels store most of the water in their blood, but they're also capable of drinking salt water with, like, no repercussions. So, no matter Repeat how salty back. you are during a game, what about a camel? Can't believe you just repeated a fact on us. I didn't. I said that said they stored the, their the water in their fat. blood before. Yeah. I didn't say but the salt water you're, you're one repeating before. Camels. Wait, that's mm. the same thing? 
Is it? Dead. Those are both water. You want a different one? Okay, <laughs> camels can shut down their nose to prevent sand from going in. Okay, that's is what that I'm exciting talking about? That is good. That's what I'm talking about. I'm an unpaid intern. Please, they didn't even <laughs> buy me Starbucks. <laughs> All right, let's see. So now it's Cotty versus Bagels in the best of five. Final. All right. I would love to see my streamer pull it off. My streamer? Cotty's like the E-Rob of the SAP community. <laughs> He's on dad. That's a bit rude. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> What's wrong with Erob? What's wrong with Erob? I love Erob, but in the context you're saying, I think it's a bit rude. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like nobody wants. Nobody that was wants a compliment. Like I, I, mean, I love Erob, but like, do people want to be the Erob of something? Is that a <laughs> goal you want? Googling who Erob is. <laughs> Just Google Cotty. <laughs> that that's Erob. <laughs> But but unlike E Rob, Cotty's gonna win the whole thing. Are you Eddie. manifesting that? Are you jinxing that? <laughs> it's, I'm manifesting it. Cotty said, "What the fuck?" Manifesting I mean, what the f? The, the people a, want a, a wombat fact. A wombat fact? Ooh. I got. Don't you. they have square Let poop? Me... What? Wait, what? That's my favorite fact. I think wombat. Yeah, they yeah, have they square do. poop. They, they do. Yeah, they, they do. No. Mm -hmm. Am I a wombat? Cube. And also, wombats use their butt as their main form of defense. If you're caked up, you're like a wombat. I want you to know. <laughs> Cotty? All right, Cotty and Bagels, the uh, the lobby is sent in Discord. Cotty got them wombat thighs. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, Cotty could be a wombat because, you know, wombats can actually run as fast as a human. Fun fact. And Cotty poops cubes. <laughs> 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 who said that how did you know that fun fact like what in the god's cute, name the, inspired the you to learn poop? that i don't know i just you got i don't know i got fun facts sitting around Dang. that one's popular I, yeah i, I think that one's like, pretty popular that too all right well out the loop Cotty and bagels are not uh they're not joining the lobby <laughs> they probably they said, are rioting they no, they're rioting they, wait wait i was about to say they so just the hung against and drew they're riding. Cotty's in. Oh, no, they're in. They're in. They're in. They split the trophy hat in half. That'd be cool. <laughs> half a trophy hat. Oh, Imagine. yeah. Cotty's busy pooping bricks. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah. A little bit of uh, Kai knowledge. I have never seen somebody want a trophy hat as bad as Kai. Like, the entire competitive community, you know, we've, we've all had a dream of a trophy hat for a while. Kai is dedicated. He seems like it. He, he about oh, it. Well, poor Kai. He, he talks about it a lot. He's been robbed a couple of times of his trophy. He I don't it. think there was any robbing yeah, here. Yeah, I, I think that like, I think that one was really good. I think they both no, had. No, 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 no. Really... I'm, I'm not talking about like here. I'm saying he's been robbed oh, okay. a few times. Yeah. In the past. And those knee robes. <laughs> I will say maybe best of seven. Maybe Kai can take it, but. In the uh, in the tournament, I think Cotty played great against Kyogre. Very Wait, true. Uh, they yeah, both played really well. Yeah, they played. They both did very, very well. Smooth brain question: What's the score again? It's not updated on the on the stream overlay, and I forgot. Zero zero. It is updated. It. Wait, round, it is? Yeah. yeah. It is yes, the first round. round. My brain is smooth. Excuse <laughs> me. Don't mind me. Double, doubly smooth. <laughs> All right, we have the. Kiwi, but no strawberry. Lobster. Haven't seen any lobster gaming for pivots. We got the leech and the lollipop. No peacock, Sag. Mm hmm. Jellyfish is there. And monkey's shark always pill. strong. Yeah, shark with pill. We haven't seen pill a ton. We got fly again. Uh, I love to see a cuttlefish. Cuttlefish is really strong. It just has great base stats. It's great. Yeah, cuttlefish I mean, great really ability, easy. great base stats. Ooh, so, those are good ooh, level ups. Just... Yeah, I would like to see someone go a rhino this time around. 
I haven't seen any rhinos yet. And haven't seen they any crabs. Like I, I won with a rhino. What do you mean? Oh, you did? Like uh, Noob Skills game? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I thought the last time I was still crying. I'm so sad that you can't get Leech to still mm. on. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I thought you were going to say Leech, Guinea Fowl. Give me the two trumpets. I mean, that too. You got so many things that are like almost leechable, you know? Soak Moth. Guinea Fowl. Yeah, where's the Soak oh, Moth yak? I wanted to do it. There was one game where someone had it. Yeah, I, I didn't get yak. I went Soak Moth Manatee. One of the lobbies. Ooh, that's based. Yeah. Manatee's just cool. I do love me a manatee. Is the iguana manatee ever going to play a role? Uh, Doesn't really seem really, like it. Not really. No. Only sheep. No. There's no sheep mo no one up here. Okay. Yeah. There's nothing. Let's see. Let's go over to uh, bagels. Level three beaver. Is there bison for it? No, just going for the level three. On turn four. <laughs> yeah, that's that. This is a sick team on turn. <laughs> I'm uh, liking it. And the hashing chick, I guess, has not gone off. I guess bagels hasn't into the turn. Yeah, there you go. Bag, right? There you go. Let's we'll see the stat. No, this. Oh, this beaver's so big. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, I think they're just gonna try and tempo Cotty out. They're already up six to three. Just hatching chick things. Yeah, they need to level up <laughs> off the cricket here. Yeah, not caring about either of those. I don't think it's ever llama in that situation. No, mm -hmm. I mean if your easiest win con seems tempo. A reason mm. to look like kind of crappy scaling. Garlic so, here. You know. Garlic the beaver. And then hatching chick the beaver. That's a yeah. big beaver. And then you can <laughs> crab maybe because the crab will get a decent amount of health. Maybe not. <laughs> mm, woodpecker looks a little awkward. Yeah, woodpecker does look awkward. Uh, you can just have it. You can still have it front. Yeah, I can stay in the front, second. kill this flea. Oh. Good he doesn't. Oh, oh yeah. Because garlic the, on beaver. The beaver gets hit. Hmm. Frigate bird. Yeah, frigate bird. It's counter that. Frigate bird. Counter the weakness. <laughs> frigate gaming. We've seen a lot of frigate bird. And it's actually been playing like a decent role. Cotty does go for it. Cotty does this, woodpecker the bagels. Oh, this is bagels. Sorry. Bagels going to woodpecker the... Maintain the, the garlic, right? You get plus four. And then you damage the Oh, yeah, and then the woodpecker gets the weakness. Mm. That does seem good. And this beaver is still pretty that decently so statted. Brain. Yeah, that's really good. But yeah, why does... Why does oh, my God, that's so huge brain. brain. Like, in what world would Frigate be OP if it just worked on itself? It I would not. <laughs> yeah, probably none. But I just don't understand it. They're like, we can't, we can't let this thing... Hey, but now it's, now it it's getting weaker, but giving rice in battle. <laughs> <laughs> what bagels? is up with them and just giving things rice <laughs> I liked the bread that the dolphin had I also like that does bread. absolutely nothing double hatching chick feels strong yeah bagels is just trying to get a tempo win no cricket so can swap it out or sorry no flea anymore and Cotty goes Going for with the toy, toy gun, gun instead of... Hmm. Oh, not having Flea anymore just allows this beaver to kind of have free reign. Big beaver. Yeah. I also don't understand why the Flea got sold. I feel like there's a lot of like mid-units on his board that could have went. Like mm -hmm. Silk Moth, Iguana, mm -hmm. Silbug, any of these tier ones could have went. Yeah, because the flea is still strong, even if it hit that woodpecker last turn. Yeah.
And having the level up on turn 7 almost, maybe Kadi will almost have one. Tier 4s don't seem super strong, though. Oh my Triple Lord. Capybara. Oh That's my. Awesome. Ooh. If there was a way back into the game. Doesn't survive, right though. This is a way back in. Isn't that lobster? There is lobster. There's lobster. Uh -huh. Pivot possible. Pivot incoming. Getting a large blowfish Ooh. could be Dude. something. There's also banana pill. Just saw that. Oh, yeah. Mm. Let's go see what Cotty's rolling into. He's about to enter Glizzy Overdrive. <laughs> <laughs> 8 Buffalo. I think you just have to buy that. Yeah. yeah. Increasing grip by seven percent. Sag, can you please do an AI stream? <laughs> yeah, become an AI streamer. Who says I already don't on TikTok? Yo. I'll be on the lookout for it. <laughs> Oh, that's close. That's sad. That's garlic. Two value. health. I think Cotty's still good. Oh, Survives. Nice, yeah. yeah. Real good. Has the one donkey frozen. Back. Cotty goes for the donkey after getting rid of the iguana. <laughs> Not going for the synergy. Yo, Ooh, all these caffeine. The stats. Another caffeine. Do you sell the monkey or just stack them? I think you stack. I was thinking. You stack. Yeah, yeah stack seems stack. good. Mm. Yeah. Do you ever lack this pill for banana? Um, I can see a lock. Mm. I can see a lock. Maybe, but then you're like you're you can just roll for monkeys as well next turn. But I guess it gives you just more yeah. options to get it level two. Yeah, I guess it's just like what other food are you buying? Banana. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pear's not terrible. Onion chili's doesn't seem like good. okay, yeah. maybe. Yeah, chilies might be okay. That's it, the really, though. Foods are pretty good. I guess yeah. the pills, if you're wanting to go shark. I don't think Cotty's ever going shark, though, just because being on lethal. He's going to have a hard time. Oh, Here a we go. Here we go. Double monkeys. Ooh. Got the water oh, he, had gun too. he had double monkey last turn. But, uh, oh, he did? Yeah, yeah. Goes for the cuttlefish, fair. though. Still with He's the frozen in. donkey. Is this a bug? Yeah. He's going to bring oh. it in. Oh, no. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> nope. It's back. It it's back. Today. Big rhino. Is lobster? Lobster into rhino. Two very large units. Can you sell three things this turn to activate buffalo? You honestly... Just lock yeah. bowl for chinchilla. Easy. Oh. Cheese. Is cheese ever good? Maybe. I you could see cheese being a really no, good idea. Keep rolling. Could have. I guess egg I doesn't do too buffalo. much. Chili oh. rhino. <laughs> if only. I don't think chili rhino ever does anything mm -hmm. for the breakpoints. See how big Ooh, that oh, cheese is good. Geez. Still alive, though. Dude, that's that's like so in. close. Wow. Please, Cotty. <laughs> Lethal. Another monkey, another rhino. I don't think you ever shoot for the level two rhino. I like it. Yeah. I, I feel like that yeah. really helps with whatever breakpoint the eight is for it, but... Or do you sell this Cappy and have double Rhino just for a turn? Or is Cappy too good to pass up I was on? Say, I think Cappy might be too good, but it. it's yeah. hard to it's hard to get out of this team. Yeah, it is. See, even here, like, I guess it's drop lobster over Cappy. You get that, you get the Garial potentially. I'm down moose, I guess, with no value. No, you can just <laughs> take the Garial and right. Well, if you buy, if you buy sell garial too, yeah, you buy you buy the garial, you sell, then you buy sell moose, and then you get the stats on the buffalo. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, gotta get that value. Yeah, you can't commit to this melon. Mm -mm. It's foam sword. Oh, Cody oh, is confident. Whoa. Oh, the buffalo already hit. 
Maybe Cotty already oh, did. Oh, oh, perfect. perfect. Okay. And the moose does nothing. Front rhino. Turn front rhino. Yeah, I, I feel I, like I feel like the bagels has so much opportunity to try and beat the beaver cheese. The beaver cheese. No, he's <laughs> back. The beaver just has a little bit too much health. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Oh, it doesn't. Wow. Oh, it gets value nice. traded anyways. It's, yeah. A level two monkey. Fortunate. And a level one. I think Cotty just oh. lo lost too many rounds yeah, early. A level one. Yeah. It's not too bad, though. Yeah, just game one. Reminded me of my game. Not my streamer. <laughs> <laughs> Cotty's got this. C Cinderella story. Yeah, that was good. I think Cotty just had some bad rolls early. Because Cotty was down to lethal almost immediately. Hmm. All right. Any more fun facts? Oh, yeah. Google is infinite, my dude. <laughs> I don't have to stop. Um, did you know that koalas, their name means no drink, and it's based on an Australian Aboriginal language? And also, koalas are really good at smelling things, and when they eat eucalyptus leaves, they will sniff to find out which leaf is the most nutrient-dense one and leave the other ones behind. Wow, they're so smart. Aren't, aren't eucalyptus, like, no nutritional value at all, though? They're very low nutritional value, and they're also kind of poisonous to eat, so, you know, like, casual <laughs> things a koala does. <laughs> Cola. Mm -hmm. Damon, did you get a little pep wow. talk with Cotty there? Yeah, I told him he's got it. <laughs> Smacked him around, pull it together. <laughs> All right, well, let's immediately go into it. They're already ready. All right, my shop's not that great. I'm fine with it. That's a that's a classic Cotty shop. Ooh, ooh, horse. See the horse squad. And you see the frozen cookie. Oh <laughs> wait. Frozen cookie. Mmm, <laughs> tasty. Wait, frozen cookie than buying a kiwi. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this is Cotty's round to win. Oh, Let's see, is, is there? There is no. It's oh, it's. I guess. I guess freezing. It doesn't matter. There's cookie blueberry. Yeah. Mm. I don't know if I've ever bought a blueberry. Blueberry is not that great. Ooh, there is it's clown. Good. Cotty can go for the Drom Clown strat again. I guess you could Blueberry against Leopard. It only takes one. Like, if it's a level two, it doesn't take both. Correct? Uh, or does it take both? I don't know, because I've never, never played That's it. fair. <laughs> Hatching Chick, huge tempo again. There's Camel. Buy sell for starfish. I haven't seen any people go big starfish teams today. Also, early level two worm can do something. Yeah, I, I like worm. rabbit. Mm -hmm. Is there rabbit here? There is rabbit. Worm rabbit. And salad. And mouse. Mm. And soft ice later. And Five ice. rabbit into the soft ice. <laughs> Cotty does like going rabbit. Maybe it is a bait, but maybe it won't be. Especially level up the seahorse into the double mice on rabbit would be good. But Bagels is already up 2-0. Or I guess Cotty gets one back, so it's just one. Oh no, there's clownfish. Cotty's got it. There hit is it. clownfish. <laughs> Let's see what Cotty hits. Cotty hit woodpecker oh, camel. Not bad. Oh. I like a camel. Yeah, camel's, camel's probably still really good. Already selling the mice. No uh, camel. I guess it's you God, get the salamander this is, hit. This is why you don't buy salamanders because when you buy salamanders, you get baited into start a battle. Sally Gaming Sag. Ooh, little snail. Get rid of the horse for the snail, maybe? Yeah. Oh, I, I... Oh, okay. Are I you buying these two thing. apples? For your salamander? Maybe? Yeah. 
Yeah, this seems. I think that was Is a strong turn. Uh, I'll check after Snail this. Salamander? I think so. There's a draw here, yeah. I don't know, Cody might have wanted to lose there. For the snail? Maybe. There maybe. is lollipop. Oh, no, there's lollipop. Never mind, never mind. I don't definitely think don't want to lose. I, I was about to say, yeah, maybe you don't. I like even if there's not a lollipop, I mean it. Ooh, I love yeah, hopefully get, Ooh, have, like, I love two, all these two or so oh. bats. Oh. Even consider it. Just getting rid of the oh, woodpecker. Bat gaming. Getting rid of the woodpecker there is an inch. Just going triple bat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is yeah, I don't know if that's worth it. Yeah, yeah. People who don't know what tempo means, it's, it's from Johnny Tempo, the first professional sap player. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this garlic's good too. It's working. Yeah, the it bats are good. Weakness good. Where's Frigate Bird counter? <laughs> Frigate Bird is counter. in the pack. It is, it is in the pack. <laughs> Our Lord and Savior, Frigate Bird. Ooh, hatching chick is good. Do you just go parrot? I'll go parrot. Parrot hatching chick. Getting some start of battle here. Dude, have I ever parroted a hatching chick? This looks so foreign to me. I it does look weird. I don't think it works, right? I'd, yeah, I don't think I, it works. No, they're no both, because end of turn, it works the same as leech, I think. Oh. End of turn. It's, this should work. Yeah. yeah. It copies first and then it goes off. Oh, I'm learning so much. Get ready, everyone. I'm gonna. Is Cody freezing the rabbit time. just for respect, or is Cody actually gonna buy this thing? No, you freeze the rabbit so when you buy the lollipop, you get an extra health. Oh, so is Cody gonna mm. freeze this lollipop? Yeah. I... Wait, somebody's <laughs> yeah, saying right. parrot doesn't go off here. Oh yes. Let's see. Oh, it doesn't. It does. I love the crab. Oh, what? Yeah. Crab I seems good. It would still go off in turn, but maybe just any stats was just like, no. I feel like this should work. Well, they're very adverse to giving the parrot the ability to give stats. I, I'm honestly surprised that no Castego's start of turn. It's garlic. Start of battle. Yeah, I guess rather. we're just both. We're just being stupid. Ooh, that's, that's, that's a good bus. <laughs> I could have sworn it worked. I, I I really felt like it would work too, but was this this was from the previous turn? Yeah. 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 Okay. Lollipop on this salamander, double crab. Or I guess you crab first to go ahead and get the health stacked up. Oh, I wanna. Uh, I say you keep it. I guess just keeping one crab go on. instead of trying to level Ooh. two it. He's doing it. And then you parrot the crab. No, don't get don't get rid of oh, don't get rid of it. Oh. Oh, this is not the move. I think the crab's good, especially with weakness. I liked it. Especially after the yeah, lollipop it, on the Sally. It was okay. I think it was pretty good. It's okay. Yeah, you, you can shut me down. It's okay. <laughs> you can tell me it's bad. <laughs> I mean, this seems really strong. Hopefully, a level up on yeah, the hatching I don't think chicken. It was bad. It's just probably not better than a hatching chick. Mm. Tier fives aren't looking but insanely strong. There's that ocelot. We, we, have, we have armadillo hyena. Hmm. Oh, oh, that is armadillo a good combo. swordfish. Wait a second. <laughs> Hold on. But then your swordfish won't kill anything. <laughs> <laughs> but it yeah, also won't pepper? kill itself. Yeah, oh, right. I mean, where's Pepper? There is Pepper. Hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We haven't seen. I mean, we, someone did play Swordfish, but it was, it was like a last ditch effort. I guess it's been hard to get consistent level twos. I feel like every time you see Lynx in a random pack, it's being oppressive. Oh, yeah. I think you have to buy Lynx if you see it. Big okay, stats. I do not. Ooh. I like still cycling start of battles on turn seven with one level one summon. <laughs> that is fair. 
Okay. Cody looking good. Alpaca is yeah. good here because of the lack of consistency, just getting a level two much easier. Mm -hmm. Still have yet to see anybody anglerfish the other. Oh, I... Should I you not continue to scale the salamander? That's That was my first thought. Mm -hmm. I guess maybe... What's in the pack? Is he playing around something? Is there anything there? There's no skunk. There's no scorpion. steak or scorpion. There's no cheese, even. There's mm -hmm. salt. Yeah, there's salt, salt and then, like, cool. bell pepper, potentially, but... Yeah, I think you just get a salamander for now. <laughs> Ooh, the Tintin bus. Oh. That level 2 pair like, is going to be strong. Hair. Yeah, it's, that's a tough loss. You know, let's go look at uh, bagels. That level two parrot bagels will be good. Busting. I wonder what else it level can. Level two parrot looks like really good in this pack. Is there oh, stego? Yeah, there's Not there's stego. Link. Yeah, lynx could be a good Never copy. Remember. Mammoth would be good. Yeah, the tier. Uh, actually, uh, I guess it's not. Yeah, it's, it's not that good. I, I thought there was stego. Wait, is there fox in here? Wait, no. You parrot, no, no parrot I was about to say, no, I was going to say parrot beluga. That doesn't work, right? If you have a mm. fox, really also eat a food. Oh. That can hit. <laughs> oh. oh, that's so sick. Have you made that's a video huge. on that? No, no. Don't Is this somebody somebody was talking that. about it in my chat. Is this hyena doing much? I guess it's I making flame, the salamander uh, easier to kill. Uh, small, small sap tuber. I think he's done it. Flame 96. Oh, oh that's you're giving credit to my homie, of course. <laughs> also, oh, I hot. watched. Oh, apparently, okay. grounded did as well. Uh, okay, grounded did too. Not going parrot hyena here is so uncool. <laughs> <laughs> Chaos. Whoa. Okay, never mind. This was still cool. It was cool. <laughs> I think you get rid of it once the salamander evens out. Mm -hmm. But by the can, radio, can get rid of it. What about a fire ant? Yeah, a fire ant parrot. There you go. How do you guys feel about the fire ant buff on test server? I feel like it seems uh, good. Up. It hits the highest tier pet now. Is yeah. that what it does? Yeah. Yeah, I think just yeah, making German anything Shepherd. less random is good. German and Shepherd gonna Cobra. be happy. Yeah. Oh, they're both gonna be happy. And Warthog, a lot of good hits. Lionfish. Maybe Golden Pack isn't getting nerfed. <laughs> yeah, I think that's a huge buff for Golden Pack. So Fire Ant should be really good. Meerkat Fire Ant. Oh God, you're getting me excited. <laughs> 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 I we like the salt on the call. Rhino. Oh my. <laughs> That's a different kind of stream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like watching Debbie play is it's it's the best thing you can it's the best viewer experience for Seth. There's just so many things going through his mind. Let's see, double shot from the rhino is good. Sally's taking two down. Mm-hmm. And then if you level up this fire ant. Because Fire Ant's great alongside this bell pepper. Wait, isn't Stu good here with Hyena? <laughs> yeah. And if, like if they I mean, aim to okay. keep it. They are going Hyena with the Armadillo. Potentially. Getting rid of... I mean... I don't know. What do you get rid of? Lynx? We, we, all, we all saw it, right? When, right when you showed the pack, the first thing <laughs> you looked at was Hyena Armadillo. <laughs> And we know whoever goes sad. is going to win. It's sad that he has to abuse meta to win this one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, replacing it. Oh. I mean, it's probably it's probably good with this salt and fire ant. If only Cody would have taken that camp. Oh, and then you pair it the armadillo. That's what you do. Instead of the lynx. I guess it's really good with fire ant here. 
Oh, the, right the salt's doing a lot. Cotty is down to survive. one. Oh, there's a little axolotl. Look at uh -huh. it. Uh-huh. Little, little guest appearance. Aww. Pepper. Pepper's e probably good. Time. Yeah. Ooh, this seems good. And another T-Rex. Just oh. go another T-Rex and another oh. Rhino. <laughs> oh, my God. Wow, yeah, oh, life. man. Yeah, with four life, it's just... It's Jover. Good luck, Cotty. <laughs> We'll see what Cotty can come up with. Cotty's basically had the same team since, like, turn five. <laughs> Just oh, trying it to. It looked decent. It looked. It did like look a decent. Good team. Just trying to scale this bat and salamander. Bagels is just countering him at at every corner. Apparently, Bagels isn't just countering him. Someone in the chat said Bagels is just trolling and getting away with it. Can't keep getting away with it. I don't know. Bagels is making good plays. Like, I I can't comprehend them, but they're good. <laughs> <laughs> Me, this entire tournament. What a mood. <laughs> I understood yeah, I the double T-Rex play, though. Yeah, I understood mm. that one. Okay, we have the swordfish. Out. I guess the swordfish is just for the start of battle, mainly. Oof. All right. Bagels is up 2-0 against Cotty. This is gonna I be tough to crawl back from. That guy out of the tournament. <laughs> you could have. This could have been you versus Cotty, Sag. Yeah. If I hit if Camel I... and he didn't. <laughs> or if, if the snake hits anything else, like one yeah. out of five packs. Yep. That was just. Uh, I don't even want to talk about it. Get me out of here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's Unlucky see. Unlucky RNG baby rage. <laughs> Let's see if Cotty can bring it back. Let's we need a cool fact see. for Cotty. Cool any cool, fact any cool facts Cotty? about Cotty? About Cotty? Or for Cotty? <laughs> Cotty, fun fact: <laughs> Cotty was actually on the cover of World's Most Handsome Man three years running. <laughs> three years running. What happened the fourth year? Uh, fourth year. I think that's when he went into his E Rob transition. <laughs> <laughs> no. Became everyone's dad. I still have the I still have the Playboy 1986 with Cotty on the cover hanging on my wall. I wasn't okay. gonna talk about that fact. Whoa. Well, what a boomer. <laughs> that was for next time, when it's two two. But you know, Cotty might be going through some dark times. You know what lives in the dark? Anglerfish. Fun facts. Well, I'm so good at segueing. Thank you, everyone. Speaking for the of applause. dark places. <laughs> uh, Fun fact, though, not all anglerfish can produce their own source of light. Only some of them can, and it's at the end of their elysium, which is the little dangly thing. Um, there's a symbiotic bacteria that lives in there that causes it to glow. That's cool. Go. That you is cool. Like one cool. of the ones that don't have the glow. Like, you're not, you're not no, 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 real because angler. the other ones are like cool little cat toy looking things. <laughs> yeah, and they attract all... fish. Yeah, because all anglerfish will have a little dingly dangly, but not all of them glow. Do the male ones have a dingly dangly? Uh, I don't mean that in. I think so. But, but listen, funny you mentioned male anglerfish because the male anglerfish depend on females to survive. They have to latch onto a female and suck the nutrients out of her blood to live. Hey, there you go. I'm just like an angler. There we go. For real. Well, <laughs> Leech. All right, what we got here? Camel. There is camel. No elephant with it. Oh, I still can't believe there was elephant, camel, and leech in that one game altogether. Yeah, that was I mean, too much. Her, that I was too him. much. <laughs> Let's see. We got scaling. There is bison. I don't think you're gonna bison in a one v one. Giraffe is gray. Ox is gray. Well, big beaver into bison. I think could have worked that one game. That is true. That big beaver did do three. well. We, this is the first time we're seeing Shoebill with Strawberry and Velociraptor and oh, Seagull. Oh, no, that's Seagull, not uh, the Pelican. <laughs> Excuse me. And we got the Seagull. <laughs> the Seagull can give everything Strawberry. that you can Shoebill. Dude, dude, he's tripping balls. It's a long day. 
lobster the pelican and seagull, they look they look similar. Yeah, lobster we can. We also have spider like pill. Oh, spider pill. I don't think we've had spider pill in like any game. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. We haven't. Because I love me a spider. Spider pill is great. Are there good tier threes for it to rolling? hit though? Is there any other euphoric rush you get like other like when you pill a spider? Is there any other feeling like that? The yeah. level three stoat that you save for turn eleven. <laughs> 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 oh, there's so many hummingbirds. I feel like there's no better feeling than when you have like three or four sharks on board, and that's when you pill something. Oh my god. What's the what's the, I guess three threes. I I think he's throwing. I think this is a throw round. That's the only reason why you combine this. Yeah, but he's on five. Is there snail? This is not a throw round. I don't. <laughs> <know>. <laughs> he made it. He made it. It works. Uh, yeah, I guess. I don't know if. I yeah. Think he's just, I think he, okay, I think. The break uh, points for three three right. over two two. Oh. But like two. Yeah, but it's but two 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 is the same thing. <laughs> yeah. Or it's worse. Yeah. I don't. I, I mean. Whatever he won, I well, guess I can't complain. <laughs> and they're hummingbirds so when you already have a strawberry. So you're just oh wait, it yeah, back. yeah. Wait a second. Maybe he's just showing off, <laughs> I, I playing with his food. <laughs> Cody well, does hit the glitch. ox. That could have been a glitch we, we saw, like combining. Oh no, because it would have fixed it in battle. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe no, it's, it's a glitch. glitch. Sag. He actually still has four separate hummingbirds. <laughs> There's, I mean, Dove. There is a decent amount of strawberry synergy. Dove's really there strong. There's a pill. Yeah, pill on the Dove. I think Dove is pretty strong. Yeah, I like strawberry. it. Giving the strawberry to the goldfish. I guess so the hummingbirds have something really to I really like goldfish here because of lobster can. Mm -hmm. And when I, you're eventually... Are you not freezing this pill? Nope. Oh. Nothing. No drugs. Uh, 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 uh. You good? David? <laughs> I think he's, he's got to be trolling. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> he just can't comprehend what's going <laughs> on. <laughs> Wants to take it to a game five. All right. Yeah, you just—I think you gotta hold. Just, you gotta pill this thing. Never punished. God, I hate—I hate watching this happen. Wait, no, you gotta go bison? for the bison. Combine the it's hummingbirds, bison? please. Go bison. Wait, if there was bison. ever a bison, it's oh, right you now. You gotta be no. kidding me! <laughs> you're gonna—you're gonna buy a camel over a bison. That's right. Or That's another the dove. Way to play the game. Okay, to be no. fair, if he buys the bison, then he can't get his double hummingbird. That's I fair, but true. but winning with the bison, you can't write a better story. <laughs> no, you're right. he, should, he should have taken the bison. Staged. They're both going for the dove line. They are. That is good. Is I feel good. like Cotty's really happy to get these trades. Because these double hummingbirds have such strong tempo. Leveling up the goldfish would be huge. If you oh, stack sure. up a ton of money and then get the uh, shoe bill, potentially. Just stack up a whole bunch of money and then never use it. <laughs> <laughs> and just roll yeah, away we everything. It. Just a like... Big goldfish, big goldfish. Are we pilling it? Maybe? Here, we'll go look at Cotty. This ox is strong. Ooh, ooh I don't know. think Cotty has it frozen, uh -oh. though. Uh-oh. Oh, no, Cotty does have I'm it frozen. Yeah, Do you ever hold these strawberries for the potential of going for the shoe bill, or are you really wanting these pills? I I would lock at least one of them. Mm -hmm. Just in case I hit shoe bill. I don't think you need to lock both. Mm. Agreed. Most of the time, like, you won't even want to be buffing that many with shoe bill. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We'll see if Cotty hits it, though. Wouldn't still be good. Oh. Ceratops. Yeah, I don't know. Probably better than nothing. Another giraffe? Do you double up giraffe, or is it... 
too late. Probably too late. Oh, goes for it. Never mind. It's never too late. <laughs> never too late for the giraffe. Well, like, what other scaling options are, are in the pack for, like, turn four? There was penguin. Manatee. And yeah, manatee. manatee. Penguin? I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know about that giraffe. Any, any scaling the giraffe. Not like, the seahorse. Yeah. Weird. Wait, what is... Okay, his team didn't improve. No. no it actually got worse. It got worse. Got rid of the dove. Did he lag out, or is he just freezing his whole shop? Be canning, he could be canning. Mm. Could. Holding can, lobster. Yeah, I, I mean, we can. Um, Bagels does love his cans. He loves big T sixes. Yeah, yeah, just okay, a bunch yeah, of cans. Yeah, hold, hold lobster oh, can. Boy. I knew it. I called it. Level up this goldfish oh, on nine. <laughs> Four cans so far. <laughs> this is funny. Is it good though? If he hits. No. If he <laughs> <laughs> I think if, if he hits, it just goes crazy. All right, well, let's see it. My body is ready. Like, good tier fives, too, if he gets a couple good tier fives. Blue ring something? Oof. Angler to steal uh, Triceratops? Or do you just go uh, snake? No, snake? Definitely snake. Snake, snake. snake is yeah, very good. Wait, but anglerfish is two units. Snake is one. I, you got mm -hmm, me there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 817 manatee, no joke. And can lemon it. Yeah, it. lemon that thing. Yeah. Another, Another blue one. ring. Here we go. Buy can. Right, I guess you're just buying lemon first. Wow. Not lemoning manatee. Uh, yeah, you can just pivot off manatee. Yeah, this is fine. This is strong. This was a good pivot. I don't, I don't even think he yeah. hit, and it was just a good pivot. Mm. Yeah. There goes one. Oh, but Cotty still wins this? Mm -hmm. No. no. Not the ox no. isn't good enough. Really bad for Cotty. Yeah, Cotty yeah. needs to win very quickly. Especially if bagels can hit the level two on the blue ring. Putting a pepper on it. Is there is it catfish? There is it waffle? Is catfish, but there's not waffle. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Are you just gonna pepper the snake here? Or you just roll for more? Ooh, that's a good hit. <gasps> oh, we found this may one. be it for Cotty. <laughs> uh oh. I think Cotty needs to win these next two rounds. It's not Jover till it's Jover. Never back down, Cotty. Oh, okay, has okay. the shoe bill oh, and the monkey. Bill. Okay. Lemon. Uh, I still lose it. The oh. pepper's yep. so good. Oh, it's close. Dang. Cotty does have scaling that can compete a little bit now, though. Yeah, yeah he does. I, yeah. I think so. Yeah, so Cotty's not out. That was a good roll for Cotty. Unless catfish here. <laughs> yeah, catfish one would be less. great. One less one. Are you Maybe going? Octo. Yeah, octopus. No. Oh. Really? Oh. oh my god. Oh, hold the anglers. Four. Four over. Four over manatee. Well, you can't get it this no, turn. No, no, I because I I think you just go for catfish, don't you? Uh yeah, yeah eventually. Yeah, I guess you're still that. looking for it. I it was, I thought the manatee play was kind of weird, but maybe you could have grabbed fly too. Like fly is probably good with snake there, you get more triggers, but Fly is good too. Maybe you do just greed. I don't know. You only have two lives. Do you really want to greed for catfish? I don't think you do. You're unless you searching? leveled up into it off of the uh, blue ring. That's what you were hoping for, I think. Mm. Yeah, I, you can't I agree. That's, for it. that's why I think not taking the blue ring. Right oh, away. yeah. Fly would feed Cotty's Triceratops, potentially. But it also could just break the melon, so. Get another snipe with uh, Snake. Snake. Yeah, probably still outweighs. I like how you just elected to freeze everything and just decided. Yeah, <laughs> I do just, yeah. I do this just is a this is a future right problem. It's like my yeah, like, Oh, double shoe bill. That is getting big. Ooh. 
That's getting okay. real big. If Snake shot the, the uh, uh, yeah. Is it Knuff? Someone said. Oh my gosh. <laughs> is it is it Knuff? Yeah. <laughs> Right, the catfish is here, but you're on lethal, so... Yeah, no, this is too late now. <laughs> you needed yeah. it I think you're, three turns ago. I think I'm going boar. Yeah. And then just another boar blue top. ring. Maybe oh, popcorn? I, no, I think you want pepper, don't you? Yeah. You want everything? I don't think popcorn's good enough. Even even tomato would be better. Is Cotty looking for Velociraptor? Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, that would kind of suck with ox, but you'd have ah, to true. Yeah, if it, if it hits the ox. Yeah. Front ox. This is a huge salt. Even then, front ox is kind of Yeah, this weird. salt could be good against the triceratops. Does it even kill? Oh my God. It doesn't oh, kill, it I doesn't don't think. Kill. Nope, it's off by one. It's so good. Dang. Oh, no. Not oh. yet. Oh, the yeah, snake's nice. still strong. I think if your bagels are just turns. you're just wanting peppers and more blue rings. Maybe and I guess these these, pretz, these pretzels are hitting for four as well. Do you think he'll find more blue rings? Peppers. Mm, he could. I don't think you focus solely on it. No, mm. the opportunity cost of of having it. Ooh, there is oh, one. There. If he if he Ain't lives, no that's way. insane. I think if Cotty doesn't win here, he's going to have a hard time. Mm -hmm. mm. He is still out scaling. He is. He, I was about to say, he still has really good yeah, scaling. We'll see if, two units. We'll see if Cotty's pivoted to a yeah. uh, Velociraptor or anything. Okay. Snake. He got his own has snake. snake. There we go. And Hit then he's going to go fly. Yeah, Shoebill probably has to go. Yeah. The anglerfish is good because you can't like hit a bad unit. Every unit off the opposing board is good. Oh, by one, oh, he misses break that point. break point. Uh -oh. Wait, and the snake's go. going. Cotty does get this one. Yep. Wow. Oh. All GG right, GG's to Cotty. Cotty does oh, not get skunked. Right Can Scotty reverse Damn. sweep this? That's my. Right. That's my goat. On game, we just finished up game three out of five. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yes. Bagels is up 2 1. Jeez. But he's in the zone right now. He's got his wide camera on and everything. <laughs> <laughs> he's got the wide camera. I freaking love Cotty Wide. It's such a vibe. It gives me serotonin. <laughs> then he just gives you that smile. <laughs> I, that was my favorite part of the watermelon stream is when he's just staring dead into the camera, like scooping <laughs> the watermelon into his mouth. All right, let's just immediately get into it. They're already ready. Jeez. Wait, uh, bagels on pack two? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, we'll see if it. It normally just forces, but it could be a bug. Yeah, no, I think it's just a bug. I think it is. Somebody says, I want Cotty to win, but it's been seven hours. <laughs> <laughs> and well, we're going to game five. Yeah, since Cotty's already won, Cotty has to win out. It was either get 3 0 or bring it back. He's got to win three in our, or two more in a row. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Cotty has to that. value these people's time. Wow. Can't, can't hold it to game five and then lose, so Cotty's got to win now. <laughs> yeah, Cotty wins on turn seven here. Oh, He's I do just have to. Doing revenge. <laughs> I do have to pay Maybe out the prediction. Eight. All right, how we'll much look of at the, the turn he's left? It depends how much juice Cotty's got left. <laughs> <laughs> how much Cotty's got in the tank? Yeah. Bring out the cells. watermelons. <laughs> Let's see. We got he melons. Needs, we have cows. We got some decent scorpion. stuff. Scorpion, where's where's the scorpion moose gamers? Oh please no. <laughs> Cotty cheese, let's let's get this going. I guess rolling for a level up, yeah. Trying to get the level mm -hmm. two balloon. Is there? There is not flying squirrel. Camel. 
I haven't seen have anyone seen going for the. Uh, we have not. I don't think. That is insane. Thank God. Maybe Grounded's randomizer. Maybe Grounded hates the mandrel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure Lionfish wouldn't have been included. That, that's the only one that would have been out. Eggy, people are uh, people are wanting the fact. Oh, sorry. I didn't want to interrupt because you were like... <laughs> Everyone was so ready for the next game, but uh, fun fact, if it's dinner time for y'all in the U.S., uh, did you know one of the hungry animals of the sea is the seahorse, but they actually don't have stomachs? They just got to continuously eat to keep them satiated, and they feed about 30 to 50 times per day and can eat up to 3,000 pieces of food per day. I'm a seahorse? What? Just like the last wow. fact, Just like me for real, dude. He's, He's like me fact. for real, for real. <laughs> I see they both hit the level two ferret, but Cotty just hits it on combine, so it doesn't get the level two balloon. Now I just imagine seahorses are like one of those Cheeto girls, you know, that always has a bag of Cheetos. Oh, Isn't that a snack. gamer bro stereotype? Like a giant thing of Mountain Dew or Monster and just Dorito dust on the keyboard? No, I'm thinking Dorito, about like the, the Cheeto. Girl, two different the things. The girl at school oh, so who sorry. always had a, had a cheat like a bag of Cheetos in the back of the class. It was hot Cheetos. Yeah, like hot Cheetos and the teachers, I asked them six times to put them away already. I think I'm going to get canceled. I don't like hot Cheetos that much. I don't think they taste that good. I think they were better in school. Mm. I liked hot fries. Chester's hot fries, the, that was my go-to. I like Cheeto puffs, and I like to eat them with chopsticks so my fingers don't get the little cheesy dust on them. What? That was the most <laughs> eggy thing I've ever heard in my life. What? <laughs> You guys That's, so, that. That's so good. No, my favorite part is licking the, the dust off of my fingers and others. Oh, hell no. Uh-uh. <laughs> Give me your dust. <laughs> Give me your dust. <laughs> Give me that sweet, sweet, cheesy dust. <laughs> Bro, you, you in here eating Cheetos without me? You know I want your dust. <laughs> <laughs> All right, is Cody going to go for the level three ferret here? Oh, I yeah, think so. Going to keep this ferret going? I feel like Cody's just making up for like the miss. Like, you remember when he buffed the ferret earlier? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's proving yeah, that the ferret is what you keep around. Double slug <laughs> seems good. Yeah, but a you crow know, is so hard to get. Yeah, that is true. Is slug good with anything here? There is spino Ox. or stego. Not, not spino. Poison dart frog. Ox can oh, give more attack. Yeah. yeah, there is poison dart frog. But le I guess leveling up the slug isn't super important. You could still just go crow. I almost feel like PDF still just doesn't do anything. Like, it, it just is never enough. That's why the plus four damage is going to feel good. Mm -hmm. No, I do think it's a much needed buff, but like... I think it's a fine tempo thing to slot in, just because it's like you throw it be like in this case where you throw it behind a slug, it's it's doing what nine damage. That's, well, like I play it, I play Golden Pack a lot, and even with the support for PDF, it just it feels like it just is never enough. But I guess it's yeah, Static I, Pack. I agree. It's never like you never want to use like Emu with it and make it like your main engine. I just feel like it's like a fine like tech unit. Maybe uh, the the buff is much. Though, but I feel like it's a little bit better than people give it credit for. It's a lot of damage if you have the right unit. If only there was the axolotl to pair with the slug ox. Oh, oh. Right. just stat oh. up the melons. Cotty pulling ahead a little bit here. Yeah, Cotty is. Cotty does love a good ox. I think you ox do. Ox is good. I think you commit to this level up on the moth already. It's not yeah, worth holding all of this. Maybe buy an avocado for turn seven. Chameleon with the balloon. <laughs> oh. Is there a pill for it? No. No. There is Stingray and Mongoose and Gariel. So stacking Good up toys. Stacking up could Chameleon could be something. Two. Goes for the slugs. Maybe trying nice. to go to Spino. Gonna stat the slug as well with the balloon. Pelican feels like the worst random pack unit. I feel like every time <laughs> I see it. <laughs> yeah, it does not seem great. If there was strawberries, the poor just, guy. Like, <laughs> like, at least Shoebill. Shoebill doesn't show up that much. I feel like we haven't seen it much. There's been, like, a Pelican every game. Mm -hmm. Never show up. <laughs> Pelican's actually decent tempo. 
because you do get the plus two plus one during battle. Mm. Yeah, true. The double beta fish is gonna be good. I like what Cotty's got going on here. Yeah, this is a good team. Especially yeah. like saving it for getting Spino in. But as uh, Bagels proved last game, he can do whatever he wants for the first seven turns. And that is out. true. <laughs> Reverse sweep. Yeah, that, probably going to level up this beta fish. I'll see what they get. Beta fish is so good. Mm -hmm. Very, very Ridiculous. good. Hits yeah. the goat. Going to go for polar bear or stingray? Polar bear could be good. Maybe not on three hearts. I don't know if he can go polar bear. Yeah, I was say, I don't know if he can go polar bear here. Okay, well. <laughs> he's he's going to do it. He's going to do it. Getting another balloon. He's got to find something to cook. Buy two big pairs. Big Triple big toad. Big. <laughs> Look at some toads. <laughs> get the toads. No, oh, just no. get rid of it. The That's toads a decent so hit. Peaceful. Yeah, you just, just where you get PDF. Out, in. Yeah. Um, would you say, Damon, that both were running Big Ferret? Yeah, they both ended up going yeah. Big Ferret with balloons. That's, yeah, that's level pretty three. Close. Yeah, this Ox will be a good hit. I wonder if Cotty is going to try and go Poison Dart Frog. I think it wouldn't be a bad hit. Mm. Ooh, okay. Wow. Rhino something. Ooh. Breaks the Melon is good. He gets, a, he gets value out of that. Takes him down to two. Yeah, Cotty's just going for tempo now, trying to win. Bagels is going to have to cook faster. This big ox is going to be a big difference, though. Let's yeah, see, what tier fives are we eventually looking for? Still haven't seen stonefish. anyone really go much for the stonefish. I think stonefish is still really strong. Stonefish could be really good here. Yeah, Talk. I think it's insane that we haven't seen more stonefish, because it's especially in 1v1s, it's just it's so good, man. Mm hmm. I think Cotty's also, with as much health as he has, can go this Spino and be really strong late with the slug. Gotta buy this slug. Oh, this I ox right here? Komodo. You gotta buy this ox, right? I think you have to. I don't think you can risk going down to lethal against a scorpion pack or walrus pack. I think you have to now that you haven't found anything else to freeze. It's well, you would apple, get a gold, yeah. You would get a gold back. Roll. Take your, take your goat. Champ. Oh, you're, you are darn right. Look at you. <laughs> <laughs> Sound like a proud father. <laughs> it brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> Ooh, oh, gets the draw. I oh, that's a huge for bagels. That is great for bagels. The greed pays off. Yeah, very large ox now. Level is level three beta, beta fish. I think he might as well. I don't know. I feel like you want to get out of that. Yeah, you have a lot to roll for. It's really cool though. That's fair. What do we start statting with the polar bear? I think you have to get rid of polar bear, but no. Okay, so he's gonna he's gonna. I sell Gariel for instead. sure. Gonna go farm sword, the oh, item of choice. Know. Wait, oh, yes, get that. Go lionfish. It. You're on two hearts. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> Just go for it. Wait until you're on lethal. Yeah, I mean, he did get a uh, tempo improvement with Big Ox. I mean, he could definitely win this fight. Cotty does not have that much. So. Mm -mm. He doesn't have a lot of growing. If Cotty levels up into uh, Spino, though. Into Spino, yeah, it needs Spino. Hit Walrus oh. instead. Ooh, the nut. Uh oh. Wait. Got rid of the melon, really? at least. This is starting to look bad for Cotty. Mm -hmm. yeah. This is polar bear he needs, he needs good level ups. It is You're cooking something with the polar bear, though. Yeah, maybe it's also a lot. It's a stingray. Um. <laughs> Interesting. No, this is not what the chef ordered, but it is Wait, what we level... were getting. No, you can't level two polar bear here. Yeah, this gold breakpoint is really, really awful. He's gonna ah, do it. God, he's gonna risk it. Let's go to health. We get rid of Walrus for Komodo. Get rid of Walrus for Komodo. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you just roll everything. 
Dang. Uh, I guess it's fine. So I'm uh, yeah, pointing out. Scorpion. Okay. Cheese? I would freeze a pepper, I feel like. Yeah, pepper on rhino is always food. good. I think Cody's just really bar. wanting this spino for this I slug. I too. Oh, that, that could have been really thin. good. <laughs> oh, but now... Yeah, he, oh, the rhino there would have actually tied, but the, but the one health... Because I think he's like, the polar eight. Hit? Polar hits scorpion. That's yeah, great. it would have tied. It would have tied the rhino there. That's unfortunate. I guess this, hitting the scorpion isn't terrible, because now scorpion's totally fine against these foam swords. Mm. That's true. But, I mean, a big stingray would have been... Akati, you have to. Wow. <laughs> Akati oh, immediately God. sells. Akati, you have to. <laughs> <laughs> cool yeah. He's a content creator. He's got this. Freeze that stonefish, please. Aww. Aww, I think Akati's just it. wanting oh, the committed you buffs. Attack. You, yeah, you want a 21 attack scorpion. Are there melons? I think there were melons. It's the ox. But oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that, that lionfish has been cooked. Mm-hmm. Bagels has a really good team now, though. And he got, yeah, and he got the spino. spino. This is rough. Yeah, but Cotty is cooking bad. up something of his own. Someone asked, what am I looking at? You're looking at elite gameplay. This is how you play Super Auto Pets. <laughs> <laughs> you tell him, Meg. You gotta buy the scorpion. That's such a big score. And then you melon it. Dude. Then, <laughs> wait, oh you, my god. You melon it? You melon Cook it another, you put one. another one. <laughs> you put squirt back and walrus Poison dart? Does poison dart frog? Melon no. Squirt. <laughs> Peanut bag. That would be crazy. Do you? I like mongoose here. Yeah. I like freeze mongoose. Because you have three but... hearts. Not you... buying the melon. A little weird too. Yeah. I guess Cody really wants to find this lionfish. Yeah, you could have just meloned on, like, this slug. Wait, how does this breakpoint work? Because what is uh, Bagel's lionfish? 24. 24. <laughs> that's, a little, that's a little risky. Uh, that's a little risky. That is, that is a little risky. Ooh, but it, oh, it gets everything. Oh, yo. Ooh, it oh, missed. Value. It missed. Okay, walrus at the right Oh, thing. and then oh, it hits. Oh, the oh, my oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That was... Cooking. <laughs> That round was so lucky. That was so yeah, lucky. That, that is, now Cody's getting a giant lionfish with a melon. Oh, uh, that's unreal. And then you buy you buy some mongoose and first. Mongoose. Oh my oh. god. Wait, okay, what? What was that? Why what? do you like on the melon? Why do you not buy some mongoose? What? Cody might also melon. be getting tired as Does well. Does Cody care more stinky about sock. stinky sock over? He cares more about stinky sock. Don't. Touch flashlight. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Sock gamer. Is he gonna? No, he's gonna buff lionfish for another turn. He's greedy. Uh, you gotta. Oh, uh, you you gotta commit for it. That's Freeze bad. the melon at least, Cody, or buy it. Bagels, bagels isn't isn't Pretty stacking good, yeah. um, polar bear anymore. That's fair. I guess. I so don't Cody, know. I think Cody thinks that he can get down to one life and then. I guess beat him then. I feel like I would have just mongoosed there. I don't oh, think not. Uh oh. Yeah. Get out position. Got greedy. All right. Well, I think I think Cody just throws the next round and cooks the lionfish even more. That's so scary. I really don't like that. Yeah. I don't like that either. Because <laughs> bagels, bagels position is godlike. I would not want to make it come down to that. Cody's yeah, gonna cook it. Wait. Oh no. Uh, I was thinking separated walrus, but uh, double okay, now, double scorpion with lionfish. Yeah, double scorpion lionfish and when you so, this way. You have so, so many so of that plan. Okay, Cody goes yeah, for okay. it. Goes for the level oh. two potentially. I think I he's just buff scorpion. Yeah, I think he frees a scorpion. Oh, get it out of Voice this no, this 24 voice attack voice. break points ridiculous. Yeah, wait a second. Is I would, there? A, I don't know if I would do this. I don't know if there's a way to give it 25 attack. No. If he just there it is. Alive. No, he did. Yeah. He if he did, stacked uh, one, yeah, he stacked one. Oh, oh eggplant. Anyways. Oh. Interesting. 
All right, they're both yeah. on lethal. I wonder how the, that one attack got given. Maybe like a... No, he stacked them. Oh, he stacked them. Okay. I think oh, yeah, Cody not getting Spino on the turn is is the downfall right here. Because I think if he leveled up into Spino instead of Walrus, I think mm -hmm. he would have won. Mm. Well, a lemon on this lionfish keeps it alive for one hit. The eggplant is going to be scary too. Problem sword in case Scorp. Yeah. I think the lemon's good there. I think you do something lemon, so he's only one shot. I'm just so surprised he's rolled away all the melons. That's yeah. what I was thinking, too. Maybe Cody oh, is... Maybe, Ever, least. maybe Cody's hoping that uh, Bagels doesn't find another mongoose, but probably just has one frozen. Yeah. I think I you know, got you got to play around the coconut. Or you just put that gharial in the front. Uh, or you get... I mean, you get the second scorpion. As well. You wait. You just you can front walrus if you have two scorpions because oh, yeah. walrus won't hit. Oh wait, but now you have your eggplant on your wall. Yeah, he eggplanted it. I don't oh, know if yeah, he's gonna flood his bug. gold again. No, he's. You gotta swap for the scorpion, don't you? He or you do peppers, that? Or, that may be worth. Because you can't really position the other scorpion very well. That's true. Does get a coconut. Yeah, replaces the melon. Yeah, he moved the eggplant back one. Breaking the coconuts hey, huge. Wait, this is good for Cotty here. Yeah. Oh, oh my god, he did it. Oh. He did it. <laughs> he did it. Cotty. Oh, we're going to game five. Can I, can I, can, can I oh, add that's my streamer? God. That's my streamer. Yo. Not to not to not to discredit Cotty, but what happened on Bagel's board? Why does his board get worse? I think I think Bagel's probably found the mongoose with like not enough gold and thought the coconut was worth going down to four. I have yeah, no clue though. I feel like that's the only, I think that's the only reason you go down to four is to get that coconut. Cotty clutch. That was. Oh, Cotty's probably sweating over there. Hey, you know, you know <laughs> who's really rag. sweating? The guy that said he's donating a thousand subs. <laughs> True. <Yeah. laughs> That was, that was a pretty toxic game. And you know what else is toxic? Scorpions. <laughs> and a fun fact, scorpions in the wild can live up to five years. And the most common in the deserts and grassy, dry grassy highlands, I think it's called. Um, and I'm currently looking at pictures of scorpions to tell you all these fun facts. And I'm gently crying on the inside. So I hope you all appreciate my sacrifice. <laughs> oh, this pack is looking quite scary it, a good scary, like scary? Goody is curating it to have jerboa no there there is a combo that i think is gonna win someone this game but i will show hopeful it bison <laughs> yes it's the hopeful bison <laughs> it's just just a dromedary that's it all right Cody, it's the same code <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. It all comes down to this. Mm -hmm. My goat. Can my goat. Oh, let me start this prediction. I think this is actually really good for Cotty and really bad for Bagels. Why so? You, you don't want to get reverse swept. That so is true. I feel like the nerves are actually kind of kind of uh, in favor for Cotty here. Mm. I agree. I mean, Cotty has nothing to lose at this point. Okay, so the Where combo I is? saw when I first generated this was the Sabertooth... Tiger and bell pepper. <laughs> oh, there's no oh, pug at least. Crazy. There is no pug. Oh no, eat your tiger, saber tooth anyway. Yeah, stego. Yeah, there is there is tiger stego chicken potentially. Camel and baby. here you go. That's we have I the see. pelican with the strawberry. Yes. Everything oh, is a okay. <laughs> and we have and, and there's leech camel. <laughs> yeah, whoever high rolls. Oh <laughs> no. Leech saber tooth. It's like Leech. a better swan. Oh, you're so right. <laughs> what a it's like a, final it's like pack. A better, um, owl. Oh yeah, it is. It's better out. You could get Wait, mouse out of owl? it. No, you get mouse. You could hit level two mouse. Yeah, level two mouse. <laughs> oh, this is really good for bagels. This does look like a high roll pack though. Oh, so this it, is, it comes so is good. good. At hitting. 
Hey, I mean, that's that's the skill in this game, you know? <laughs> Cody is very good at hitting. I wish I was as good as him. And yes, this is the finale. Oh, crazy. I can't believe we made it. <laughs> Cody's going triple pill bug. I mean, it's, yeah, it's all going to be on these level ups here. Mm-hmm. Bagels is... Oh, the duck level up is going to be great as well. Yeah, double level for Camel Leech. <laughs> <laughs> yep. With duck, too. Oh, with more like, ducks. Oh. Double worm? Oh, you worm don't care worm? about the worm? Does it? Broccoli. Feels strong, man. Manda. There is... Oh. oh. This is good. It was close. Wait. This is Leech Peacock. Any fell. Oh. oh. For that. Yeah. Can't afford Maybe. it, though. Can't afford both. You gotta pick and choose. Yeah. Do you go leech peacock? Uh, Hatching chicks look so go. tempting, but I, I could see it. Round bird being saved. Yeah, it looks like he's gonna go leech the... peacock. Is there, is there a lollipop too? There is. No. no. Not. Yeah. So he's gonna have to hit it with a lot of broccoli. I kind of didn't hate that double worm on that first roll. I think level two worm could do something. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Average. Cody finds player. leech as well. The problem with worm is that uh, if you don't get the level two, it just turns. Yeah, then it's just useless. Yeah. It's a race to camel. It is a race. That's, that's <laughs> what I like to hear. But Cody has more chances at level ups. Has the two pigs. Has a kiwi to scale the leech a little bit. And then Elf even if too. he doesn't hit the level up, he has the pigs for more gold. Oh, they're both they're going peacock. Yeah. Not caring about the other what? kiwi or peacock. He Not wants a leech. I mean, yeah. yeah, he wants camel. This pill bug is strong think... for Cody as well. Because you just that leech camel idea. until you pivot into finding what you want and then get rid of camel. Mm hmm. Positioning oh. could have been better, but Trumpets do it. That's the guinea fowl power. I think Cotty really wants to level up here to get ahead, just because that's all bagels could buy last turn. The double worm. Ooh, hatching. <laughs> hatching just strong. Gotta yeah, go that. Gotta take, gotta take a head coach here. Don't care about the peacock. Just for looking this, just this was me. This just was me. Digging for the pig. <laughs> I mean, you, you'd buy it. You can still afford if you sell the level 2 pig. I yeah. guess digging for the camel as well. Eel. There is pineapple for the leech. Oh. Yes. Doing a little extra damage. But well, fainting something. Yeah. No blobfish. I don't think there's any good faints. No. Maybe fire and ant. Either. And there you <laughs> go. You got me. Someone just called it a Walmart candle, <laughs> a camel. <laughs> Going big pig. I, I don't know. I think I would have sold pig, froze, eel, rolled one, and hoped Just try to and get that camel? Yeah, <laughs> that's me, and that's why I lose. Let's see. Well, let's see if uh, Bagel hits the camel. <laughs> Still no camel three. being hit. <laughs> Very good breakpoints for bagels there. Yeah. I don't know about the eel being frozen. You can buff it with hatching chick. It's pretty good tempo. Yeah, that's true. Even hit a uh, broccoli on it. That's like a lot of health. Mm -hmm. Or do you just commit to finding that camel? I mean, another hatching do. chick. You oh. want it bad. I don't like Nobody the found it. I just like buying the, the hatch and chick if we're going to buy it. Yeah, like freezing it to lose your slots. Yeah, I was about to say, I feel like Leech Peacock should be up front. Though Cotty's getting out traded really hard here. 14. If they combine, it goes to 12. There's, there is uh, broccoli. Oh, yeah, broccoli. He's yeah. going to get broccoli here. No pears yet. There's not, not much you can do if you broccoli. Isn't. 
Yeah. There is bell pepper for this peacock, of, which would be good. Maybe you go front. Um, go bug. Go bug. Yeah, to play around that. Ooh. Ooh. Good for Cotty. No. Yeah, good for Cotty. Look how big that eel is. Eight. That 16. eel is really strong. He's thick. With one broccoli hatching chick. That's beautiful. And that's right. going to tier three. Gee. Cotty just needs to hit. Do, Cotty hits the hatching chick. The live, there's, there's no way. <laughs> no, the, no, the eel, the eels, it should not be that strong. It should not go down to yeah, three. It's so good. Fire ant. I don't know if these Speaking tier fives are. Great test server changes. I love just the small change. Make it a little bit more consistent. To what? Mm -hmm. For what? To fox. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's good. I, I do. I wish there was more little small changes in the test server. Yeah, I agree. Oh, like Cotty's going for the fox. Going for fox. What do you hope for with fox? Avocado? Mm -hmm. Yeah, just yeah, wait yeah, a second. Great. Freeze both of them. Yeah. Buy the eel. Yeah. Freeze. Yeah, that's juicy. Oh, we getting some fresh avocado. Wow. I don't think you wow, ever push actually... for three hatching. That's crazy. No. Ah, uh, yeah. Wait. I don't know. D uh, don't freeze you unfreeze one? I think you unfreeze both if you're unfreezing them. He yeah, because now. Both of them. He forgot it's not test server. He thought it was going to eat the right one. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> This peacock will be great once it gets this bell pepper. Is there a scorpion or peanuts in? I did not see scorpion. After. There could be walrus. Or like skunk, because th this eel could go crazy unless those things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's see. There is no walrus, no scorp. No mongoose. No skunk. Is disgusting, no skunk. Man. Yeah. And cheating your way up. The, <laughs> the peacock is calling Cotty's name. We've seen so many of them. Why the lobs are here. I mean, yeah, What's yeah. It's at it's it's it three, three health. Three It'll go up to six here. That would survive maybe a little bit if it got more stats. It lets you leech it for longer. Mm hmm. The camel. There's Turn the camel. Eight. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is Cotty looking Rose for? Casting. Just an eel? Oh, camel's yeah, way I... too late. Sure, anything. Okay. Yeah. There's no. There is chocolate right? next turn. You think he front loads eel here? Oh, pie? Oh, no, no. I guess if there's chocolate, you don't want pie. I still think. We would have loved to see pie eel. Like, mm -hmm. mm. that's another hatching chick. That is, I see it. that is another hatch. I love to explain things that way. Ooh, nice <laughs> pie grab from the fox. There we go. Excellent. Good hit. Cotty's so about to knows. kill this peacock. <laughs> so, uh, related to that, Sag, what me and Kai used to refer to all damage and uh, amount of dolphin snipes. Beautiful. Mm, oh, no. That is not good. All right, I think bell pepper on the peacock is necessary. Level up on the eel. For some reason, I thought leech was eel. <laughs> Level up eel, good. Huge. Saber tooth. Okay. The funny Bad. guy. I think you... Okay, please sell the fox, though. Yeah, I think you get rid of the fox for this thing. You just fox, buy, sell zebra, then buy saber tooth. And have peacock go down to one. Uh-huh. And then you eventually like the get... Going to one. <laughs> Are there any mosquitoes? <laughs> <laughs> Double hit on the hatching chick, not the best. Oh, guys, it's so time. Sell peacock so you can leech saber. There we go. Can you afford to freeze chocolate here? I think you have to. Level two saber. Maybe. Oh, there's pepper. I think there's you're pepper. I think you're wanting pepper on peacock as well as pepper on saber tooth. He is yep. lethal. Yeah. Yep. Um, oh, he's wait. doing it. Saber. <laughs> Watch it. He's fly. doing it. <laughs> so, what I think the coolest part is you could tell that was a ladybug that was lost. Mm -hmm. I like that. Mm -hmm. If only yeah, we saw a sloth fly. Oh my god, that would be so sad. <laughs> okay, this is. Ooh, this is good. This eel does this really well with this. Oh. The break point? Yeah, oh, and then you're gonna. Matter. Uh, saber yeah, yeah, yeah. What was I talking about? Nice. Saber tooth. This level two eel is going to be this. great for Cotty. 
Cody really true. needs his bell pepper, though. I need to another, nail out here. Another chocolate. Would be yeah, another chocolate or bell pepper. Well, pepper is a little awkward because of micro, but that's still good. I'm I was just saying for the peacock. Yeah, just so you could front it. You know? Yeah. Yeah, microbe is good. Holding the yeah, monkey. I like monkey. Get the pie. Pie. <laughs> One of these days. Uh, pie, get the pie. Food. I was thinking pie eel. Because like mm. he lost by he lost by one health for the or not lost. But there it is. He died by one health. Yeah. Oh, uh, pie eel is good too. I just like sabers getting a little bit more stats, so maybe it gets a you know extra trigger or two. Are you ever gonna try and broccoli this peacock? <laughs> I don't know if it does with weakness. I don't know if it gets another trigger. Because like if bagels just if edge. bagels just puts this anteater up front and just trades with this peacock. Yeah, I think you front the leech this time. Front leech, peacock second. I gotta yeah. see what this peacock is probably just gonna die to something happen. very weak. Yeah. Oh, oh it's a wait. It survives from the one damage. That's <laughs> <laughs> uh, a big okay. brain. That's why you that's why you don't leech it down to one HP. Uh-huh. <laughs> that okay. Thank oh, you. It's, gonna, it's gonna go down to one versus one, wait, is isn't it? Pita? Is there PETA? There, there is Peta. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh my god. Yeah, oh! Level up the Stego? <laughs> the chocolate. No. no. Oh. He's going far this, crazy. This, this turn is so, so sexy. Much. And then Snake. Snake is so good. Snake, is snake instead of this hatching chick? Yeah. Oh. Oh, I think he... Buy. Oh no, he decided to go. You gotta snake that eel, because the eel's getting 50 no matter what. So are you yeah, hatching chick something you know. else? I think what he's doing is he's gonna sell the leech next turn. He's gonna he might be dead next turn. Oh, I think snake's gotta go on this eel. Yeah. I mean this is this team did get a lot better. It I mean, yeah. yeah, this level two saber. The the pedo I think is massive because now he can't get uh what's it called? Uh scammed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree, yeah. This was a really good turn. Let's see. Yep, he doesn't get scammed thanks Ooh. to this. That's huge. Eh, eh, eh. That is... Oh. And then What's in I think it's still just the. Okay, now it's a panther. <gasps> oh, it's oh, one to one. Oh, my God, Cody. <laughs> my God, Cody. Cody. Oh no. Punching the butt cheeks, holding on to their pants. This is crazy. Double, double saber tooth. Go Wait, double saber tooth. For, for another saber? Yeah, get leech, get leech. Yeah, yeah, oh, leech I think you double saber. saber. Mm, you okay. Her double saber. Mm -hmm. You get the pie, right? Sure. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking pepper. Another pie. Oh, Show me another, another pie. pie. Another one. I saber. <laughs> I favor. Yeah. I feel, yeah. Like, I feel like Bagels gets rid of God, my here. You got it. Tells me Saber's mm -hmm. just so much better than the snake. I just want the pie for the memes. Why doesn't he? Why does he uh, pie everything except for his best pie target? <laughs> yeah, that's what I was wondering. <laughs> that's the pepper target. Wouldn't it be best on Saber, right? Yeah. Watch Bagels hit like three fried shrimp to get microbe. To 15 just attack. enough to kill. <laughs> I don't know. I think Snake just goes crazy here if he keeps microbe. I don't think he keeps microbe here, but yeah. Do you? My heart hasn't been racing this fast since I took like my final thesis. My <laughs> I'm about to go crazy. Come on, Cotty. Come on. Cotty's writing my a streamer. thesis of his own right now. No, God, he's writing a sap thesis. <laughs> he switches it up. Oh, oh this, nice. this did get rid of microbe. The uh -oh. snake might be good. Snake versus Snakey snake. Talk. Saber's dead. Oh, got rid of Saber? Oh. The snake, no, snake the, is fat. The snake's too good. It's over. Oh, it's, it's oh, over. over. It's Jover. It's Jover. Wait, what's in it? Oh, oh Connie oh, gets it done. Connie won. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my streamer. That's my Oh, my God. Connie, get in the waiting room. Oh, my God. Connie, get in here. Get your thick thighs in here. <laughs> thick thighs. Wait, I can't curse. Thick booty. There we go. Melon buster. <laughs> Oh, GG's. 1,000 subs. 1,000 subs. All right, subs here's Cotty. 1,000 subs. GG's, Cotty. Go! 
Oh my gosh! <laughs> Cody, how do you feel? Man, Cody. Oh, man. Proving the content creators proud. <laughs>